Welcome to the Fantasy Audiobook, Transcendent Insight, From Green Snake to Eternal Dragon. Chapter 61 The mountain is thousands of feet high, and the top of the mountain is filled with white mist. A huge white jade tower stands there, exuding extremely rich spiritual energy fluctuations. The rich aroma filled the air, causing the entire mountain peak to be wafted with this strange smell. Old man, where is this? Zhang Lin fell to the ground, stood in front of the jade tower, and asked old man Long Wu in confusion. It smells so good. This mountain is called Longdan Mountain, and the jade pagoda is called Danyu Pagoda. Old man Long Wu smelled the fragrance of red pepper in the air and took a deep breath. Longdan Mountain, Dan Jade Tower, then why did you bring me here? I didn't understand what kind of medicine old man Long Wu was selling in this gourd. Come with me. Rolling his eyes at Zhang Lin, old man Long Wu took the lead and walked towards the Dan Jade Pagoda. On the way, he also explained to Zhang Lin why he was brought here. The soul enhancing pill, heavenly blood pill, and other pills you take all come from here. There's no point in bringing you here. I just want you to help me. After all, you can't take the elixir in vain. And, I'm telling you. When old man Long Wu said this, he paused, looked around, then lowered his voice and continued, the pills here are all refined by the second elder, and he asked you to help by name. If you help me, the benefits will definitely come to you. Zhang Lin was a little surprised when he heard what old man Long Wu said. He was also impressed by the second elder of the dragon clan. However, it seems that, apart from being familiar with old man Long Wu, he is not very familiar with several other elders of the dragon clan. Why are these second elders looking for me? Entering the Dan Jade Tower, the rich fragrance of Dan Jade became even stronger. Zhang Lin couldn't help but take a deep breath. There didn't seem to be many disciples in the Danyu Pagoda. Zhang Lin saw only 30 or 40 people along the way. If there are only so many disciples in the huge Longdan Mountain, they are indeed a little too few. Are you curious as to why there are only so few disciples here? Actually, there are many disciples, but they are all in Tianyan Mountain next door, where there are more disciples. As if aware of Zhang Lin's doubts, old man Long Wu explained. Tianyan Mountain is on the other side of Longdan Mountain, where most of the alchemy disciples are. The disciples on Longdan Mountain are all elites among alchemy disciples. Danyu Pagoda has 18 floors. The further up he went, the fewer disciples Zhang Lin saw. Old man Long Wu took him all the way to the 15th floor before stopping. The two came to a wooden door. This is it. Old man Long Wu waved to Zhang Lin, asking him to come closer. Here, Zhang Lin looked towards the wooden door in confusion. Simple, simple. On the door panel, there is only the word, Yaolu, written on it. Now that you're here, come in. What are you doing at the door now? An old voice came from inside the door. Let them both in. Second brother, man, I brought it to you. When old man Long Wu heard what was said in the house, he no longer hesitated, opened the door directly, and said to the house with a smile. Zhang Lin also stepped in, his eyes involuntarily looking at everything in the room. I saw a stone table and several stools placed in the room. At the main seat, an old man with a rosy complexion who looked younger than old man Long Wu was sitting there. The old man's clothes were embroidered with gold threads, forming a real dragon pattern, and his eyes were as sharp as an eagle. The old man raised his head. Seeing the old man's sharp gaze, Zhang Lin couldn't help but trembled in his heart, and quickly raised his hands in salute. Junior Zhang Lin pays homage to the second elder. Um, sit down. Seeing Zhang Lin salute, the old man nodded and motioned Zhang Lin to sit down. Then he looked at old man Long Wu and said, I brought you here, you can leave. Second brother, you have to let me take a few sips of tea before leaving, right? You are trying to kill the donkey. Old man Long Wu looked helpless, then walked to the table, sat down, unceremoniously picked up the teapot on the table, and started drinking. Seeing Long Wu's vulgar movements, the second elder suddenly frowned. Lao Wu, can't you pay more attention to your image? I'm leaving, but I'm staying here. After the water in the teapot was completely drunk, Long Wu put the teacup down again, stood up, patted his butt, and walked towards the door. Boy Zhang, it's not bad to stay here. There are countless pills for you to eat up. Before leaving, old man Long Wu winked at Zhang Lin, showed a wicked smile, and then left. After old man Long Wu left, 
Zhang Lin and the two elders were the only ones left in the room. Zhang Lin sat there and looked at the second elder. The second elder also looked at Zhang Lin, who was sitting opposite. No one spoke, and after looking at each other for a moment, the second elder slowly spoke. I called you here because there is something I need you to do. It's just that you are not suitable for it now. Hearing the words of the second elder, Zhang Lin was slightly startled, and then hesitantly said, Second elder, I wonder what I need this junior to do. Go to the seventh floor. There are some elixir books there with detailed explanations. Come back when you finish reading them all. Yes, go. After receiving the order, Zhang Lin didn't hesitate at all. He stood up and headed towards the seventh floor. Although I don't know why the second elder chose to let him understand the alchemy. However, since the second elder said so, she must have a point. There is no need to dig into the details yourself. As for what exactly he was asked to do, the second elder did not say. There was no need for him to ask. When it's time to say it, it will come naturally. Seventh floor. There was a boy guarding here early on. When he saw Zhang Lin, he immediately bowed and saluted. I've met senior brother. The master asked you to start reading from here. There are 36,500 volumes in total. As he spoke, the boy pointed to the densely arranged books on the wall. He guided Zhang Lin to the starting point, and after finishing speaking, he turned around and left. Thank you. After thanking the boy, Zhang Lin quickly walked towards the books. Looking at those books, Zhang Lin also felt a headache. There are 36,500 elixir books with detailed explanations. I don't know when I will see them. The seventh floor, the eighth floor, and the ninth floor are all books. The second elder won't let me watch the seventh floor, and then the eighth or ninth floor, right? When he went downstairs, he saw all kinds of books on the seventh, eighth and ninth floors. I'm afraid, they are all different elixir books, right? Detailed explanation of elixir refining. Pulling out the first alchemy book and looking at the title, Zhang Lin also started to read it. Ding, you read, detailed explanation of elixir refining, and gained some understanding. You understand the refining method of elixir. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the, secret book of elixir. Alchemy. The method is very important, as each step determines the refining efficiency and quality of the elixir. The, secret book of pills, records all the details needed to refine the pills. And many special refining methods and techniques. Close your eyes slightly, countless techniques and skills, mysterious and difficult to distinguish, keep flashing in your mind. It turns out that alchemy is so complicated and mysterious. The art of alchemy is so vast and profound that it is unimaginable. Feeling the profoundness of alchemy, Zhang Lin couldn't help but sigh. He also paid attention to the elixir book in his hand. Sit down and get ready for some good reading. When Zhang Lin looked at the 36,500 volumes, it was as if he were looking at a treasure. The value of them could not be expressed in words. As time passed, Zhang Lin read one alchemy book after another here, and gradually became fascinated. Moreover, with the existence of a heaven-defying system of understanding, Zhang Lin can get a lot of inspiration and feelings from every alchemy book he reads. On the entire seventh floor, apart from the sound of Zhang Lin turning the pages of books, there was only the rustling sound caused by Zhang Lin turning the pages. And I don't know if it was because of the second elder that no one came here to disturb Zhang Lin. Ding, you read the, Book of Heavenly Pills, congratulations to the host for understanding. Ding, you read, The Book of Evil Pills, congratulations to the host for understanding. Ding, you read, Book of Heavenly Evil Pills, congratulations to the host for understanding. As Zhang Lin read more and more, the content contained in the alchemy book became more and more extensive. It even includes the right time, right place and right people. Zhang Lin was surprised by the breadth and depth of the Alchemy Sutra. The things contained in it are so rich. Moreover, Zhang Lin felt that he had benefited a lot from the knowledge contained in this elixir book. When you reach the realm of Zhang Lin, you no longer need to eat grains. The seventh floor of the Danyu Pagoda is like a small world that belongs to him. No one would disturb him, just for him to read the Alchemy book. Comma, neither arrogant nor impetuous, calm and calm, with a tough mind. Good. On the fifteenth floor, the second elder, who had been observing Zhang Lin for several days, sat at the table and nodded gently. 
Ever since Zhang Lin was sent to the seventh floor to read the alchemy book, he had been observing Zhang Lin silently in secret. I thought it would take Zhang Lin a few days to calm down and become absorbed in reading the alchemy book. But to his surprise, Zhang Lin was already fascinated on the first day. How about his help and my old son? At this moment, sitting next to the second elder was Dragon King Long Yao. With the great elder, Long Yao also observed Zhang Lin's state at this time and asked. The second elder fell silent after hearing Long Yao's words. Naturally, the second elder also knew what he was talking about. It's possible, but there's no guarantee. The second elder was silent for a long time, and finally gave this answer. No one dares to guarantee that, and no one dares to make a guarantee. Long Yao and the great elder also knew the secret. Well, there are still two years, don't worry. Long Yao also knew that it would be very difficult to accomplish that matter, so he stopped asking further. Seven levels, eight levels, nine levels, three levels, two years should be enough for him. From now on, I will give him a blood reverse pill every month, and he will not fall behind too much in terms of cultivation. The taciturn elder suddenly spoke at this time. His eyes were fixed on Zhang Lin, who was still reading the alchemy book on the seventh floor, with a calm expression. Yeah, after the second elder was silent for a moment, he also said something. Long Yao didn't speak, just nodded. A peaceful life lasted for two months. Zhang Lin's cultivation level also broke through to the fourth level of Tianxuan. This was all thanks to the two pills called Nishui Dan. After swallowing the blood reverse pill, Zhang Lin's cultivation also improved by leaps and bounds. The blood reverse pill reverses the bloodline, which contains the rich power of dragon bloodline. Returning to his ancestral bloodline also greatly improved Zhang Lin's cultivation. In two months, it seems that Zhang Lin has not left the seventh floor. The alchemy book inside was like a jade beauty, attracting him and making it difficult for him to let go. There are 36,500 volumes of alchemy books. In the past two months, Zhang Lin has only read 6,000 volumes. With 3,000 volumes in one month, one can read the entire seven-level alchemy book in one year. Zhang Lin closed the alchemy book titled, The Art of Refining Alchemy and Controlling Fire, and with a thought, the book flew back to its original place. Another book next to it also flew out and landed on the desk in front of Zhang Lin. Dang, thunk, there was a sound of hurried footsteps on the stairs. Um, Zhang Lin frowned slightly and looked toward the door. This was the first time in the past two months that he heard such a noisy sound. In the past, both the boys and the disciples went up and down the stairs in silence. Today is quite strange. At this time, a petite figure suddenly appeared at the entrance of the stairs. When Zhang Lin saw this figure, he recognized it instantly and even got a headache. How did you come? Zhang Lin looked at the visitor helplessly. This girl is none other than Long Yu, the girl he least wants to see right now. Especially what she said, Brother Zhang, you don't want others to know about this, right? Zhang Lin now has a headache when he sees Long Yu. Hey, Brother Zhang, long time no see. Long Yu lay at the door, tilted his head and said with a smile to Zhang Lin. Her face was filled with a bright smile, her eyes were curved into crescent shapes, and she was smiling very cutely. But Zhang Lin always had a creepy feeling. It's an ominous premonition. Xiao Yu -er. At this time, a slightly familiar voice suddenly sounded on the seventh floor. Hearing this voice, Zhang Lin's eyes lit up. It is the light of hope. Sure enough, the next second, the figure of the second elder appeared at the entrance to the seventh floor, looking at Long Yu with a kind smile. Second Grandpa, looking back at Long Yu, after seeing the second elder, his smiling face suddenly collapsed. Looking aggrieved, the body also stood up straight, head lowered, not daring to look up at the second elder again. Zhang Lin looked at this scene as if he had discovered a new world. His eyes kept looking at the two of them. You know, as far as he knows, several elders like Long Yu very much. He dotes on her very much. Xiao Long Yu also has a good relationship with every elder and is not afraid of them. But now, he seemed to have discovered that someone was finally able to cure Long Yu's people. That is the second elder. Xiao Long Yu, please don't disturb Mr. Zhang here. Come up with second grandpa, you haven't been here for a long time. Second grandpa misses you. Ignoring Long Yu's slumped little face, 
the second elder grabbed her little hand and took her upstairs with a smile. Brother Zhang, Long Yu was held by the second elder's hand. She was holding on to the doorframe with one hand and looking at Zhang Lin pitifully. She really wanted to stay here with Zhang Lin and not go anywhere. I don't even want to go up there with Grandpa Er. Zhang Lin, on the other hand, did not listen to what was going on outside the window and only read the books of sages. He concentrated on flipping through the alchemy book in his hand and ignored Long Yu's request for help. Alas, in the end, Long Yu was pulled away by the second elder with a look of reluctance. Looking at their leaving figures, Zhang Lin shook his head. Finally, this little ancestor was sent away. Long Yu is here, he feels uneasy. Boy Zhang, I'm curious, did Xiao Yu or do something? Didn't you like playing with Xiao Yu or before? Why don't you want to do it now? Suddenly, an old voice came from beside Zhang Lin. Zhang Lin turned his head and saw the old face of old man Long Wu. Ahem, old man Long, am I busy? Where can I take care of Xiao Yu or? Zhang Lin's heart tightened, and then he smiled awkwardly. You can't let old man Long know about that matter, otherwise. Oh, I understand. Old man Long Wu nodded with sudden realization. Zhang Lin, what do you know, old man? By the way, you brought Xiao Yu er, right? No need to guess, Zhang Lin also knew that Long Yu was definitely brought by old man Long Wu. Otherwise, old man Long Wu would not have appeared here. Tell me, old man, what are you doing here? Turning around, Zhang Lin looked at the alchemy book in his hand again and said lightly. He didn't believe that old man Long Wu would come over with nothing to do and chat with him specifically. Sure enough, after hearing this, old man Long Wu also suppressed the playfulness on his face, and his expression became much more serious. He stared at Zhang Lin and spoke word by word. I heard that you have taken Nishui Dan in the past two months. Um, Zhang Lin nodded. There was no need for him to hide it, after all, this thing was given to him by the second elder. My second brother borrowed you from me earlier. What did I think it was about? But now it seems, I'm afraid, that matter is not trivial. Old man Long Wu also sighed softly after receiving Zhang Lin's response. He also knew something about that matter, but he didn't expect that Zhang Lin would be involved in it. What's wrong? Zhang Lin asked with a frown. This matter, old man Long Wu pondered for a moment, and then slowly spoke. This matter involves too wide a scope, and it is not convenient for me to talk about it. You will know after a while. It's an opportunity, but it's also a risk. Yi Yan. But if you succeed, I believe that your strength will be greatly improved, and your future achievements will definitely be improved a lot. Zhang Lin. Okay, okay, you're halfway through talking, are you trying to whet my appetite? In this case, old man, you should leave. You're disturbing me from reading the alchemy book. Zhang Lin snorted dissatisfiedly and continued to flip through the ancient book in his hand. Old man Long Wu was also rudely ordered to be kicked out. You think I want to come? Aren't you here to give you something? Old man Long Wu glared at Zhang Lin, secretly thinking that he was a heartless little guy. He worked so hard and owed favors everywhere, for whom? Not for him. Um, send something. What thing? Hearing this, Zhang Lin put down the alchemy book in his hand and turned to look at old man Long Wu in confusion again. Get ready. Remember it clearly. Old man Long Wu suddenly stretched out his finger and pointed at Zhang Lin's forehead. Snapped. As soon as his finger fell, Zhang Lin felt as if his head had been hit hard. My whole head was buzzing. A mysterious feeling surged throughout the body, even the blood was boiling. An inexplicable power appeared in his body, guiding him. His breathing already had a special rhythm, sometimes heavy, sometimes long, sometimes short, sometimes rapid, sometimes slow. This feeling was very mysterious, and Zhang Lin gradually got used to it. Good, the epiphany came quickly, and all my hard work was not in vain. Loosening his fingers, old man Long Wu took a step back and looked at Zhang Lin, who was already in trance, with a happy smile on his face. It took him two months of work and many conditions to get this thing. But seeing Zhang Lin's appearance, it seemed that everything he had paid was worth it. With a wave of his hand, the entire seventh floor was protected to prevent people outside from being alerted. After doing all this, old man Long Wu nodded, and after confirming that there was no problem, he disappeared to the seventh floor. Ding, you have learned the true dragon breathing technique, 
and realized a trace of the power of a true dragon. Congratulations to the host for understanding the eternal breathing technique. A reminder came in Zhang Lin's mind. But at this moment, Zhang Lin had no time to deal with the system. Instead, he concentrated on comprehending that wonderful mystery. His breathing suddenly became rapid, and the spiritual energy around him was frantically drilling into his body. A strong force filled his body, making him feel as if he was in the clouds. His body seemed to be undergoing earth-shaking changes. Suddenly, he took a deep breath, and the spiritual energy around him suddenly entered his body. Boom boom boom. Zhang Lin's body seemed to be burning like a volcano. The spiritual energy that entered his body was like lava from a volcano, wandering around his limbs and bones. From time to time, there was a roar of explosions, which made Zhang Lin tremble all over. Exhale. A breath of foul breath came out of his mouth. Like the black smoke and turbid gas emitted by a volcano. These turbid air were the impurities in Zhang Lin's body. At this moment, all the impurities hidden in his body were squeezed out, and a pure and incomparable power flowed in Zhang Lin's body. Eternal Breathing Method, True Dragon Breathing Method After a long time, Zhang Lin slowly opened his eyes. At this time, the Eternal Breathing Method has been completely integrated into his breathing. Every breath he takes is the rhythm of the Eternal Breathing Method. The feeling that the Eternal Breathing Technique brought to him was wonderful and he enjoyed it very much. But there was a question that appeared in Zhang Lin's mind. That is, the true dragon breathing method. Where did old man Long Wu come from? If old man Long Wu had it a long time ago, he would probably have given it to him long ago, and there is no way he would have delayed it until now. I'm afraid that this real dragon breathing technique was something that old man Long Wu worked hard to achieve. Even at a considerable price. Only if he practices the true dragon breathing technique can he understand its value. Old man, I really want to thank you this time. Zhang Lin took a deep breath, with this eternal breathing method, if I can't compete for the position of dragon sun, I will never be able to see you in this life. Body like heaven and earth. The roar inside was like a thunder drum, and the sound was like thunder, shaking the whole world. Waves of spiritual energy spread out in all directions like a tide. The sound of tiger and leopard thunder echoed in his body, like rolling thunder, deafening. The strength is still not enough. I have been led by them all the time. Recalling what old man Long Wu said, Zhang Lin realized at this time that he had been involved in such a big thing without knowing it. In the final analysis, his strength is still too weak and too low. The fourth level of Tianxuan is still not enough. Why? Gotta speed it up. With a gentle sigh, Zhang Lin lowered his head again and flipped through the alchemy book in his hand. But this time, he was much faster. It's like reading ten lines in one glance, and flipping through the alchemy book in his hand in dozens of breaths. Volumes of alchemy books were constantly reflected in his mind. Time, Zhang Lin felt, was becoming increasingly urgent. This feeling gave him a sense of urgency, eager to improve his strength quickly. The eternal breathing technique and the candle sun heavenly fire sutra operate together. Even though he did not concentrate on practicing, the speed was astonishingly fast. Especially the eternal breathing method, the effect is even more amazing. Every time I take a breath, there is a steady stream of pure spiritual energy flowing towards all parts of my body. It feels like taking a big bottle of tonic, refreshing my heart. Moreover, it is still an overall improvement effect. The body, soul, and realm are fully developed. Did you speed up? Zhang Lin's strange movement also attracted the attention of the second elder who was playing with the reluctant Long Yu. He looked at Zhang Lin seven floors below with a slight frown on his face. At this speed, I'm afraid it will take less than half a year to read the entire seventh level elixir book. The second elder estimated the time in his mind. Taking advantage of the moment when the second elder was absent minded, Long Yu seized the opportunity and fled out in a flash. I was secretly happy that I finally escaped from the second grandfather's clutches. The second elder, who didn't know what he was thinking, didn't notice at all. Comma. First round. Long Ji Yu. Are you sure you want to break through? On the tall tower, there are traces of swords and traces of the vicissitudes of time all over the place, making it look extremely shabby. But the city wall still stands tall and towering, like a mountain, standing tall in the world. There were guards guarding the city wall, their sharp gazes, like lightning and arrows, shooting at the testers in front. 
They were wearing armor, had resolute faces, held weapons, and were tall and mighty, as if they were made of steel. The aura also vaguely contains at least the realm of Dixuan and Tianxuan in the early stages. In the middle, there was a middle-aged and burly man standing at the front. His body was as tall as a mountain, and he was wearing armor that made a hunting sound. He had his hands behind his back and his eyes were as sharp as lightning, staring ahead. He looked down at the young man wearing a yellow robe and standing tall at the foot of the city. Logically speaking, it will take another fifty years for the heavenly pass to be officially opened. If you insist on breaking through the pass, the master of this pass will not stop you. The middle-aged man said with a deep breath, his voice was loud and thunderous. Senior, I wonder how far the Phoenix Yu from the Tianwang clan and the Golden Margin from the Golden Winged Dapang clan have reached. The young man in yellow robe was none other than Long Ji Yu from the Dragon clan that day. He looked at the gatekeeper and asked. The Phoenix girl from the Tianwang tribe passed the 11th level half a month ago. The one from the Golden Winged Dapang clan, after reaching the 10th level a month ago, stopped continuing. The middle-aged master of Tianguan opened his mouth slowly and said. Hearing this, the faces of everyone in the first level froze. They had heard about the Golden Winged Dapang clan and the Tianwang clan, which were both forces left over from ancient times. In ancient times, they were also among the top forces. Moreover, this generation of Phoenix girls and the holy son of the Golden Winged Dapang clan have even more terrifying talents. As expected of a member of the Phoenix clan, his talent is indeed extraordinary. He actually reached the eleventh level in one breath. Someone sighed with envy in their tone. It is said that the Phoenix girl of the Tianwang clan has returned to her ancestors and is infinitely close to the bloodline of her ancestors' pure blood Tianwang. She is a true evil genius. Although the holy son of the Golden Winged Dapang clan is not as talented as the Phoenix girl, he is still a genius and can definitely be considered the top among his peers. The 10th and 11th level. Long Gu's eyes flashed with a sharp edge. The Phoenix girl from the Tianwang clan is his number one enemy. Senior Chen, turn it on and off. Junior also wants to see how many levels he can get through with his strength. Long Gu's eyes were firm. He also wanted to use the Tianguan to test his own strength. In two years, he will return to his clan, and he will take advantage of this time to improve himself. Since you have decided so, the master of this level will also grant you permission, switch. Comma, how many have you seen? Daniel Pagoda 7th floor. The second elder suddenly appeared, looked at Zhang Lin sitting there, and spoke calmly. A third of it. There should be about 20,000 alchemy books that have not been read yet. Zhang Lin's face became more solemn as he quickly flipped through the alchemy books. 20,000 volumes. The second elder nodded slightly. The second elder was not surprised by Zhang Lin's browsing speed. As for whether Zhang Lin was cheating, or whether he was just looking at it casually and swallowing it whole, he wasn't worried. After such a long period of observation, he didn't think Zhang Lin was cheating. I'll read them all within half a year. I have something for you then. The second elder thought about it secretly. Then he said something to Zhang Lin and disappeared again. You have something for me. Zhang Lin was slightly startled when he heard the second elder's words, and he was also a little confused in his heart. However, there is still half a year left. He didn't think much about it. There is news that Guer has begun to break into the sky. Within two years and Guer's strength, the first ten levels won't be a problem. On the Danyu Pagoda, Dragon King Long Yao and the Great Elder came to the Second Elder again. Long Yao spoke and told the Second Elder the latest news. Very good, my old son's talent is even stronger than yours back then. Just like Long Fu back then, his skills surpassed all the heroes. The Second Elder smiled happily and praised. As long as my old son can pass the 50th day pass, then I another unrivaled talent has appeared in the Dragon Clan. In the words, a name suddenly appeared. Dragon Voltage. Upon hearing this name, both Long Yao and the Great Elder fell silent at this moment. Who is Long Fu? This name is too familiar to them. In the history of the Dragon Clan, he is also a very charming figure. He is the pride of the Dragon Clan and the strongest genius of the Dragon Clan. Unfortunately, after he became a dragon, he suddenly disappeared. Long Fu is the dragon son who disappeared from the previous generation. Why? After a long silence, the second elder sighed. 
Long Fu is the pride of the Tianlong clan, and his disappearance is also a huge blow to the Tianlong clan. Nowadays, anyone who mentions the word, Long Fu, shakes his head and sighs with a sad look on his face. Second uncle, don't worry, Guer will definitely be able to lead our clan to the top in the future. Long Yao patted the second elder on the shoulder and said comfortingly. Long Yao admired his former competitor from the bottom of his heart. That man was powerful, unparalleled in wisdom, and an unparalleled genius. If he had not disappeared, if he had become the Dragon King, I am afraid that the current Tianlong clan would be even more prosperous. Kindness. Hearing this, the second elder nodded. As long as the ancestral dragon pill is successfully refined, there is hope for my son to become an emperor. We have been planning for this prosperous era for countless years, and there is no room for failure, so I am going to make it happen. Long Yao's eyes revealed a strong fighting spirit and were filled with strong ambition. My dear friend, when he comes back, let Lao Chi personally protect him. There are many powerful people in Tianguan and there are many crises. I can rest assured if I let Lao Chi protect the way. The great elder also attached great importance to this matter and warned him. Good, comma, senior brother, this is the elixir of the month. Seventh floor, another second elder's alchemy boy came over. He held a wooden tray in his hand, with a bottle of elixir placed on it. On the white porcelain bottle, there is a sculpture of a dragon flying in the clouds and mist, which is lifelike, as if it has come to life. Kindness. Zhang Lin took the porcelain bottle and nodded. He naturally knew what the elixir in the porcelain bottle was. It's the blood reverse pill that is given once a month. Ancestral dragon pill, taking it can return the bloodline to the ancestral state. By chance, Zhang Lin was attracted by the Zulong pill recorded in the elixir book in his hand, and couldn't help but read it carefully. Ha, huh, why is there no refining method? After reading the introduction, Zhang Lin turned another page, wanting to see the refining method. However, there is no record of the refining method. However, there was a clear tear mark on that page. It's like, there should have been a page here before, but it was torn out abruptly later. Weird, he shook his head. After reading the last page of the elixir book, Zhang Lin's eyes focused on the porcelain bottle containing the blood reverse elixir. Nine blood reverse pills, and the blood reverse pills are also involved in something. This really makes me a little curious. I wonder what exactly you are going to do and what secrets you are hiding. Zhang Lin thought to himself as he rubbed the white porcelain bottle in his hand. Ni Shui Dan is dark red all over. Dan's body was covered with circles of blood lines, as if blood was flowing, with a strange beauty. The blood reverse pill has the functions of stimulating blood vessels and improving cultivation. As for what it was made from, Zhang Lin didn't know, after reading so many volumes of alchemy books. The anti-blood pill is just like the ancestral dragon pill. Its function is only introduced, but its refining method is never mentioned. This also seems to be to prevent the prescriptions of these two elixirs from leaking out. Looking at the anti-blood pill in his hand, Zhang Lin hesitated for a moment and then put it into his mouth. The Nishui Dan melts in the mouth, and there is a warm feeling at the entrance, sliding down the throat. Gudong. The next moment, Zhang Lin felt as if his throat was burning, as if it was about to burn. A stream of rich essence rushed down the throat, towards the limbs and bones, and instantly surged through every acupuncture point, muscle, bone and tendon of the whole body. Under the infusion of essence, Zhang Lin suddenly felt that his body was full. The blood in his body is constantly boiling, like hot lava. Zhang Lin's body also began to become hot, and his body turned red, like a soldering iron. The eternal breathing method was operating to the extreme, and the blood inside Zhang Lin's body was flowing like boiling water, boiling continuously. The golden blood is being tempered, a little sacred, and a little domineering, like the blood of gods, exuding powerful power. Moreover, the golden blood contains endless life force, filling the whole body. Thumping, thumping, a strong and powerful beating sound resounded on Zhang Lin's chest. This sound was like a war drum, clanging loudly. The heart is beating, the sound is like thunder. Zhang Lin's blood was constantly boiling, and every drop of blood seemed to contain terrifying power, like a mighty force. The terrifying life essence contained in the Nishui Dan was constantly washing every inch of Zhang Lin's skin and pores. An indescribable feeling of comfort spread throughout the body.
The aura is rising, and the bloodline is gradually transforming. Not even close. Zhang Lin's aura continued to rise to the peak of the fourth level of Tianxuan, and then stopped. There is only one step left to break through to the fifth level of Tianxuan. After a long time, Zhang Lin opened his eyes and slowly exhaled. It's just a little short of a breakthrough. Feeling the surging breath in his body, Zhang Lin couldn't help but smile. This last step is missing, I believe it won't be long before he can break through. However, a problem has arisen now. That is, the effect of the blood reverse pill on him is getting worse and worse. In terms of realm, the effect has even declined somewhat. I have only taken three of the nine blood reverse pills now, and I can clearly feel that the effect is declining. I am afraid that the remaining six will allow him to break through to the peak of the sixth level of Tianxuan at most, or the early stage of the seventh level. Smell good. Where's the smell coming from? There was a fragrance in the air, and it soon drifted into Zhang Lin's nose. The aroma was so fragrant that he sniffed it several times. But soon, his brows wrinkled. The temperature seems to be rising. Especially for someone like him who plays with fire, his sensitivity to the fire element is far beyond that of ordinary people. Zhang Lin suddenly stood up and headed downwards. At this time, fifth floor, a huge alchemy furnace crashed to the ground, and inside the furnace, a black flame burned blazingly. The blazing high temperature caused the entire fifth floor space to become distorted and deformed. The surrounding disciples did not dare to step forward rashly. They all stood at a distance, looking at the black flame with fear. Just because this flame is so terrifying, it seems to burn the air clean. Moreover, as the flame burned, it continued to expand around. The air was filled with the fragrance of the elixir, but no one dared to step forward and take out the elixir. Why is the second elder coming back? If we don't come back, the entire fifth floor will suffer. Don't forget, today is the day when the second elder goes out to visit friends. Everyone was talking a lot, with looks of fear and worry on their faces. Someone has already informed the great elder. I believe the great elder will be here soon. Other than that, there's no other way. The black flames expanded to the surroundings in waves, making the surrounding air hot, as if even the space was distorted. The scorching black flames swallowed up everything around it, including the void. The space is distorted, ripples flashing continuously, as if it will collapse in the next moment. Without the suppression of the special formation within the alchemy cauldron, Black Flame was like a wild horse running wild and rampant. If it is not suppressed, the entire Danube Pagoda may be destroyed. No, we can't delay it any longer. We must find a way to suppress it. Otherwise, there will be endless troubles. Yes, we must not let it expand any longer. Amidst the anxious discussions among many disciples, Zhang Lin finally rushed over. This flame, Zhang Lin's eyes were immediately attracted by the scorching black flames. At the same time, I was a little shocked. This black flame was actually able to distort the space, and its power was extraordinary. Even compared to his candle sun flame, it is not inferior in any way. Senior Brother Zhang, this is the twelfth-ranked black flame of the world among the divine flames of heaven and earth. A boy who often went up to the seventh floor to deliver things to Zhang Lin saw Zhang Lin coming down from the seventh floor and looked puzzled. Expression, he hurriedly explained. Glowing black flame. Hearing the boy's words, Zhang Lin's pupils suddenly tightened. The divine flame of heaven and earth is a legendary existence. Legend has it that there are 33 kinds of divine flames in heaven and earth, and each kind of divine flame is the top existence in heaven and earth. Every kind of divine flame is the most precious treasure in the world. Rumor has it that the divine flame possesses supreme power. As long as one possesses a divine flame of heaven and earth, one can become the world's top powerhouse. And Zhang Lin didn't expect that he would encounter a kind of divine flame here, and it was the twelfth-ranked black flame of the world. No wonder, he felt that this black flame actually gave him a feeling that was not inferior to the flame of the candle sun. Why does this glorious black flame appear here? Zhang Lin was a little confused and didn't understand why the divine flame of heaven and earth appeared here. Even though it's here, shouldn't it be sealed properly? How could it still be released? This, senior brother Zhang. What you don't know is that this radiant black flame was originally sealed in the alchemy king cauldron by the second elder for daily use in alchemy refining. But I don't know why, the glory black flame just broke out in a riot, 
breaking through the seal set by the second elder in the Alchemy King Cauldron. The boy smiled bitterly, and shook his head helplessly. This glory black flame is no small matter, we there is simply no way to suppress it. We have already informed the great elder, and the great elder should be here soon. It will be fine then. That's it. Zhang Lin nodded and immediately stepped forward. The divine flames of heaven and earth are incredible. It was a rare sight, how could he not take a good look at it? Senior brother Zhang, you. When Zhang Lin came forward, the boy couldn't help shouting, wanting to remind Zhang Lin. Seeing Zhang Lin coming forward, several people around him also made way for Zhang Lin to pass. Zhang Lin, they also know. The second elder is a very important person. Moreover, his cultivation level is also very strong. Perhaps, he can really suppress this radiant black flame. Everyone looked at Zhang Lin expectantly, hoping to see Zhang Lin suppress the glorious black flame in one fell swoop. Zhang Lin stopped, turned to look at the crowd, and muttered, Everyone, you'd better exit first. It's really not safe here. I also need a quiet environment. Yes, senior brother Zhang. Everyone nodded. They knew that staying here would be of no use and would only disturb Zhang Lin. Zhang Lin didn't talk nonsense. With a wave of his sleeve, he swept away the group of discussing disciples on the fifth floor and landed outside the Danyu Pagoda. The brilliant black flame, the twelfth-ranked existence among the divine flames of heaven and earth. Looking at the dazzling black flames that were still spreading outward, Zhang Lin's eyes narrowed slightly. He could clearly feel the terror of this radiant black flame. It is worthy of being the twelfth among the divine flames of heaven and earth. The terrifying power contained in it is simply unimaginable. Even he, facing such flames, felt an inexplicable palpitation. Of course, he felt that his candle sun flame was not inferior at all compared to the glory black flame. What's bad is that his cultivation level is too low and he cannot exert the full power of the candle sun flame. If you get slightly closer, you can feel the burning heat. Close, Zhang Lin stretched out his hands, spiritual power flowing in his palms. Buzz, an invisible force of suction burst out, immediately covering the surrounding space, enveloping all the terrifying black flames of the world. Zhang Lin also frowned slightly. This radiant black flame was actually burning his spiritual power. If this is the case, there will be some trouble. We need to fight quickly. Give me, gather. The spiritual power exploded again, gathering the surrounding black flames toward the center. The radiant black flame was like a ferocious beast trapped in a cage, struggling crazily and burning Zhang Lin's spiritual power. Constantly resisting, but still unable to escape. Zhang Lin not only used spiritual power, but also used the flames of the candle sun to envelope it in a space. Zhang Lin's eyes were slightly focused, and his mind was completely focused on his spiritual power. Although this radiant black flame was extremely dangerous, Zhang Lin didn't feel the slightest bit afraid. Find wealth in danger, he still knows this truth. The black flame of the world confronts the flame of the candle sun. Entanglement, collision, explosion. Under Zhang Lin's control, the glorious black flames finally shrank towards the center. And this process is slow and careful. Zhang Lin clenched his hands tightly, and his spiritual energy was consumed like a tide. Under Zhang Lin's control, the radiant black flame was gradually squeezed, shrinking and changing. The brilliant black flame was getting smaller and smaller, and in the end, it became only the size of a fist. However, at this time, Zhang Lin's forehead was already covered with fine beads of sweat. Zhang Lin did not dare to be careless in the process of compressing the glorious black flames. Because, once there is a slight mistake, all previous efforts will be wasted. Zhang Lin saw all these changes. So close, looking cautiously at the blazing black flames not far away, Zhang Lin couldn't help but let out a breath and secretly said he was lucky. Every moment, the radiant black flames were resisting, struggling, and erupting with extremely terrifying energy. If it weren't for the blessing of his candle sun flame, I'm afraid his spiritual power would have been burned out long ago. It is impossible to completely suppress it. However, at the moment, he has suppressed the brilliant black flame. However, problems gradually emerged. That is, he didn't know how to refine this world-dazzling black flame. People have divine fire, but they don't know how to refine it. Urgent online, is it possible? Zhang Lin thought of a way. However, that method is indeed a bit risky. 
Old man, how should I refine the radiant black flame? At this time, Zhang Lin thought of old man Long Wu again. In his opinion, his method should not be used if possible. He quickly used the communication jade pendant to send a message to the old man Long Wu and asked about this matter. In his opinion, although this old man is usually a little unruly, he should be more reliable at critical times. Glowing black flame, how do you know this? Old man Long Wu, who was accompanying the second elder to visit friends, sat in a pavilion with the second elder. Seeing the communication jade pendant that suddenly lit up, old man Long Wu was slightly startled, and then he said with a strange expression. He glanced quietly at his second brother, old man Long Wu, and seemed to understand something. The radiant black flame among the divine flames of heaven and earth has been sealed in the alchemy king cauldron by his second brother. He knew this a thousand years ago. But now, Zhang Lin suddenly asked him how to refine the radiant black flame. Is it possible? Old man Long Wu suddenly felt a little sad for his second brother. Hurry up, tell me quickly. I can't hold it in anymore. Seeing that old man Long Wu didn't reply to him for a long time, Zhang Lin urged again. The radiant black flame was constantly burning his spiritual power. Without the blessing of his candle sun flame, he might not have been able to hold on long ago. If you want to refine the radiant black flame, you can only let the radiant black flame enter your body, and then you refine it. Remember, be careful. While the second elder and the surrounding people did not react, old man Long Wu quickly responded to Zhang Lin. There is only this chance. I hope Zhang Lin can truly refine this world-dazzling black flame. Lao Wu, what are you doing? You're sneaky. The second elder also had a clear view of old man Long Wu's little moves, frowned and scolded. Hee hee, it's okay, it's okay. Old man Long Wu smiled awkwardly and quickly explained. Looking at the second elder, he looked a little guilty, a little flickering, and a little afraid to look at the second elder. After all, Zhang Lin is stealing the second elder's home now. Is everything okay? The second elder looked at old man Long Wu's appearance and asked suspiciously. For some reason, an ominous premonition suddenly arose in his heart. It's okay, it's okay. Old man Long Wu shook his head, praying in his heart that Zhang Lin could be faster. Before his second brother got the news, he quickly refined the black flame of the world. Okay, Luang Pu Sage, let's have some tea. Another old man on the side also quickly invited the second elder to drink tea. However, at this moment, the second elder's communication jade pendant suddenly lit up, and old man Long Wu also felt something bad. The second elder looked at the sudden news, suddenly raised his head and looked at old man Long Wu, and yelled directly, Long Wu, it's your grandma's fault, you fool. My house was burned down, and you still say it's okay. Isn't my grandma your grandma? Comma, Dan Yu Pagoda. Fifth floor, Zhang Lin looked at the news from the old man Long Wu, then looked at the glorious black flame, and fell into deep thought. Let this thing enter his body and then refine it. Is the method given by this old man really reliable? Zhang Lin hesitated. If what the old man Long Wu said was true, then he would put himself in danger. After all, this thing is not something easy to refine. Although he hesitated, Zhang Lin finally grabbed the radiant black flame and fired it into his body. As soon as the brilliant black flame entered the body, Zhang Lin's body began to tremble violently and seemed to be in pain. Zhang Lin's face was twisted and ferocious, cold sweat broke out on his forehead, and he gritted his teeth. He looked extremely painful. Even with the protection of the candle sun flame, Zhang Lin could still feel the terrifying heat and heat from the glory black flame. His body gradually became hot. The scalding high temperature seemed to melt Zhang Lin, causing Zhang Lin to take a breath of cold air. The origin of the radiant black flame seemed to be conscious, rampaging through his body, wreaking havoc and destroying his body. Under the burning of that high temperature, Zhang Lin felt that his bones and skin were melting inch by inch. Bullshit. Zhang Lin forced himself to calm down and cursed through gritted teeth, secretly cursing in his heart. At the same time, he also drove the candle sun flame to capture the radiant black flame in his body. Outside, the domineering flames of the candle sun wrapped Zhang Lin's body and protected him. Inside, the flames of the candle sun spread all over Zhang Lin's body, surrounding the radiant black flames that were raging wantonly in Zhang Lin's body. Outside Danyu Pagoda, the figure of the great elder suddenly appeared out of thin air, 
standing outside, staring at the scene in the Danu Tower without blinking. Great Elder, seeing this, the boy disciples outside the Danu Pagoda rushed forward to greet him. Let's all disperse, the Great Elder took a deep breath and said in a deep voice. After saying that, the Great Elder's figure appeared in the Danu Pagoda. Within the fifth floor, the traces of Yaoshi Black Flame have disappeared, leaving only Zhang Lin sitting cross-legged, gritting his teeth with a ferocious face. But on the surface of his body, golden domineering flames kept emerging and enveloped him. The brilliant black flame, this kid is really a little reckless this time. The great elder stood there, staring at Zhang Lin motionlessly. Naturally, he could see that Zhang Lin had already got the black flame of the world into his body. And it has reached the point where they cannot be separated. There are only two outcomes for Zhang Lin now. The first is to successfully refine the radiant black flame and refine it into his own power. The second is that he failed to refine the black flame of the world and was swallowed by the black flame of the world. You know, Zhang Lin's behavior this time was too reckless. Even if you are refining this world-dazzling black flame, you must be fully prepared. How could he be as reckless as Zhang Lin? But the matter has come to this, and even he has no choice now. Hey, with a slight sigh, the great elder waved his hand, and the surrounding spiritual energy gathered crazily. As the surrounding spiritual energy gathered, a huge spiritual energy vortex appeared above the Danyu Tower and headed towards Zhang Lin. Meditate, concentrate, and refine. The great elder shouted in a deep voice. The spiritual energy vortex above the Danyu Pagoda became more and more intense, and it kept coming towards Zhang Lin, and Zhang Lin also kept swallowing the surrounding spiritual energy. After the majestic spiritual energy was injected into his body, Zhang Lin immediately started to work, frantically refining the spiritual energy to replenish his missing spiritual power. Quiet Spirit Pill At the same time, a pill also flew out from the sleeves of the Great Elder. This is a purple-red elixir that exudes a strong fragrance. Zhang Lin also opened his mouth slightly when he heard the Great Elder's words. Instantly he felt a pill flying into his mouth, falling into his throat, and melting instantly. A refreshing stream of clear water instantly surged through Zhang Lin's limbs and bones, and the cool feeling refreshed Zhang Lin's whole body. The burning sensation in the body has also decreased. He even felt that he felt a little more relaxed when he captured Yaoshi Black Flame. After a long time, Zhang Lin finally forced the escaping Black Flame back to one place. That was the original power of the Yaoshi Black Flame. The black flame was burning in his body. The cunning Yaoshi black flame was trying to find Zhang Lin's weakness, defeat it, and then take over this body. And Zhang Lin, who had forced the dazzling black flame to one side, felt happy at this time. As long as you force it to one place, it will be easy to handle. Now, as long as it is defeated, the refining will be considered successful. Candle Sun Flame, refine it for me. Manipulating the flames of the candle sun in his body, he wrapped the world dazzling black flames. However, he seemed to be aware of Zhang Lin's actions. The black flame of Yaoshi began a conscious and violent counterattack. The increasingly fierce high temperature caused Zhang Lin's body, which had just cooled down, to rise again. Snort, with a muffled groan, Zhang Lin couldn't help frowning and groaning, with a look of pain on his face. The last resistance is coming soon. As long as you survive it, you will succeed. The great elder looked at the changes on Zhang Lin's face and couldn't help but whisper. He could feel the final struggle coming from the glorious black flames. However, even so, he could only watch Zhang Lin silently and cheer for him in his heart. Will the black flame of Yaoshi finally have an owner after thousands of years? However, the great elder became slightly distressed when he thought of something. Call, brother, how's it going? At this time, the second elder, who hurriedly and slowly returned, finally came back. As soon as he entered the Danyu Pagoda, he saw their eldest brother standing aside. The second elder stepped forward anxiously and asked. On the way back, he learned from Long Wu's mouth that Zhang Lin planned to refine the glory black flame. This allowed him to rush back so quickly. Looking at Zhang Lin again. Zhang Lin was wrapped in the golden flames of the candle sun and had a look of pain on his face. The second elder couldn't help but feel his heart skip a beat. Could it be that Zhang Lin is going to fail? Old man Long Wu behind him also looked nervously at Zhang Lin, who showed pain on his face. 
praying in his heart that Zhang Lin could successfully refine the black flame of the world. Okay, stop talking. It's a critical moment. None of us can help Mr. Zhang at this time, we can only rely on him alone. The great elder shook his head and said. The second elder also nodded when he heard this. When the first elder and the second elder were talking, Zhang Lin's expression changed several times. His face was a little pale, and large beads of sweat were dripping from his forehead. This caused old man Long Wu to feel nervous. The flames of the candle sun forcibly enveloped the black flames of the world. Under the struggle of the black flames of the world, Zhang Lin ran the Candle Sun Sky Fire Sutra in an attempt to refine the black flames of the world. The power of refining is getting stronger and stronger, and the source of the radiant black flames and the power to resist the struggle are getting weaker and weaker. Gradually, the power of Yaoshi black flame gradually became smaller. In the end, it completely disappeared. The violent and violent black flames of the world quietly exuded a peaceful and gentle aura in his body. The black flames that had no resistance were refined very smoothly. The Zuri Heavenly Fire Sutra was operating to the extreme, and it didn't take long for the radiant black flame to be completely refined by Zhang Lin. And Zhang Lin's realm, at this moment, also successfully broke into the fifth level of Tianxuan. Success. Feeling the change in Zhang Lin's aura and the relaxed look on his face, the eyes of the second elder and old man Long Wu also brightened. Zhang Lin's realm successfully broke into the fifth level of Tianxuan with the help of Yaoshi Black Flame. Apparently, he successfully refined the Radiant Black Flame. Well, it worked. I'll leave the rest to you. I'll leave first. The Great Elder also saw Zhang Lin successfully refining the Black Flame of the world, nodded slightly, and then disappeared directly. When Old Man Long Wu and the Second Elder saw this, they quickly stepped forward. Approached Zhang Lin's side because the flames of the candle sun were still burning outside Zhang Lin's body. The two of them just stood aside and looked at him quietly, their eyes constantly looking at him. As if aware of their gazes, the flames of the candle sun outside Zhang Lin's body began to pour into his body and gradually disappeared. Then he opened his eyes, and as soon as he opened his eyes, he saw two old faces appearing in front of him. What's wrong? Zhang Lin stood up slowly, stretched his muscles, and looked at the two of them with a smile. The second elder and the old man Long Wu looked at each other, both showing satisfied smiles. Then the old man Long Wu came forward and patted his shoulder, and said with a look of relief, Not bad, not bad, we can successfully defeat the black flame of the world. Refining, very good. His words were full of praise for Zhang Lin. The second elder on the side suddenly realized something. There were black lines on his face, and the look he looked at Zhang Lin was also very strange. Ahem. Seeing the second elder like this, Zhang Lin was also embarrassed. He coughed twice and explained. Second elder, don't look at me like this. Junior is a little scared. The death stare from the second elder made Zhang Lin feel frightened and he coughed twice. The second elder looked at Zhang Lin. He didn't know what he was thinking. He just kept looking at Zhang Lin. After a long time, the second elder finally sighed, Hey! That's it, it's destiny. Without saying anything more, he turned around and walked towards the Alchemy King Cauldron. In the Alchemy King Cauldron that fell on the ground, there were three golden elixirs lying quietly inside, exuding a faint fragrance. Since you have refined this glorious black flame, I will also give it to you, this Alchemy King Cauldron. With a wave of his sleeve, the three golden elixirs entered the hands of the second elder. And the alchemy king cauldron was slowly floating in the air. The huge alchemy king cauldron gradually shrank under the gaze of the three people, until it shrank to the size of a fist. Then, under the guidance of the second elder, the alchemy king cauldron slowly floated towards Zhang Lin. Looking at the alchemy king cauldron floating in front of him, Zhang Lin was also startled. Do you really want to give this to him? Why is he embarrassed? Then he looked at the second elder suspiciously, Second elder, I'm afraid this is a little inappropriate, right? With that said, he reached out and grabbed the alchemy king cauldron. He looked at the second elder, but the movements of his hands did not slow down at all. He said he was embarrassed, but physically he accepted the alchemy king cauldron without any courtesy. Seeing Zhang Lin's actions, the second elder smiled. This alchemy king cauldron is what I will give to you later. I will give it to you sooner or later, and giving it to you now is not a big deal. As for the Alchemy King Cauldron, 
the second elder had already intended to give it to Zhang Lin. But that was after Zhang Lin read all the alchemy books on the seventh floor. He had taken away the Yaoshi Black Flame, and now that the Alchemy King Cauldron was given to him, it didn't matter. It's just a pity that the Black Flame of the world is gone, which will have some impact on alchemy. But now that the matter has come to this, there is nothing he can do. You can't let Zhang Lin hand over the Yaoshi Black Flame to him again, right? Go on and read the alchemy book. Furthermore, the power of the Black Flame is beyond your imagination. You need to explore it yourself slowly and don't let its pearl be covered in dust. I don't know why, but it's enough for the second elder to look at Zhang Lin now. She didn't want to see him at all, maybe because Zhang Lin stole her home. The feeling of losing his wife and losing his troops really made him feel a little depressed. He waved his hand and signaled Zhang Lin to leave. Seeing this, Zhang Lin said nothing more and could only turn around quickly and run towards the seventh floor. This time, he made a lot of money. The twelfth-ranked black flame among the divine flames of heaven and earth, and the king's weapon Dan Wangding. Zhang Lin was a little excited when he thought about it. Yes, the alchemy king cauldron is also a weapon of the king. Although it cannot be compared with his golden dragon halberd, the alchemy king cauldron is different from the golden dragon halberd. It is an alchemy cauldron. When refining elixirs, you can also increase the level of the elixirs to increase the success rate of elixir refining. A king-level alchemy cauldron is the treasure that all alchemy masters dream of. You know, even the alchemy masters in the king realm may not necessarily have an alchemy cauldron at the king's weapon level in their hands. And just like that, the second elder gave him a king's weapon level alchemy king cauldron. Zhang Lin couldn't help but secretly clicked his tongue. After Zhang Lin's figure disappeared, only the second elder and old man Long Wu were left on the fifth floor. When old man Long Wu saw that his second brother actually gave the alchemy king cauldron to Zhang Lin, he felt a little bit moved on his face. The alchemy king cauldron, this was the special cauldron used by his second brother to make alchemy, but now he actually gave it directly to Xiaozi Zhang. This really surprised old man Long Wu. It seems that his second brother is also very optimistic about Zhang Lin. Second brother, if you do this once, I'm afraid it will cost you a lot of money. Old man Long Wu said with some emotion. When the second elder heard this, he shook his head slightly, and a faint sentence came from his mouth, Stop talking, I want to be quiet. It seems that on the surface, the second elder looks very calm, but in fact, he is already feeling painful inside. It's a pity that old man Long Wu is the kind of person who reports his grudges directly, so he just said, Second brother, who is Jingjing? You are so old, you might as well think about her when you are refining an alchemy cauldron. After saying that, old man Long Wu disappeared from the place in an instant. The second elder was left alone, stunned in place. Why, comma, Danyu Pagoda, a figure sat cross-legged in front of a desk, and the alchemy book in his hand was constantly turning the pages. It's just that it only took dozens of breaths to read each alchemy book. After a long time, the figure finally closed the alchemy book in his hand. Then, he stood up. There was a constant crackling sound in the bones of the body, which was obviously the result of a long period of inactivity. 36,500 alchemy books, after nine months, I have finally read them all. After saying that, the figure disappeared from the place. This person was Zhang Lin. After nine months, he had read all the 36,500 alchemy books that the second elder had given him. Wulongshan Courtyard, the place he left for nine months. It's just that I don't know if he came at the wrong time, but there was no one in the small courtyard. Old man Long Wu and the little girl Long Yu were not at home. This surprised Zhang Lin. This situation is rare. It's really strange. Where else can old man Long Wu go? Is it possible? Zhang Lin was a little confused as he walked into the small courtyard. However, little did he know that old man Long Wu was working hard at this time. In a small world somewhere, an old man wearing shabby clothes and holding a black pickaxe in his hand. He was holding a pickaxe in both hands and was chipping away hard at the golden stone in front of him. While chiseling, he cursed and said, why is this thing so hard? How long will it take to finish this? Old man Long Wu looked at the huge golden mountain in front of him, feeling bitter in his heart. Here, his saint cultivation was not able to be used at all. 
he could only dig with the strength of his body and the pickaxe in his hand. I'm so tired. An extremely rare sweat appeared on the old face and slowly slid down. There was already sweat on his body and his clothes were soaked. Putting down the pickaxe, old man Long Wu just wanted to take a rest. Unexpectedly, a scolding voice came from the distance. What are you doing? Not even a piece of God's gold has been carved out today. Do you still want to rest? I saw, in the distance, an old man missing an arm and a leg, looking at old man Long Wu with wide eyes. Hearing this voice, old man Long Wu trembled all over and immediately did not dare to take any rest. He quickly picked up the pickaxe again and struck at the god's gold. Celestial gold, a legendary divine gold. Even if old man Long Wu cannot use the cultivation level of a saint, his physical strength is absolutely terrifying. But here, there is still no piece of god gold to be dug out. No matter how hard he used it, no matter how crazy he struck. That day, Shenzhen Mountain seemed to be a solid city wall without any cracks. This made old man Long Wu so angry. He was almost driven crazy. Boy Zhang, for you, I am here to dig the divine gold. Sooner or later, I will let you taste what this feels like. Panting for air, old man Long Wu roared angrily. What are you yelling about? Hurry up and get to work. A black shadow flew from a distance and hit old man Long Wu on the head. Old man Long Wu was trembling with fright and hurriedly avoided. A stinky shoe passed by him. Comma. Ah sneeze. Ah sneeze. In the small courtyard, Zhang Lin sneezed twice inexplicably. Rubbing his nose, Zhang Lin muttered, Could it be that old man scolding me? It shouldn't be. Lao Wu is not at home. He has to go out for something. There is no need to look for him anymore. Come to the 15th floor, I'll see you if I need anything. After a fruitless search, Zhang Lin stopped looking. Instead, at this time, the familiar voice of the second elder suddenly came to his mind. After hearing what the second elder said, he stood in the small courtyard and thought for a moment, but he couldn't imagine what the second elder wanted to do with him. However, Zhang Lin did not dare to delay the call from the second elder. Not long after he left the Danyu Pagoda, he was now heading back towards the Danyu Pagoda. On the way, Zhang Lin also guessed in his heart that the second elder had something to do with him this time. It's still the 15th floor, it's still the medicine house. Only, this time, the second elder is not the only person inside. There is also a great elder sitting inside. Nine months, nine blood reverse pills, 36,500 pill books. The second elder sat aside, poured a cup of tea for the eldest brother, and then said. Yes, the great elder nodded took the tea and took a sip. This kid is quite capable. By the way, the black flame of the world was lost to this kid. Do you feel bad? The great elder said with a smile. Hearing this, the second elder suddenly looked bitter. The brilliant black flame is the twelfth ranked existence among the divine flames of heaven and earth. Thirty-three divine flames of heaven and earth, it can be considered to be of the upper middle level. And that thing has stayed in his alchemy king cauldron for thousands of years, and it's just a matter of time to go out. Things are gone. It would be a lie to say that I am not heartbroken. After all, this is his hard work. Why, don't mention this matter anymore. I feel so uncomfortable. As he said that, the second elder sighed again. Okay, Dick, don't feel too uncomfortable. Yaoshi Black Flame, that thing has a great effect on you, and it does the same on us. So, instead of wasting it in the Alchemy King Cauldron, it's better to treat that boy as a favor. It's just a matter of smooth flow. The first elder patted the second elder's arm and said comfortingly. Speaking of which, there was another thing that worried him even more. That boy is now at the sixth level of Tianxuan, plus that radiant black flame. The second elder spoke at this time, but fell silent before he finished speaking. When the great elder heard this, his heart couldn't help but thump. What he was worried about was exactly what the second elder was talking about now. Why, Boy Zhang, only the current Guer can fight with him. The rest of them will not be his opponents at all. Regarding Zhang Lin's combat power, the great elder knew very well that among the Longzi competitors, except Long Ji Yu, the others were far inferior to Zhang Lin. This time, Long Zi was probably born between Zhang Lin and Long Ji Yu. However, Thinking about Zhang Lin's cultivation speed makes people speechless. In less than a year, 
from the first level of Tianxuan to the current sixth level of Tianxuan, even with the help of some pills, the speed of cultivation is extremely terrifying. The great elder was a little shocked when he thought of Zhang Lin's astonishing speed. How many people in this world can achieve this speed of cultivation? Of course, this is because the great elder and the others did not understand Zhang Lin. If they knew that Zhang Lin had broken through from the body training realm to the sixth level of Tianxuan in just one year, wouldn't they be even more surprised? The two of them are just like Long Yao and Long Fu back then. The first elder looked at the second elder and sighed slightly. It's just that the two of them are even more dazzling than Long Yao and Long Fu. Second elder, Junior Zhang Lin is here. Suddenly, Zhang Lin's voice came from outside the door. Obviously, Zhang Lin came to the door of the second elder's medicine house, knocked on the door and shouted. Come in. The second elder and the first elder looked at each other. After the topic was over, the second elder spoke slowly. Zhang Lin outside the door opened the door and walked in after hearing the second elder's words. Junior Zhang Lin has met the first elder and the second elder. Seeing the great elder inside, Zhang Lin was also stunned. After he realized what he was doing, he immediately bowed his hands respectfully and saluted him. He he, Mr. Zhang, sit down. The great elder looked at Zhang Lin and said softly. Zhang Lin raised his head and was not polite when he saw this, and sat down directly. He looked at the two of them with some doubts in his eyes, wondering why they called him here. Boy Zhang, I'll just tell you the truth. Do you have Dao soldiers? The second elder asked calmly, stroking his beard and looking at Zhang Lin. When Zhang Lin heard the word, Daobing, he was stunned for a moment, then nodded and replied, Yes, yes. It's just that I don't have any Taoist soldiers yet. After changing his words, Zhang Lin spoke again. He has Tao soldiers, whether it is the Golden Dragon Halberd or the Alchemy King Cauldron given to him by the Second Elder, they are all Tao soldiers. It's just that he really doesn't have any Taoist soldiers. And he remembered that Qingyao's natal Taoist weapon was a long sword and he has never had the opportunity to refine his own Taoist weapons. Um, the second elder and the first elder looked at each other and nodded. Now there is an opportunity for you to get the legendary divine gold. It's just a bit difficult. Do you want to give it a try? Refining the natal Taoist weapon should be done sooner rather than later. It is better to do it as early as possible. Sacred gold. Zhang Lin frowned slightly. That's right, it's the legendary divine gold. The great elder nodded and explained. Although it's difficult, as long as you get it, it's all yours. It just so happens that you can refine your natal Taoist weapons, how about that? Hearing this, Zhang Lin couldn't help but fall into silence. To be honest, he was moved. The legendary divine gold. As long as he blends in a little divine gold when refining his natal Taoist weapon, he can upgrade that Taoist weapon by several levels. Lao Wu is also there, don't worry. The elder obviously saw Zhang Lin's heartbeat and suddenly said, Um, where is the fifth elder? At this time, it was Zhang Lin's turn to be stunned, with some confusion on his face, and then understanding. No wonder he didn't see old man Long Wu when he went back. So where did old man Long Wu go? Go, if old man Long Wu was there, he wouldn't be able to give it a try. Zhang Lin's eyes became firm, he nodded and said, Okay, I'll go. Second brother, take him there. How much divine gold you can get in half a year depends on your ability. The great elder said calmly. The second elder looked at Zhang Lin and said, follow me. Immediately, the second elder stood up and walked outside. His eyes were looking forward to it, wanting it to be over now. Divine gold, the legendary divine gold. However, little did he know that how excited he was at this moment would be how desperate he would be in the next six months. Those days of despair will be something he will never forget for the rest of his life. Chapter 71 In an inexplicable small world. Where is this place? Zhang Lin followed the second elder and looked around, filled with doubts. This small world was unremarkable, but there was a golden mountain shining in the distance, which made Zhang Lin couldn't help but take a few more glances. Did you see that golden mountain? That is the golden mountain of God. The second elder pointed at the shining golden mountain in the distance and said. The second elder's words made Zhang Lin look startled. Is that the legendary god gold? What, it's a mountain. He has never heard of anyone whose sacred gold comes from a mountain. Is this Jin Shan all made of god's gold? 
Zhang Lin swallowed a mouthful of saliva and looked at the second elder in shock and asked. Well, the whole mountain is made of God's gold. It's just that it's not easy to mine. The second elder glanced at Zhang Lin and said calmly. Impressive. Zhang Lin naturally knew the difficulties involved in mining the God's gold. This is the legendary divine gold. How can it be so easy to get it? However, after coming to this small world, he found that his cultivation seemed to be useless. This small world has suppressed my cultivation. Feeling the abnormality in his own cultivation, Zhang Lin muttered in his heart. Glancing at Zhang Lin, looking at the changes on his face, he seemed to be aware of his inner doubts, and said, in this small world, if there is no exclusive token, the mark will be sealed when entering this small world. Cultivation. You can only use the power of your physical body. No wonder. No, you can only use the power of your physical body. Is it difficult? Zhang Lin heard the second elder's words with some clarity a second ago, but then suddenly thought of something. He looked at the second elder with a shocked face. He can only use the power of the physical body. Doesn't that mean that if he wants to get the god gold, he can't use any cultivation skills and can only use the power of the physical body? With his physical strength, let him get the god gold. Isn't this a foolish dream? Ignoring the shocked Zhang Lin, the second elder waved his sleeves and the two disappeared instantly. The next second, appeared in front of Shenzhen Mountain that day. Looking from a distance, Zhang Lin saw a figure in front of the Divine Gold Mountain that day, waving a pickaxe there and digging continuously. His cultivation was suppressed, which also caused Zhang Lin to feel that the figure was familiar, but he did not recognize it. Is this how God Gold is mined? Since Zhang Lin only saw one person mining celestial gold, he was not very clear about the method of mining celestial gold, so he could only ask the second elder. The second elder also glanced at the figure mining god gold in the distance with a somewhat complicated look. Then he said, Yes, this is how Tianshan gold is mined. How much you can mine within half a year is your ability. That's Lao Wu, you can learn from him. The last words made Zhang Lin couldn't help but look at the figure again. That's old man Long Wu. Staring at old man Long Wu in the distance with disbelief, he really couldn't bring this figure into old man Long Wu. However, when the second elder said this, it seemed that it was really him. It's just that the dignified fifth elder of the Tianlong clan is actually, mining, here. Isn't this a bit of a price drop? Shower Z, why are you here? Bring a boy with you. Suddenly, an old voice came from behind them. Zhang Lin and the second elder turned around together. Turning around, he saw a disabled old man appearing not far behind. The old man looked very old, even more aged and aged than the second elder and old man Long Wu. In his eyes, there was a sharp look in the turbidity. Second patriarch, and the second elder saw this and immediately saluted respectfully. Yes, the second ancestor nodded slightly. His eyes fell on Zhang Lin, and there was a hint of appreciation in those turbid old eyes. This little guy is not simple. The old man who was called the second ancestor by the second elder cast his turbid eyes on Zhang Lin. Zhang Lin's heart skipped a beat and he felt as if he had seen through him. Incredible, the proud son of heaven. At the sixth level of Tianxuan, he has the body of a king, a quasi-sacred weapon, and the weapons of a king. Hey, there's also the black flame of the world. The second ancestor's eyes narrowed for a moment, and then a glimmer of light appeared in his eyes. At the end of the conversation, the second ancestor glanced at the second elder. If he remembered correctly, Yaoshi Black Flame, wasn't it at Shower's place? Shower, is this guy your apprentice? With Yaoshi Black Flame here, doesn't it mean that this kid is Shower's apprentice? This time the waiter had a good eye. I have taken on such a good apprentice. The second ancestor looked at the second elder and said with a smile. Second ancestor, the second elder was stunned. He didn't expect that the second ancestor would say that. Zhang Lin was also stunned. He looked at the second ancestor and then at the second elder. He was also a little confused. Ahem, second ancestor, this is not my apprentice, this kid was brought here by Lao Wu. The second elder was also a little embarrassed and quickly explained. Zhang Lin is indeed a good boy, but unfortunately, there is no master-disciple relationship between the two of them. Oh, is it so? When the second ancestor heard the second elder's words, he was obviously stunned for a moment, and immediately looked at Zhang Lin, with a hint of surprise in his eyes. 
Did Xiao Wu bring it? Not your apprentice. Xiao Wu, come here. After saying that, the second ancestor shouted to the old man Long Wu who was still digging for the god's gold. Then he took a deep look at Zhang Lin. This glance made Zhang Lin's heart tighten. This ancestor is very, very strong. When the second ancestor revealed that he had the quasi-saint weapon Golden Dragon Halberd and the Alchemy King Cauldron in his body, he felt a little worried. Since he can detect this, wouldn't the Dragon Ball in his body have also been discovered by the second ancestor? I felt a little uneasy. After a while, the digger, Old Man Long Wu, came to them panting. When Zhang Lin saw Old Man Long Wu and looked at his current appearance, he almost stopped laughing. In the end, I held back and didn't laugh. How does this look like a master of the holy realm? Wearing shabby clothes with holes in some places. There was sweat on his body and he looked tired. Sweat was still dripping down on his forehead. Hey, second brother, Mr. Zhang, why are you here? Old man Long Wu raised his hand to wipe the sweat from his forehead and looked at the two elders strangely. But when he saw Zhang Lin looking like he wanted to laugh but was holding back his laughter, he couldn't help but raise his eyebrows. Old man, what's wrong with you? Why have you become so lazy after not seeing each other for a while? Old man, what's wrong with you? Why have you become so lazy after not seeing each other for a while? Zhang Lin stepped forward, came to the side of old man Long Wu, and said jokingly. As he spoke, he pointed at his current appearance. Old man Long Wu lowered his head and glanced at his current appearance. You brat, it's not because of you that I'm like this. Without saying a word, old man Long Wu slapped Zhang Lin on the head. I'm not doing this just because of you. Even though he couldn't use his cultivation level, his physical strength was still very powerful. Don't underestimate this old man. Old man Long Wu glared at Zhang Lin angrily, and then turned his gaze to the second elder, a little confused. Second brother, why did you bring this boy here? Hearing this, the second elder said, This kid still doesn't have his own Taoist soldiers. I brought him here to let him get some god gold and let the second ancestor teach him. Upon hearing that it was another man coming to dig, the second ancestor immediately stepped forward and approached Zhang Lin. He looked Zhang Lin up and down, and his eyes stayed on him for several seconds. Shaoer, do you think Tianxin Jin is a cabbage? You can do it if you want. The second ancestor's tone was slightly dissatisfied. Okay, they're here. Just leave quickly. I'm so old, but I still want to help you, treacherous son. I don't know what it means to respect the elderly and love the young. The second ancestor glared at the second elder with some displeasure and said, then turned around. Then, second ancestor, I will leave first. Seeing this, the second elder felt a little helpless, but had nothing to say. He could only say goodbye to the second ancestor and leave. As soon as the second elder left, the second ancestor looked at Zhang Lin. Little guy, your name is Zhang Lin, right? Hearing the second ancestor's question, Zhang Lin quickly stood up straight and answered seriously, yes, senior. I wonder what senior has ordered. This, but the second elder and the others all have to call the second ancestor for the existence of their seniors. Just like them, just call me second ancestor. Take it. The second ancestor looked at Zhang Lin and said calmly. After saying that, he threw a pickaxe to Zhang Lin. The pickaxe is completely black, and it looks like it's not ordinary at first glance. This is it. Zhang Lin was startled and quickly reached out to catch it, but as soon as he took it, he felt the heavy power coming from the pickaxe. After reacting quickly, Zhang Lin also used a little force to hold it firmly in his hand. I weighed the pickaxe, it was very heavy. Take this thing and follow Xiao Wu to mine the god gold. If you can mine it in half a year, it's all yours. The second ancestor pointed at old man Long Wu and said to Zhang Lin. After saying that, he turned around and left. Old man, this. Zhang Lin held the pickaxe in his hand and looked at old man Long Wu with some hesitation. Hey, come with me. In half a year, you should be able to carve out one or two pieces, which is enough. Old man Long Wu shook his head and sighed. One second, he was asking Zhang Xiaozi to give it a try, and the next second, Zhang Lin was brought to him by the second elder. It really means Sao 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 has arrived. You should have known about this heavenly god Jin Shan before you came here. Heavenly gold, the legendary divine gold. But if you want to mine it, you can only mine it with this divine pickaxe. 
Old man Long Wu walked in front, introducing as he walked. If you don't use this divine pickaxe, you won't be able to mine this divine gold no matter how you deal with it. Even using this magical pickaxe is very difficult. After listening to old man Long Wu's introduction, Zhang Lin suddenly understood. So that's it. Doesn't that mean that this magical pickaxe is also a magical weapon? Zhang Lin's eyes couldn't help but focus on the pickaxe in his hand. All the moving gold that can be mined says that this pickaxe is awesome. Finally, the two came to the foot of the god's golden mountain. Only when you really come down here can you feel the shock brought by the god gold. God's gold, the whole body is golden and integrated. It's just that there are dense mysterious lines on its body. Among them, there is light flowing in the lines. These lines are all the natural Tao patterns of this heavenly gold, which contain the Tao of the world. Okay, stop looking and get started. Look, learn from me. Picking up the pickaxe he had left here, old man Long Wu clasped his hands together, exerting force on his arm muscles and exerting force suddenly. Bang! Under the strong force of old man Long Wu, the pickaxe struck hard on the hard god gold. A crisp sound came, making Zhang Lin focus on the divine gold that day. Only, although the sound was loud, the results were not ideal. The contact surface between the pickaxe and the god gold. Although old man Long Wu used a lot of strength, he didn't leave any traces at all. Not even a white trace was left. This scene immediately made Zhang Lin dumbfounded. He knew the strength of old man Long Wu. The cultivation level of Saint Realm can't be used even if it is cultivation level. If he could only use the power of his physical body, he would have the majestic body of a saint and his power would be terrifying. But just like that, old man Long Wu didn't even leave a trace behind. Then, with his strength, doesn't that mean it's even worse? In half a year, could he really mine a piece of God's gold? Suddenly, Zhang Lin had deep doubts about his mining of God gold. Saints are like this, so wouldn't he, Tian Xuan? Why? Don't be stunned, hurry up and dig. Old man Long Wu was helpless about this result and could only remind him with a sigh. Even if he wanted to mine this divine gold, it would be very difficult. Well, looking at the Jinshan mountain of heaven and discarding all the distracting thoughts in his heart, Zhang Lin also took a deep breath and discarded all the distracting thoughts. Then, he imitated old man Long Wu, holding the pickaxe tightly with both hands, and struck the god gold with all his strength. Sonorous, sonorous, dong dong dong, each knock will cause a crisp impact sound. However, the result is the same as that of old man Long Wu. The sound is very loud, but there is no trace. And every time he exerts force, Zhang Lin will feel the counter shock force from the pickaxe. Right, that is it. I learned quickly and learned well. I estimate that if you dig for 10 days and a half, you should be able to leave a trace. Old man Long Wu stood not far from him and looked at Zhang Lin with a smile. Seeing Zhang Lin's appearance, old man Long Wu thought to himself, how dare you laugh at me? It won't be long before you look like this too. Moreover, in his opinion, it was remarkable that Zhang Lin could carve out a piece in half a year. The operation was as fierce as a tiger, and Zhang Lin couldn't stop for a moment. Continuously hammering the god's golden mountain, over and over again, over and over again. But, unfortunately, the result is still the same. Not even a white mark appeared. At this time, Zhang Lin finally understood why old man Long Wu looked so embarrassed. I'm afraid it won't be long before he looks like that. However, there was one question that kept lingering in his mind. That is, why is old man Long Wu here? And looking at this, old man Long Wu has obviously been here for a long time. Otherwise, it wouldn't be like this. Old man, why are you here? Zhang Lin asked as he kept waving the pickaxe in his hand. It's not because of you. Old man Long Wu was slightly startled when he heard Zhang Lin's words, glanced at Zhang Lin, and then said angrily, if it weren't for you, would I be mining here? The words were full of complaints. Me, Zhang Lin frowned slightly, not understanding what old man Long Wu meant by this sentence. This matter seems to have nothing to do with him, right? Zhang Lin thought about it over and over, but never thought that it had anything to do with him. Have you forgotten? Didn't I teach you a breathing technique before? Do you think I got it so easily? Seeing that Zhang Lin hadn't realized the problem yet, old man Long Wu couldn't help but hate the fact that iron cannot become steel. The true dragon breathing technique, 
he had paid a huge price to get that thing. In the end, this kid actually forgot about it, which really pissed him off. Breathing Method Zhang Lin heard this and carefully recalled the scene when he learned the breathing method that day. This, he certainly has not forgotten this matter. True Dragon Breathing Method, Eternal Breathing Method. He had previously wondered how old man Long Wu had such a thing. Now, I finally figured it out. I promised the second ancestor and the others that I will mine here for 50 years, plus some other conditions. Otherwise, how do you think you got it? Old man Long Wu became more and more angry as he thought about it. When he said this, he became even more energetic in his hands. In half a day's effort, a white mark was carved out of the heavenly gold in front of him. Fifty years, all go, old man, you've sold yourself out. Fifty years, with your appearance, I'm afraid you won't even be able to work for fifty years. Zhang Lin was also a little surprised when he heard that old man Long Wu was going to work hard here for fifty years and exclaimed. You know, old man Long Wu, at such an old age, has no idea how many years he has left to live, but he will have to work hard here for fifty years. Fifty years, I'm afraid, once he's finished, he'll be truly exhausted. Is this any different from selling oneself? Old man, this is really hard on you. Zhang Lin sighed, with a hint of guilt deep in his eyes. If it hadn't been for him, I'm afraid old man Long Wu wouldn't have had to sell himself for fifty years. Fifty years in this place is really torture. And I learned from old man Long Wu that there were only three people in this small world including him. Doesn't that mean that there are only old man Long Wu and the second ancestor? Fifty years, so lonely. Hey, brat, you can't expect anything good from me. Hearing Zhang Lin say that he might not be able to live for fifty years, old man Long Wu blew his beard and glared angrily, wishing to beat Zhang Lin. However, this matter was also brought up by him on his own initiative. The past fifty years have been relatively good under those conditions. Old man Long Wu thought about the remaining conditions. His eyes are also looking at this small world. From now on, hey. Okay, stop talking. The true dragon breathing technique is more powerful than you think. Don't let it down. If you feel guilty, just snatch the position of Dragon Sun from me and then send the thing back. Then you will be worthy of my efforts. Old man Long Wu waved his hand and said impatiently. Zhang Lin is their only hope. Boy, where did the dragon beads in your body come from? A cold word suddenly sounded. Zhang Lin was immediately startled and almost dropped the pickaxe in his hand to the ground. Ha, huh, it turns out to be senior second ancestor. Turning his head, Zhang Lin saw second ancestor sitting not far from them, staring at him closely. Second ancestor, what did you just say? Zhang Lin, who didn't know whether he didn't understand clearly or pretended not to understand, asked in confusion. Dragon beads, where did they come from? The second ancestor stared at Zhang Lin and repeated again. Don't pretend to be stupid with me, I can see clearly. Before Zhang Lin could speak, old man Long Wu spoke first. Isn't that right, second ancestor, the dragon ball needs to be at least the semi-saint realm to be conceived. This kid Zhang Lin is only at the Tianxuan realm, how can he have the dragon ball? After hearing what the second ancestor said, old man Long Wu didn't believe that there was a dragon ball in Zhang Lin's body. It wasn't that he didn't believe it, but that it was impossible. Dragon balls must at least be found in the semi-saint realm. Zhang Lin, the Tianxuan realm, is incomparable to the semi-saint realm. Xiao Wu, don't say you don't believe it. Even I couldn't believe it just now, thinking it was because I felt wrong. But, this is what happened. There is a dragon ball in this kid's body. It's very powerful, very powerful. In response to Long Wu's rebuttal, the second ancestor didn't say anything. He just looked at Zhang Lin deeply and spoke with absolute certainty every word. What? At this moment, old man Long Wu's eyes widened and his face was full of shock. This thing is so unbelievable. He knew Zhang Lin very well. Moreover, he couldn't imagine where Zhang Lin got a dragon ball. What shocked him the most was that the second ancestor said that the dragon ball was very powerful. It was very powerful. At the very least, the owner of that dragon ball is as strong as the second ancestor. Boy Zhang, tell me, is what the second ancestor said true? Looking at Zhang Lin again, old man Long Wu still couldn't suppress the shock in his heart and asked quickly. Zhang Lin also fell silent at this time. 
He also didn't expect that the second ancestor in front of him was so powerful, and even the dragon ball in his body was discovered by him. Just now, he was thinking of hiding it and pretending to be confused. However, looking at the current situation, I'm afraid it won't work. After being silent for a long time, Zhang Lin raised his head, looked at old man Long Wu and the second ancestor, and finally said, yes, there is indeed a dragon ball in this junior's body. Ignoring the look of shock on old man Long Wu's face, Zhang Lin continued. And this dragon ball was obtained from the dragon transformation pond. Hearing this, both old man Long Wu and the second ancestor were all stunned. Huolong Pond, the two people asked in unison. How could there be a dragon ball in the Huolong Pond? Old man Long Wu couldn't help but ask. Zhang Lin shook his head, I don't know either. It's just that a golden dragon suddenly appeared in the Huolong Pond. It was he who gave this dragon ball to this junior. Boy Zhang, tell the truth, where did your dragon beads come from? Old man Long Wu obviously didn't believe Zhang Lin's words. Where is the golden dragon in the Huolong Pond? He has lived for thousands of years, why have I never heard of him? He looked at Zhang Lin and asked solemnly. Dragon Ball, the essence of a dragon clan. This is the fact. The dragon ball in my body was obtained from the dragon transformation pond. Seeing that old man Long Wu didn't believe what he said, he shrugged, spread his hands and said helplessly. Huolong Pond, Huolong Pond, Golden Dragon, Dragon Pearl. Compared with old man Long Wu's disbelief, the second ancestor on the side kept thinking. He is an old monster who has lived for countless years. Naturally, he has many things about Huolong Pond in his mind. Moreover, Zhang Lin's words reminded him of something vaguely. Long long ago, it seems that someone once said about the abnormality in Huolong Pond. It's just that no one believed what was going on inside. I think that the person saw it wrong and had an illusion. Oh, right. The second ancestor suddenly remembered the person who talked about it at that time. Isn't that my eldest brother? Is it possible that what Zhang Lin said is true? Did the dragon ball in his body really come from the dragon transformation pond? Thinking of this, the second ancestor also believed a little bit of Zhang Lin's words. My eldest brother has also experienced this matter, but it seems that the eldest brother only saw the figure of Jin Long and did not get the dragon ball given by Jin Long. As for why the golden dragon appeared in the Huolong Pond and why Zhang Lin was given a dragon ball, the second ancestor didn't quite understand these things and couldn't understand them. Can you refine the power in this dragon ball? He suddenly stepped forward and pushed the boy Long Wu aside. The second ancestor looked at Zhang Lin and spoke solemnly. Cannot, this dragon ball has no effect in my body, and I have no way to refine it. Zhang Lin said with a wry smile. He had used countless methods to refine this dragon ball. Unfortunately, no one has any effect. He is also very passionate about this dragon ball, but he just can't refine it. Is there nothing we can do? The second ancestor suddenly stretched out his hand and grabbed Zhang Lin's arm with lightning speed. Then, a ray of spiritual power followed Zhang Lin's arm and entered his body. Strange, really strange. The second ancestor grabbed Zhang Lin's arm with a look of surprise on his face. The dragon ball in Zhang Lin's body is really strange. He was also a little confused as to why it couldn't be refined. Second ancestor, is there nothing you can do? Zhang Lin looked at the second ancestor looking puzzled and couldn't help but ask. Oh, I can't. This is the first time I've seen you in this situation, and there's nothing I can do about it. The second ancestor sighed retracted his palm, and shook his head helplessly. Boy Zhang, don't be disappointed. This dragon ball is something that not many people can envy. Why are you disappointed? Old man Long Wu looked at Zhang Lin's somewhat disappointed expression and couldn't help but offer words of comfort. It's a pity that it can't be refined, and it's of no use if it stays in my body. Zhang Lin shook his head, feeling a little regretful. Anyway, it's better to have something than nothing. After all, this dragon ball is the essence of the dragon clan. If one day, you have a chance, you might be able to refine it. The second ancestor smiled and comforted. This dragon ball is amazing. He could feel the terrifying power contained in it. Perhaps, that golden dragon may not be their ancestor. Okay, just keep this dragon ball. The second ancestor patted Zhang Lin on the shoulder with his only remaining arm. After saying that, he disappeared. 
Zhang Lin and old man Long Wu were left behind again. The two stared at each other with big eyes and small eyes, but neither of them spoke. No one spoke first. What are you looking at? Why don't you dig the mine quickly? Your Taoist soldiers don't want it anymore. After a long time, old man Long Wu spoke first and glared at Zhang Lin. Why, there's still a long way to go. Looking at the divine gold that still had no trace at all, Zhang Lin couldn't help but shook his head and muttered to himself. It's good if you know it's difficult, don't do it quickly. Some time ago, I heard from my second brother that that boy Long Ji Yu only mined a piece of heavenly gold in a year when he was at the sixth level of Tianxuan. Boy Zhang, don't embarrass me. Although you only have half a year, no matter what, you must get a piece of God's gold for me. Old man Long Wu looked at Zhang Lin and said in a serious tone. In his opinion, Zhang Lin could not do worse than Long Ji Yu in anything he did, otherwise where would he put his face? In his eyes, Zhang Lin's potential was much greater than Long Gu's. Only by truly understanding Zhang Lin can we understand the horror of this boy. Okay, don't worry, old man, I will definitely get one for you. One piece is not enough, I'll get you two. Zhang Lin tried his best to hit Tian Shenzhen with another pickaxe, but he still spoke plausibly. If you are ambitious, Tu Yuan is enough. Long Wu also nodded with satisfaction. An unknown place. The surrounding mysterious lines are crisscrossing, like a spider web, densely spread all around. The richness of the spiritual energy is even more astonishing. The entire space was filled with spiritual energy, as if it had become a fairyland. In the deepest part of this place, there is an ancient tree. The branches and leaves of this ancient tree are all golden in color, as if they were made of metal. Every branch and leaf has Tao patterns emerging and flowing continuously. Exuding a faint life force, it surged towards the surrounding caves and poured into the divine source one after another. And at this moment, a figure suddenly walked in here slowly. Hey, I suddenly start to envy you. Lately, I feel like I'm on my last legs, maybe a hundred years at most. Looking at the golden ancient trees and the few caves, the visitor suddenly sighed. The person who came was none other than the second ancestor. The second ancestor's eyes were a little complicated. He has already run out of oil and the lamp has dried up. He will die in a hundred years at most. But fortunately, a hundred years is enough time for him to do a lot of things. Moreover, after he passed away, the heir who guarded this place was also found. There aren't many regrets. Unconsciously, half a month has passed. Hey, hey, hurry, hurry. Zhang Lin waved the pickaxe in his hand vigorously, hitting the divine gold again and again. It kept making crisp knocking sounds. After half a month, the piece of heavenly gold in front of Zhang Lin also underwent changes visible to the naked eye. On that day, there was already a white mark on the divine gold, and there was also a small, slightly invisible gap. Even though there is only such a slight change, you must know that this is God's gold. The legendary divine gold. With the pickaxe in his hand, he was able to make this heavenly gold change like this, which is already very good. Didn't you see that the old man Long Wu next door, with his saintly body, could only carve out a small piece of heavenly gold? No, it's not bad. Boy Zhang, it's only a crack in half a month. I'm afraid it won't be long before you can chisel off a piece. On the side, old man Long Wu, who was sitting there panting from exhaustion and resting, also saw the small gap with sharp eyes, and immediately said with a smile. Old man, don't make any sarcastic remarks. You'd better hurry up, I only need two pieces in half a year. But you needed ten yuan for half a year, and now you just got one. Hearing old man Long Wu's words, Zhang Lin also rolled his eyes at him, and then put down the pickaxe in his hand. He gently beat his sore arm. For half a month, he couldn't lift his arm. Humph, you don't need to tell me, I know it too. Old man Long Wu also felt helpless about his own standards. But, what can be done about this? There was no way he could disobey the rules set by his second ancestor. What's more, according to his words, allowing him to mine ten pieces of god gold in half a year was already the minimum standard for him. Boy Zhang, come here. Change to another place. Suddenly, the second ancestor's voice sounded behind them. Zhang Lin was stunned. Did the second ancestor want him to change places? Doesn't that mean that he and old man Long Wu are going to separate? Then, it seems even more lonely. 
Why, old man, I'm leaving. Zhang Lin shook his head, reluctantly picked up the pickaxe and walked towards the second ancestor. The second ancestor led the way, and he followed closely behind. I don't know where the second ancestor wants him to go. Anyway, we are getting further and further away from old man Long Wu's place. Xiao Wu passed on the breathing method to you, right? The second ancestor in front suddenly spoke on the road and said calmly, that breathing method is not simple. I hope you can use it well. Zhang Lin also listened silently to the second ancestor's words without speaking. I heard from Xiao Wu that you are planning to compete with Long Zi. The second ancestor continued to ask. Yes, this junior wants to compete for the position of the dragon son of this generation. Zhang Lin didn't hide anything and answered directly. The second ancestor was not surprised at all when he heard Zhang Lin's answer, but he stopped and turned around to look at Zhang Lin. His turbid eyes stared at Zhang Lin. Seeing him like that, Zhang Lin's heart tightened and he didn't know what the second ancestor meant. If I ask you to withdraw from the Dragon Sun War, would you be willing? The second ancestor suddenly spoke. What he said really made Zhang Lin a little surprised, and at the same time, he was also a little confused. Did the Dragon King or the elders ask you to do this? Let him withdraw from the Dragon Sun struggle, that is, let Long Ji Yu, the son of the Dragon King, become the Dragon Sun of this generation. Thinking of this, Zhang Lin's face turned cold. No, it's not. This is just what I mean. Do you know why I want you to withdraw from the Dragon Sun fight? Turning around, the second ancestor faced forward, talking as he walked. Have no idea. He could not give up on the battle between Dragon Sun and Dragon Sun. Only by becoming Dragon Sun could he enter the Nine Dragon Secret Realm and obtain the Nine Dragon Glazed Grass. The position of Dragon Sun is not important to him. What is important is the Nine Dragon Glazed Grass. The position of Dragon Sun also means that he will become the next Dragon King. Dragon King, he is the representative of the entire Tianlong clan, and he must always consider the Tianlong clan. The second ancestor said earnestly, your potential is very huge. In the future, you will definitely be the mainstay of the Dragon clan. Besides, I also believe that you will be even better than Long Ji Yu. But, there's one thing you can't do. Having said this, the second ancestor paused. Your heart is not in the Tianlong clan. You don't want to go to this place, that boy Long Ji Yu. He will be proud that he is a member of the Tianlong clan, and will be proud of being the dragon son and dragon king of the Tianlong clan, but you will not. Your heart is not with the Tianlong clan, but with someone else. Zhang Lin didn't say a word and listened quietly. He didn't refute what the second ancestor said. Because these are facts and there is no room for excuse. I heard what Xiao Wu said, you need to enter the Nine Dragons secret realm to find the Nine Dragon Glazed Grass. I can make the decision. I will let you enter the Nine Dragons secret realm when the time comes. How about I give you some compensation? The second ancestor spoke. Zhang Lin was also stunned when he heard what the second ancestor said. He looked at the second ancestor in surprise. Let him enter the secret realm of Kowloon without going through the battle of Long Zi. This is quite good, but, second ancestor, can you let me consider this for a while? I can't give you an answer yet. After the second ancestor finished speaking, Zhang Lin was silent for a long time before speaking slowly. Okay, before you leave, just give me an answer. Besides, don't worry, the compensation I will give you will definitely not be less than the rewards from the Dragon Sun's War. That, Zhang Lin wanted to say something more. However, his words were stopped by the second ancestor. Okay, we're here, you can mine here. Suddenly, the second ancestor stopped. At this time, Zhang Lin also looked around. Different from the previous place. Here, next to Tianjin Mountain, there is a spring. No, it should be said to be a hot spring. There was a touch of heat radiating from the surroundings, making Zhang Lin couldn't help but take a deep breath. A faint life force entered his body and nourished his body. It brought recovery to his body. Second ancestor, is this spring water? Seeing this situation, Zhang Lin asked with some confusion. The imitation version of the fountain of life is good for you. Although it has limited improvement in your cultivation, it can repair the hidden wounds in your body. It's better to take a dip in this spring of life every seven days. This fountain of life was also brought in from outside using their great supernatural powers. 
The purpose is to make mining of God gold more efficient. Zhang Lin looked at the fountain of life. Although it was only a replica, he could feel that it was of great help to him. Okay, Junior knows. The second ancestor explained some things to Zhang Lin again, and after finishing speaking, he left directly. After watching the second ancestor leave completely, Zhang Lin's eyes returned to the fountain of life. Good stuff. Without any hesitation, Zhang Lin entered the fountain of life. The gentle and life-giving spring water instantly refreshed his exhausted body. The feeling of fatigue in the body seemed to gradually disappear with the washing of the fountain of life. With every breath, a rich life force penetrated into his body, entered his internal organs, and repaired his hidden wounds hidden deep inside. The effect doesn't feel as powerful as the one in the Holy Land. Feeling the power of life around him, Zhang Lin inexplicably thought of the small world that old man Qing took him to that time in Qingyan Holy Land. The life force there is much more powerful than here, and it is also purer. Thinking of this, he thought of old man Qinglu and Qingyao. I don't know how they are doing now, especially Qingyao. It's been almost a year and I miss her so much. Qingyao, at this time, it's time to go to the Heaven Pass, right? I just don't know how far she can go. Why? After soaking in the Fountain of Life, Zhang Lin sighed, with a look of expectation on his face. Soon, just wait a few more years and give her a surprise then. I just hope that old man Qinglu will take good care of Qingyao, otherwise, he will definitely pull out his beard when he goes back. Thinking of this, Zhang Lin slowly closed his eyes, enjoying the moisture of the Fountain of Life, and began to slowly regulate his body. The surrounding life force also slowly surged towards his body. The other side, in Qingyan Holy Land, in the main hall. Old man Qinglu sat cross-legged in front of the chessboard, looking at the chessboard. The chess pieces in his hands were hesitant, not knowing where to land. Master, how long do you have to think about it? It's already a stick of incense. Opposite, Xie Qingyao was dressed in green clothes. Looking at the master who had never made a move, she felt helpless and urged. Wait a minute, I haven't decided yet. Old man Qinglu raised his head, glanced at Xie Qingyao opposite, and said angrily. After saying that, he looked at it again. After pondering for a long time, old man Qinglu still hesitantly placed the chess piece on the chessboard. Ah sneeze. The piece falls and the sneeze follows. It came so unexpectedly that Qinglu looked confused. It must be that boy Zhang Lin who scolded me on Tianlongsheng. Rubbing his nose without leaving a trace, old man Qinglu directly pinned the crime on Zhang Lin. Master, everything depends on evidence. You can't slander him casually. Besides, how do you know it must be him? What if it's someone else? Xie Qingyao, who was opposite him, rolled his eyes at his master when he heard his words, and then spoke. HMPH, hey, my elbows are turned out. Why don't anyone sympathize with me as an old man? The world is really in decline. Looking at the disciple in front of him with a resentful look, Qinglu felt a little heartbroken and couldn't help but shake his head. Xie Qingyao, Master, I suddenly feel that you have a lot of dramas. If this keeps up, I won't play chess with you anymore. Seeing the master who was acting a lot, Qingyao was also a little bit dumbfounded and said speechlessly. Hearing this, Qing Lu stopped saying anything. The two masters and disciples moved, and the chess pieces kept flying on the chessboard, and soon they fell into a stalemate. An hour later, old man Qing Lu simply admitted defeat. Why, forget it, I won't fight with you as a teacher. I'm old. Old man Qing Lu looked at the chess pieces on the chessboard and sighed. By the way, do you remember Zhou Tian? Suddenly, old man Qing Lu mentioned a name. Xie Qingyao was slightly startled and then looked at him in confusion, wondering why the master suddenly mentioned his name. What's wrong? Seeing his master suddenly mentioning Zhou Tian, Xie Qingyao also looked curious. That boy is incredible. When I was drinking some time ago, I heard my junior brother mention him, and he was extremely satisfied with him. There are a lot of compliments on him. It can be seen that he appreciates that kid very much. Moreover, that boy's cultivation level has also risen rapidly, and he has become extremely mysterious. Hearing the master's words, Xie Qingyao's heart moved slightly. She also remembered that when Zhou Tian first came here, he had just broken through the Aperture Realm, but now he was already Earth Mysterious. This cultivation speed is really fast. 
Of course, no matter how fast she practices, she can't compare to the one in her heart. That surprised me a little bit. However, you must know that he was also a proud man in the past, and his talent was not bad. This is to be expected. Upon hearing this, Ching Lu also nodded slightly to express his approval. By the way, are you planning to go to Heaven Pass too? Isn't it a little too early? It won't start until 50 years later. Ching Lu's expression also became serious. He looked at his apprentice with a worried look and couldn't help but ask. Xie Qingyao. However, looking at his master's worried look, Xie Qingyao was slightly touched in her heart. Don't worry, doesn't master still know my strength? Besides, so many people are already on their way. If I don't go, I'm afraid I will fall behind them for a long time. That's right, forget it, it's up to you. You also have something to protect your life. If you can't fight, just run away. You should also be careful when you meet the little guy from the Tianlong clan. His talent is very strong. There are also disciples from the Tianwang clan, Tianjian Holy Land, Yaoqi and other forces, so be careful. The old man Qinglu looked at the girl in front of him and warned him with a serious look. After hearing his master's words, Xie Qingyao nodded slightly to express his understanding. I understand, master, comma, it's pretty good here, but it's a pity that old man Long Wu can't use it. I don't know how long he soaked in it, but Zhang Lin finally opened his eyes, felt his surroundings, and suddenly sighed. His fatigue also completely disappeared, and his whole body was filled with an unparalleled power. He felt that right now, he could even easily chip off a piece of God's gold. Unfortunately, these are all his illusions. Without this pickaxe, even if he had cultivation, he probably wouldn't be able to get a piece of God gold in his life. Thinking of his own Taoist soldiers and Qingyaos, he was full of motivation. So motivated, keep up the good work. Set a small goal, two pieces of God gold. Use one for yourself and leave the other for Qingyao. Tianguan, Xuantian Sacred Monument, the usually ordinary holy monument suddenly lit up on this day. The bright brilliance filled the sky, washing down like a waterfall and covering the entire space. A vast aura filled the void. Xuantian's Sacred Monument, at this moment, exuded an aura that shocked all the monks. Dragon of the Tianlong Clan, passed through eleven levels. Under the shocking gaze of countless monks, Xuantian's sacred monument suddenly burst into dazzling light, and on it, a huge dragon-shaped mark appeared. Immediately afterwards, a line of golden characters appeared. The news on Xuantian's sacred monument swept the entire imperial domain at this moment. Success! Countless practitioners looked at the Xuantian sacred monument in surprise. They naturally know about Long Ju. This generation of the Tianlong clan is the most likely person to become the dragon son. Half step into the realm of a king, with terrifying strength, he is the most outstanding genius among the younger generation of the Tianlong clan. But now, the word, Long Ji Yu, actually appears on the Xuantian sacred monument. And from the current point of view, I am afraid that he is only one last chance away from the true king's realm to break through. I just don't know who is better, him or Huang Nu. Some practitioners looked at Xuantian's sacred monument and compared Long Ji Yu with the Phoenix girl from the Phoenix tribe that day. After all, the qualifications of these two people are almost equal. Moreover, Huang Nu is also the most promising successor to the Tianwang clan in the future. And Long Ji Yu is also the hope for the future of the Tianlong clan. It's hard to say. Huang Nu reached the 11th level earlier than Long Ji Yu. Although Huang Nu is powerful, Long Gu's qualifications are not bad, right? What if he comes from behind? Are you stupid? Although Long Ji Yu is very powerful, Huang Nu is definitely not simple. While many practitioners were still discussing, they were shocked by the names of these two monsters. The Xuantian Holy Monument, whose vision has not disappeared, has changed again. Buzz, Xuantian's sacred monument emits a dazzling white light. Around it, there is a sacred light flowing, making people feel sacred. Wan Mu, the holy son of Heavenly Sword Holy Land, breaks through eleven levels. Saint Maiden of Yaoqi, pass through eleven levels. Luo Ji Yu, the holy son of the Holy Land of Yin and Yang, breaks through eleven levels. The names of three people appeared on the sacred monument of Xuantian. Visions kept emerging, leaving everyone shocked and confused. 
Counting the dragons from the Tianlong clan just now, there are already four, right? It seems, there are more than four. Look, suddenly, in a tea house, someone looked at the Xuantian sacred monument above with dull eyes, and suddenly shouted loudly. After hearing his words, everyone looked up. Hiss. After seeing the words that appeared on the Xuantian sacred monument, a group of people couldn't help but gasp. Line after line, dozens of names appeared one after another, leaving a group of people stunned. Have these guys made an appointment? Why are you trying to get through on this day? It's getting lively now. This time, I'm afraid it will attract a lot of geniuses. Seven stars and six domains, it's amazing. I think not only geniuses, but also people from some top forces will come. I'm really looking forward to it. When everyone saw the characters appearing on Xuantian's sacred monument, they couldn't help but talk about it. Everyone is amazed. This is the seven stars and six domains, a place where geniuses gather. It is also the necessary place for their ultimate goal. Hey, why don't you see the Holy Sun and Saint of Qingyan Holy Land? I don't know how much time passed, but suddenly, someone looked at the many names on the Xuantian sacred monument and murmured to himself. Hearing this, a group of people immediately looked at him. Yeah, they don't seem to be here. The Holy Son and Holy Lady of Qingyan Holy Land are not here. I heard that the talent of the contemporary saint in Qingyan Holy Land is also extremely terrifying, but I don't know why she didn't break through this time. A monk had heard about the deeds of Qingyan Holy Land Saint Xie Qingyao and couldn't help but speak. That's true, but I think the saint will be here soon. I hope she can compete with Long Ji Yu, Huang Nu and the others. After all, we are all human beings. At the same time, the human race, they naturally do not want the human race to fall behind other races in terms of strength. Yes, but to be honest, there are really too many monsters in this life, let alone the Tianlong clan and the Tianlong clan. I didn't expect there to be so many ancient clans and hidden forces. Why, look, it's the saint of Qingyan Holy Land, Xie Qingyao. Suddenly, someone exclaimed, causing everyone to turn their attention to the Xuantian sacred monument. Sure enough, when everyone raised their heads, they saw a faint green light suddenly emerging from the Xuantian sacred monument, among which green lotuses were blooming and phoenixes were singing. Xie Qingyao, the saint of Qingyan Holy Land, passed through twelve levels. Level 12. Seeing the golden text that suddenly appeared, everyone was shocked and speechless. This, this is too outrageous. You know, that phoenix girl has just passed the twelfth level. But she has been through the barrier for a long time, and Saint Qingyan seems to have only been through the barrier for less than half a year, right? Everyone was shocked and speechless, staring at the Xuantian sacred monument in stunned silence. Comma, old man, half a year has passed, and I'm about to leave this miserable place. Half a year passed in a blink of an eye. On this day, Zhang Lin squatted aside, looking at the old man Long Wu who was still hammering away at the god's gold, and said with a smile on his lips. He didn't want to stay in this place at all. If it weren't for the two pieces of heavenly gold, he wouldn't want to stay here at all. But when he thought about his rich harvest this time, he couldn't help but feel happy. Two pieces of heavenly gold. That's right, he got two pieces of heavenly gold in the past six months. Of course, this was also thanks to the fountain of life that the second ancestor took him to. If not for the help provided by the fountain of life, I'm afraid he will only be able to get one piece of God's gold instead of two. Little idiot, don't be too happy. When I get the chance, I will teach you a lesson. Old man Long Wu stopped what he was doing, raised his head, and saw Zhang Lin's proud look on his face. He couldn't help but curl his lips and said, Ha ha, old man. Fifty years, I'll wait for you. When Zhang Lin heard what the old man from the dragon clan said, he mocked him unceremoniously. After hearing his words, old man Long Wu couldn't help but roll his eyes. Heartless guy, comma, okay, Mr. Zhang, come here with me and let's have a chat. The second ancestor also appeared suddenly at this time. He briefly glanced at Long Wu, then looked at Zhang Lin and said, I see, how have you considered that matter? Away from old man Long Wu, the second ancestor turned around and stood there, looked at Zhang Lin, and asked straight to the point. I have discussed this matter with the fifth elder. Juniors can withdraw from the dragon sun fight, but there is a condition. 
Zhang Lin looked at the second ancestor, was silent for a long time, and then said. He had discussed this matter with old man Long Wu before. He told old man Long Wu what his second ancestor had told him before. Regarding what the second ancestor said. After old man Long Wu told Zhang Lin what happened, he thought that the second ancestor would not lie to them. Withdrawing from the Longzi fight will also allow him to enter the Nine Dragons' secret realm. This kind of thing is also a good thing. In this way, not only did they not suffer any loss, they could also get some compensation from the second ancestor. Although they don't know what the compensation is, based on old man Long Wu's understanding of the second ancestor, the compensation must be very generous. Therefore, agreeing is more cost-effective than disagreeing. Hearing this, the second ancestor frowned slightly and was a little surprised. It seemed that he did not expect that the little guy in front of him would dare to make conditions with him. However, he quickly returned to normal, looked at Zhang Lin and said, Tell me what the conditions are, as long as they are reasonable, I can consider them. As such that, Zhang Lin took a deep breath, turned to look in the direction of old man Long Wu, and then said in a deep voice, Can you let the fifth elder leave as soon as possible? Fifty years is really too long for him. Fifty years, for a young practitioner like him, it might be a splurge. But for people like old man Long Wu, who are dying and have only a short lifespan, it is simply that every year and every second is consuming the last of their time. Instead of mining the god gold here, it is better to use this last afterglow to give full play to its due value. Did you think so yourself? Or did Xiao Wu ask you to say so? The second ancestor frowned slightly when he heard Zhang Lin's words and asked. He stared at Zhang Lin closely, as if he wanted to see something in his eyes. At this moment, Zhang Lin also raised his head and looked squarely at the second ancestor in front of him, without flinching at all. Second ancestor, this is my junior's own idea. The fifth elder doesn't know about this. The two looked at each other for a long time before Zhang Lin said. After all, old man Long Wu stayed here for 50 years because of him. And looking at his appearance, Zhang Lin was really afraid that he wouldn't be able to hold on until old Long Wu arrived in 50 years. Why, little guy, some things can't be done just by talking. Not only will I not agree to your condition, but even if Xiao Wu knew about it, he wouldn't agree either. This matter is too involved and I cannot agree to it. However, the second ancestor shook his head and rejected Zhang Lin's request. On the surface, Long Wu is going to stay here for 50 years. But secretly, the things involved in this matter are really too big, and it's not something that can be easily left. This, Zhang Lin was stunned for a moment, looked at the second ancestor and said, Second ancestor, there is something in this. Enough. However, before he finished speaking, he was interrupted by the second ancestor, who then waved his hand to indicate that Zhang Lin did not need to continue speaking. Little guy, even if you ask for this, I can't agree to it. Let's go. If nothing happens, don't come back again. The second ancestor waved his hand, Zhang Lin felt his eyes go dark and felt dizzy. The next second, when he opened his eyes again, he found that he was in the medicine house at some point. In front of him, there were the first elder and the second elder. He was looking at himself with a smile on his face. This, Zhang Lin was increasingly shocked by the second ancestor's ability to reach the sky. How are you, little guy? Have you gained anything in half a year? The second elder looked at Zhang Lin, stroked his beard, and said with a smile. Zhang Lin appeared in front of them out of thin air. In their opinion, this was the method of the second ancestor. I didn't feel that surprised at all. I could only say that I was used to it. Of course, fortunately, I live up to my fate. Suppressing the surprise in his heart, Zhang Lin nodded and said. After hearing Zhang Lin's words, the second elder suddenly became happy and asked quickly, Okay, okay, Mr. Zhang. However, how many pieces of god gold have you obtained in half a year? Seeing the excitement on the second elder's face, Zhang Lin also took out the god's gold that he had obtained personally, looked at the two of them and said, I didn't have enough time, so I only got two pieces. Two dollars, two dollars is a big deal. This time, your natal Taoist soldiers can officially set off. The clan will prepare other materials for you, but I don't know what kind of Taoist weapon you want to build. The second elder took the familiar god's gold from Zhang Lin's hand, feeling the terrifying weight contained in it, 
The second elder couldn't help but ask. Is this a Taoist soldier? I want to make it into a halberd. He had some ideas in his mind about his natal Taoist soldier before. It's just that there is no time and no suitable materials, so it has been delayed. And now, with the heavenly gold and the materials provided by the Tianlong clan, he was finally able to create his own Taoist weapon. And this halberd was also the result of his careful consideration. Halberd, the leader of hundreds of soldiers. It integrates stabbing, buckling, pecking, sweeping, hooking, cutting, etc. into one body. It mainly kills and shows its sharp edge. Halber, that's not bad, but do you plan to melt these two pieces of God's gold into it? I suggest you only use one piece, and save the remaining piece for later use. The elder looked at the two pieces of heavenly gold, pondered for a moment, and then reminded him. Junior thinks so too. To build a Taoist weapon, you only need one piece. The remaining piece can be used by me for other purposes. Zhang Lin nodded. Well, that's best. Let's do this, you will come over in seven days. In the past few days, we have also prepared the refining materials for you, and the god's gold also requires us to work hard to integrate it into the Taoist weapons. You should have a good rest these days. Yes. Comma. In small world. Xiao Wu, do you regret it? The second ancestor looked at Long Wu and suddenly asked. Um, what's wrong, second ancestor? Did Mr. Zhang say something again? Long Wu looked at the second ancestor and asked doubtfully as soon as the movements in his hands stopped. Besides, these are the choices made by the juniors themselves. Where is there such a thing as regret? Hey, there's no point regretting it. This is our fate, Wu Long Mountain. Since Long Wu, Zhang Lin and others left, no one has set foot there for a long time. On this day, Zhang Lin came back. The quiet courtyard of Wulong Mountain finally had a glimmer of life. I haven't been back for a long time. Looking at this familiar courtyard, Zhang Lin was filled with emotion. It's just that the small courtyard is still a familiar small courtyard, but there are no familiar people in the small courtyard. Old man Long Wu is no longer here, and neither is the little girl Long Yu. He was still alone. Brother Zhang, suddenly, a petite figure walked out of the backyard. The man looked at Zhang Lin standing in the small courtyard and was slightly stunned, with some disbelief in his eyes. Xiao Yuer, Zhang Lin was stunned when he saw who was coming. Apparently he didn't expect to meet her. I still remember that the last time I saw Xiao Yuer was half a year ago, almost a year ago. Brother Zhang, after recognizing Zhang Lin, Long Yu also ran towards Zhang Lin with joy on his face. When he was about to approach Zhang Lin, he jumped up suddenly, hugged him, and kissed him hard on the face. Brother Zhang, you are finally back. Xiao Yuer, I miss you every day. I can't sleep because of it. After Long Yu finished speaking, his eyes were filled with sparkling color, and his beautiful eyes were watery. Seeing this scene, Zhang Lin felt sour in his heart. He gently hugged Long Yu into his arms, patted her shoulders and comforted her, Okay, okay, we are now a big girl, don't cry. Besides, brother, isn't he back now? Um, Long Yu hugged Zhang Lin tightly, then raised his head, looked at Zhang Lin's face, and couldn't help but laugh, with a smile as bright as a flower. By the way, Xiao Long Yu, why are you here? Zhang Lin also asked, holding Long Yu in his arms. When Long Yu heard this, he curled his lips and said a little aggrievedly, you and fifth grandpa are gone, and there is no one to play with me anymore. I will come back every few days to see if you are back. Who knew it would be more than half a year ago? Xiaolong Yu said with a grieved expression. Zhang Lin was also helpless. There's really nothing you can do about this little girl. But, brother Zhang, when you come back this time, how long will you stay here? Can you please not leave? The little girl asked again. Good, brother won't leave this time. Let's have some fun with my Xiao Yuer for a few days, okay? Seeing the red eyes and Xiao Long Yu's expression of, if you don't agree, I'll cry immediately, Zhang Lin could only agree reluctantly. These days, he has nothing to do anyway. Play with her and take a break. Yeah, after hearing Zhang Lin's promise, Xiao Long Yu's face turned red and he also showed a bright smile. Put Xiao Long Yu down, intending to let her come down and walk on her own. But after Long Yu came down, he grabbed Zhang Lin's big hand and was unwilling to let go. Zhang Lin was also a little helpless. However, during this time, besides spending time with Xiaolongyu, 
he also had other things to do. In the past six months, apart from mining the god's gold there, although there was no change in his cultivation, it had secretly strengthened his cultivation. Long Ji Yu, Xiao Yu'er's younger brother, should be back in about half a year. By then, the matter of the second elder should also come to an end. But what happens next? What will he do next? He withdrew from the Dragon Sun War, what will he do next? Moreover, the final result of the battle between Long Zi will be nine years later. Only after Long Zi appears will the Nine Dragons' secret realm be opened. It will still be a long time. The time in between, return to Qingyun Holy Land, or stay here, just walked into the backyard. Zhang Lin's footsteps stopped. He looked at the figure inside. The man was lying on the couch with his eyes closed, seemingly asleep. He looked down at Xiao Long Yu again, feeling a little surprised. Dragon King Long Yao. But Zhang Lin quickly reacted, holding Long Yu's little hand and walking in. Came back, hearing their movements, Dragon King Long Yao slowly opened his eyes. Looking at Zhang Lin, he asked. Then he looked at Long Yu again. On the way, I also saw Zhang Lin holding Long Yu's hand, his eyes moving slightly, not knowing what he was thinking. Junior Zhang Lin has met the Dragon King. Just came back today. Zhang Lin replied with a smile. Dragon King Long Yao just smiled when he heard this and did not continue to speak. But the dragon language in Zhang Lin's hand gave Long Yao a grimace. Zhang Lin saw all this, but couldn't help but laugh. Second ancestor also told me what happened. What are your plans next? After a long time, the Dragon King spoke again. This question also made Zhang Lin somewhat silent. To be honest, he didn't think about what to do next. Just now, he was thinking about this issue too. After that incident is over, you can go to the Heaven Pass with Guer. There are abundant opportunities in Tianguan, which can quickly improve your cultivation. Tianguan, Imperial Tianguan. Dragon King Long Yao's words made Zhang Lin silent. It's not like he hasn't thought about breaking through the Heaven Pass. However, he didn't really want to break into the sky so early. No matter what, I have to go to the King's Realm and then break through the Heavenly Pass. This Junior has also thought about breaking into the Heavenly Pass, but you also know that this Junior's strength is really a bit low. Zhang Lin shrugged and could only explain it this way. The sixth level of Tianxuan is very low. You sure? Your boy's strength, the sixth level of Tianxuan, is no weaker than the eighth or ninth level of Tianxuan. After hearing Zhang Lin's words, Dragon King Long Yao glanced at him inexplicably, and then said. When Zhang Lin heard this, he smiled bitterly. Are you sure you don't want to go? Long Yao asked again, with a strange light flashing in his eyes. Looking at the Dragon King like this, Zhang Lin also looked puzzled. What does this guy want to do? I won't go. I'll wait until this junior reaches the king's realm soon. No matter what, Zhang Lin shook his head firmly and refused. After saying that, he took Xiao Yuer and turned around and walked towards the front yard. On the contrary, Dragon King Long Yao, who was lying there, nodded. However, the corners of his mouth outlined a meaningful arc. Suddenly he spoke again. By the way, I seem to have heard that the saint from Qingyun Holy Land is also breaking into the Heavenly Pass. I heard from Uncle Wu that that girl has a good relationship with you, very good. As soon as he heard the news about the saint of Qingyun Holy Land, Zhang Lin steps and stopped immediately. He turned his head and looked at Dragon King Long Yao, who was lying on the recliner with his eyes closed and silent. This, Junior, I thought about it carefully. Although it is difficult to break through the sky barrier, it is not difficult. Junior wants to give it a try. Have you thought about it? The Dragon King, Long Yao, looked at Zhang Lin with interest in his eyes full of amusement. Think about it. Zhang Lin met the Dragon King's eyes with his firm eyes. He confirmed towards Dragon King Long Yao. He just suddenly figured it out. He thought that breaking into the Heaven Pass was the most suitable thing for him. He was in trouble just now and thought he was too weak now. Now he has figured it out. His strength is not weak, it is just a small sky gate, how can he stop him? All the dragons and powerful enemies are just floating clouds. Didn't take them seriously at all. Well, just think about it. No one is forcing you. A meaningful smile appeared on the Dragon King's lips. No, no one forced me, it's just that the junior suddenly figured it out. 
my generation of monks are always going against the will of heaven. This difficulty will not trouble the younger generation. Hearing Long Yao's words, Zhang Lin shook his head, with a hint of determination in his eyes. Now, no one can stop his determination. He didn't change his mind because of the news he heard just now. Absolutely not. Okay, okay, I really saw you right. I knew you, kid, are not the type to be knocked down easily. Dragon King Long Yao also showed relief in his eyes. Very good. Brother Zhang, do you miss Sister Qingyao? Suddenly, the sound of dragon language came from below. A cute smile hung on his face, and he looked at Zhang Lin curiously and asked. Forehead, of course not. Brother is daring to challenge difficulties. Xiaolong Yu, please don't talk nonsense. Hearing this, a hint of embarrassment flashed across Zhang Lin's face, but he quickly explained. He he, quote comma comma quote, Xiao Yu er smiled, with an expression that I understood. Seeing this, Zhang Lin felt that children are really not cute. Especially the weird one like Xiaolong Yu. Ha ha. Okay, you er, come here. As a father, I have something to tell you. Zhang Lin also needs to practice. Long Yao looked at Long Yu, laughed, and greeted her. Xiao Long Yu nodded and walked obediently to Long Yao. Seeing this, Zhang Lin also walked out very wisely, leaving this place to the two of them. Chuang Tian Pass, did Qing Yao also go? Lying on the recliner in the front yard, Zhang Lin thought of what Long Yao said to him. Although he knew that Qing Yao would definitely go to Tianguan in the future, he did not expect that it would happen so early. What did he think? She would have to wait until the king's realm before breaking into the heavenly pass. You guessed it right. Still, it's not bad. After he also went to the Tianguan Pass, he believed that the two of them would be able to meet again soon. In his hand, he was still rubbing the projection jade pendant he got from old man Long Wu. The cool wind blew over his body, making him feel very comfortable. Qing Yao, wait for me. We will meet again soon. Xie Qing Yao's figure appeared in Zhang Lin's mind involuntarily, and there was a hint of tenderness in his eyes. At the same time, inside Qingyun Holy Land, Master, I heard from people in the Holy Land that Saint Xie Qing Yao and Saint Chen Xuan went to break through the Heaven Pass. In a cave, a figure sat cross-legged and said secretly in his heart, Have they already gone to the Heaven Pass? But after all, the strength of the two of them is almost the same. Suddenly, in front of the figure, a phantom slowly appeared out of thin air. The old man was floating in the air, stroking his illusory beard, with a bit of thinking in his eyes. Disciple, you still have to work hard. Tianguan, you have to go and break through. Only when you pass the Tianguan can you be the real genius and the real strong. If you want to become an emperor, you must go to Tianguan. Unfortunately, your current strength is still too low. He sighed with a bit of regret in his eyes. The look he looked at Zhou Tian felt a little pity. If Zhou Tian had the cultivation level of Tianxuan realm, then he could try to break through the Tianxuan realm. But now he is only at the fourth level of the Earth Profound realm, and is still far away from the Tian Zan realm. Well, master, I will continue to work hard. Strive to break through to the Tianxuan realm as soon as possible. That person was Zhou Tian. Zhou Tian looked at the master in front of him and secretly encouraged him. He is no longer the weak young man he once was. Only after he came to Qingyun Holy Land did he truly understand the shallow face of this world. He also knew about Tianguan. Master, I want to go out and practice. Zhou Tian looked at the old man in front of him and directly expressed his thoughts. There was a strong desire to fight in his eyes, which was a bit urgent. After hearing Zhou Tian's words, the old man's eyes flashed with surprise. Good. Immediately, the old man nodded and agreed directly. He agreed with going out to practice. Only fighting can stimulate the hidden potential of the human body. He didn't worry at all about letting his disciples go out to practice. He has cared about his disciples since he was a child, especially now, he is even more aware of his disciples' strength. Comma. Seven days passed in a blink of an eye. During these seven days, Zhang Lin played with the weird dragon language from time to time, and practiced silently at night, trying hard to make up for the shortcomings of the past six months. Especially in the near future, he was going to break through the heavenly pass, which also gave him the idea of cultivating as soon as possible and making a breakthrough as soon as possible. 
The sixth level of Tianxuan is still too weak. Strive to break through to the eighth level of Tianxuan before going to the Heavenly Pass. You must know that he is at the peak of the sixth level of Tianxuan. It's very, very close to the eighth level of Tianxuan. Breaking through two realms in half a year shouldn't be too much, right? Um, not much. Boy Zhang, come to Yaolu. Suddenly, the great elder's voice sounded from all around and reached Zhang Lin's ears. Zhang Lin, who was lying on the recliner, heard the great elder's words. He stood up suddenly, with an excited look in his eyes. Is it finally starting? Without any time to think, Zhang Lin stood up instantly and flew towards the second elder's medicine house. It turned into a divine rainbow, and its speed was even faster than before. He became excited when he thought that his natal Taoist soldier was about to be born. And when he has his own Taoist soldiers, he believes that his strength will definitely be greatly improved again. Excited, Zhang Lin quickly arrived at the medicine house on the 15th floor of the Danyu Pagoda. At this time, the first elder and the second elder were not the only ones in the medicine house. The third elder, the sixth elder, and even the dragon king Long Yao are also here. Obviously, they also attach great importance to Zhang Lin's creation of natal Taoist soldiers. God Jin, I'll leave it to you all. Otherwise, I might not be able to do it in my lifetime just by relying on that kid. Chapter 81 Junior Zhang Lin wants to see you. Outside Yao Lu, Zhang Lin stood outside the door and shouted respectfully. The next second, the voice of the second elder came from inside. Come in. Hearing the second elder's voice, Zhang Lin opened the door and walked in. In the medicine house, everyone was sitting aside, quietly waiting for his arrival. I have met the dragon king, the great elder, the second elder, the third elder, and the sixth elder. No gift. As soon as Zhang Lin came in, he saw several elders sitting there, and he quickly saluted. At the same time, there are also some doubts in my heart. Just refining a natal Taoist weapon, why are there so many elders here? It doesn't seem like that, right? Little guy, did you see a few of us here and think it's a bit like stirring up an army? The second elder and the others looked at Zhang Lin, nodded, and all smiled. Then it was the second elder who spoke. Yes, that's true. Zhang Lin also nodded candidly. This junior didn't expect that several elders would actually come, so I was a little bit shocked. Ha ha, little guy, we not only mobilized our troops, we even had some expectations. I hope that this time, you can bring us an unexpected surprise. The god's gold and this rare material are all for your destiny as a Taoist soldier. The third elder also said with a smile, with a hint of expectation on his face. It is not common to see natal Taoist soldiers made of heavenly gold. Although they have the god's gold mountain, there are countless amounts of god's gold in it. However, that place is not accessible to ordinary people. And even if you get in, whether you can mine it is still a question. Therefore, it is extremely rare for Zhang Lin to be able to mine god gold in that small world. Okay, no more talking nonsense, now that everyone is here. Then let's get started. The great elder looked at a few people, smiled slightly, and then spoke. Um, after hearing the great elder's words, several people nodded. Zhang Lin, are you ready? The great elder looked at Zhang Lin with a smile and asked. When Zhang Lin heard this, he was slightly stunned. Then he nodded quickly and said, Junior, you are all ready. Then let's go. The great elder changed his appearance as he waved his hand. The surrounding environment changed instantly. The house that was originally in Yalu turned into a void in an instant. Zhang Lin looked here confused, not understanding what was going on. The void was vast, and the surroundings were filled with tyrannical spiritual energy, but the location he was in was in a dark void. Here, it's like a black hole, swallowing everything around it. The surrounding space is even more distorted. Just right here. The first elder sealed the surrounding space and nodded to the second elder. The second elder also understood what the first elder meant. Countless rare materials kept flying out from the hands of the second elder. Suspended above and around everyone. Gentian stone, nine cloud gold, tomb expelling liquid. Looking at the refining materials above, Zhang Lin opened his mouth wide and shouted out names one by one. Each of these materials is a rare material. Taken out individually, they are all things that can cause a huge sensation. However, 
Now, they are placed in front of them one by one. Boy Zhang, how are you? These things are good, right? The third elder looked at Zhang Lin's shocked look and was secretly proud of himself. You know, these are also extremely valuable in their dragon treasure house. They took out these things to compensate Zhang Lin on the other hand. Zhang Lin withdrew from the Longzi controversy. They also heard from the second ancestor and others about this matter. And even the second ancestor said that in 10 years, Long Ji Yu will definitely not be Zhang Lin's opponent. If Zhang Lin doesn't give up, then he will definitely be the next dragon son, or even the dragon king. Therefore, since Zhang Lin gave up the fight with Long Ji Yu, Zhang Lin could not be made to feel disadvantaged in other aspects. They try to make up for him in every aspect, which is also the result of their secret communication. This is why so many rare materials were placed in front of Zhang Lin. Zhang Lin took a deep breath, then slowly exhaled it, looked at the second elder and Long Yaoshan, nodded, and then said, Thank you all, elders. But these materials, when used on juniors, are they overkill? Zhang Lin's eyes sparkled, he looked at Long Yaoshan and the second elder, and said, Hearing this, the great elder immediately smiled. Ha ha ha, don't worry. Today, a few of us will help you forge a peerless Taoist weapon. Boy Zhang, let me lend you the black flame of glory. The second elder moved his fingers, and the radiant black flames released by Zhang Lin flew out instantly and floated next to the second elder, emitting scorching heat. Edict, the glorious black flame surged and became nearly a hundred feet long in the blink of an eye. The blazing black flames bloomed with dazzling brilliance in the void, like a small sun. Black flames surged into the sky, illuminating the entire space extremely red. Melt, countless rare materials for refining the weapons above, guided by the second elder's single-minded focus, flew towards the radiant black flames that exuded a scorching aura. In an instant, countless materials were integrated into the glorious black flames, leaving no trace. Zhang Lin stared at this scene closely. At this moment, a burst of excitement arose in his heart, and at the same time, he was also a little nervous. The natal Taoist soldier is today. In the hands of the second elder, the power of the radiant black flame increased exponentially. Zhang Lin looked at the dazzling black flames and secretly sighed in his heart. Even a quasi-saint level warrior might not be able to withstand such burning power. Boy, just watch, the refined Taoist weapons will definitely exceed your expectations. Second brother is not only a master of alchemy, but also a master of weapon refinement. The third elder looked at Zhang Lin's appearance and said with a smile. His face was full of pride. The glorious black flames emitted raging waves of fire. Under the control of the second elder, they were constantly rolling and surging, churning in the space. Stream after stream of light burst out from those materials. Second brother's skills are still so perfect. The sixth elder also looked at the second elder with admiration and said, Boy Zhang, God Gold. The second elder, who was activating the glorious black flames, suddenly spoke fiercely. Zhang Lin did not hesitate. Throw a piece of heavenly gold towards the glorious black flame above. The legendary divine gold, the divine gold. Falling into the radiant black flames, there was no change. You must know that all the other weapon refining materials melted when they fell into the radiant black flames, but this god's gold did not change at all. Instead, it exuded a bright brilliance. As expected of god's gold. Even with this radiant black flame, I can't smelt it. The sixth elder couldn't help but sigh when he looked at the heavenly gold that had not changed in any way in the black flames of the world. The brilliant black flame is the twelfth among the divine flames of heaven and earth. It is a general weapon refining material that will melt when it encounters it and burn when it encounters it. But this heavenly gold has not changed at all. It is as if it has not melted away at all, and it still exudes a faint golden brilliance. HMPH, otherwise how could it be the legendary divine gold? If it is really that easy to be smelted, then maybe our sacred gold mountain is fake, right? The third elder couldn't help but say after hearing what the sixth elder said. Ha ha ha. When several people around him heard this, they burst into laughter. It was also expected that the god's gold would be so difficult to smelt. Their purpose here is to help the second elder smelt out the divine gold. This world glowing black flame can't even smelt the heavenly gold. Can the first few divine flames on the list of heavenly and earthly divine flames be able to smelt it? 
especially the number one eternal divine flame, how powerful is it? Zhang Lin was secretly frightened in his heart as he looked at the scene of the glorious black flame smelting the god's gold. At the same time, he thought of the legendary eternal divine flame that ranked number one. Eternal divine flame, when he was investigating the records of the divine flame of heaven and earth, he had seen records of this ranking number one. Mysterious, powerful, and unpredictable. This is the evaluation of the number one eternal divine flame in the ancient books of the Tianlong clan. According to legend, the number one eternal divine flame has spiritual intelligence and its own thinking. Moreover, coupled with its mysterious characteristics, it can swallow everything from heaven to earth. The eternal divine flame is born once every 100,000 years, and every time it is born, countless practitioners go crazy and perish for it. There are rumors that the person who obtains the eternal divine flame should be called the emperor of the world. One can imagine the horror of the eternal divine flame. Unfortunately, for countless thousands of years, there has never been any record of anyone possessing the eternal divine flame. Take action. The second elder's loud shout brought Zhang Lin back to his senses. His eyes looked at the radiant black flame again. I saw that the second elder once again raised the power of the glory black flame to a new level, and then a terrifying aura came from it and spread towards the surrounding void. Zhang Lin felt as if a huge burden had been placed on him. It was at this moment that Dragon King Long Yao, the great elder, the third elder, and the sixth elder were present. At this time, they took action at the same time. All the power was poured into the god's golden body in the glorious black flames. The power of the four saints, the four forces echo each other. The light of the god's gold became brighter and brighter, and finally exploded completely, with the power of law flowing in it, forming one vortex of law after another. Melt, under the great elder's low voice, god gold began to slowly change in the radiant black flames. The hard god gold became soft at first and gradually began to melt. The heavenly gold that melted into liquid continued to float in the void. Then, the power of law gathered and fixed it in midair again. One drop, two drops, three drops. With the joint efforts of the four great elders, the liquid of god gold soon became extremely thick. Give it to me, the second elder roared again. Various rare materials that had been smelted by the black flame of Yaoshi began to merge. It's starting to take shape. Gradually, it turned into the rough shape of a halberd in Zhang Lin's heart. Boy Zhang, essence and blood. Quick, the second elder looked at Zhang Lin and shouted. Essence and blood. Zhang Lin didn't hesitate, bit the tip of his tongue, spit out a drop of blood, and drove it into the divine halberd. After Zhang Lin's essence and blood were injected into the divine halberd, the surface of the divine halberd shone with wisps of light. Suddenly, the divine halberd began to absorb Zhang Lin's blood essence crazily. Desire, greed, it came from the god's halberd. Not enough. Come again. The second elder shouted loudly. Under the command of the second elder, Zhang Lin's blood essence was continuously absorbed by the god halberd. Buzz. At this moment, an even more majestic aura spread from the divine halberd. The next step is to fuse the god gold. The four great elders controlled the heavenly god's golden liquid to merge into the heavenly god's halberd. One drop, two drops. When all five drops of the god's golden liquid were integrated into the god's halberd, the entire god's halberd suddenly burst out with a dazzling light. There are unique lines flowing on the body surface of the divine halberd, like little snakes, lifelike. Moreover, on this divine halberd, there was a strange aura fluctuation vaguely exuding. At the same time, Zhang Lin felt in his body that he seemed to have a strange connection with the divine halberd. Finally finished. Looking at the finished forging of the divine halberd, the second elder also exhaled slowly. Then he dispersed the radiant black flames. Show the true appearance of the god's halberd in front of everyone. A black gold halberd, with some golden lines entwined on the surface of the halberd. Sharp and sharp, with a hint of chill. What a peerless halberd. The pale-faced elders and others looked at the divine halberd and couldn't help but admire it. Integrated with countless rare materials and the legendary divine gold, this divine halberd has perfectly reached the level of a holy weapon. Even in comparison, many holy weapons cannot compare with this divine halberd. Whose holy weapon has divine gold? Who can really be extravagant? Not to mention luxury, you must know about divine gold. Most saints do not necessarily have a piece of divine gold. 
This time the forging task is completed. The great elder looked at the peerless halberd in his hand and said with a smile. This divine halberd was successfully forged by several of them after a lot of effort. Not only the great elder looked pale, but also the dragon king, the second elder, and the third elder all looked pale. It seems that this process is very simple, but the difficulty is beyond imagination. Looking at the spear that exuded a cold aura, Zhang Lin's eyes were filled with excitement. This is his natal Taoist weapon, a natal Taoist weapon that only belongs to him. It only needs to be cultivated carefully for a period of time before it can be used perfectly. Boy Zhang, it's not bad. In my opinion, this Taoist soldier is like a pearl covered in dust in your hands. Even if the saint comes, I'm afraid his heart will be moved. The second elder pulled the divine halberd and flew towards Zhang Lin. Then he joked, but what the second elder said was also true. This god's halberd, made from countless rare materials and god's gold, would make even a saint jealous when he saw it. Reaching out to hold the divine halberd, Zhang Lin felt a blood connection in his heart. This halberd is everything to him. The moment he held the divine halberd, he could feel the emotions of the divine halberd. The god's halberd seemed to be very excited, vibrating slightly and making a soft sound. Good, god halberd. Zhang Lin held the god's halberd tightly in his hand and looked at the god's halberd in his hand. The next second, under the control of Zhang Lin's thoughts, the divine halberd turned into a stream of light and sank into his dantian. Together with the golden dragon halberd and dragon beads in his body, they coexist in his dantian. How about it? The elders and the elders all looked at Zhang Lin with smiles on their faces. No matter what, they were very satisfied with this divine halberd. After all, it was forged with so many rare materials and even divine gold. This divine halberd is much stronger than ordinary holy weapons. This result has exceeded the junior's expectations. First elder, second elder, thank you for your hard work. Zhang Lin said with a smile on his face. He no longer knew how to evaluate his natal Taoist weapon, the divine halberd. This can no longer be described by just two words, satisfaction. This is simply awesome, ha ha, let's go, let's go back. Once the Taoist weapons have been successfully refined, there is no need to stay here any longer. Um, the first elder, second elder and third elder nodded. It was the great elder who waved his sleeves and everyone disappeared from the void. Only traces of the surrounding areas burned by the glorious black flames were left, and the twisted space. Comma, three days later. The seventh level of Tianxuan will definitely break through today. In a cave, Zhang Lin sat cross-legged on the ground, closed his eyes, and quietly operated the technique. In the cave, there were also thunderous sounds of tigers and leopards. Behind Zhang Lin, there was a huge shadow crawling there. The huge phantom of the sky dragon exudes terrifying pressure. As the body rose and fell, bursts of rumbling sounds were heard, which was deafening. At the same time, a lot of spiritual energy gathered. Boom, there are traces of thunder shining on the body of the celestial dragon's phantom. Suddenly, the spiritual energy in the surrounding heaven and earth seemed to be drawn by some kind of pull, and they gathered together and submerged into Zhang Lin's body. Zhang Lin's aura interacted with the phantom of the heavenly dragon behind him. Hu Hu, as the spiritual energy between heaven and earth entered, Zhang Lin's breathing became more and more rapid. Under the operation of eternal breathing method, beads of sweat the size of peas were rolling down on his forehead. Boom, in Zhang Lin's dantian, the purple gold brilliance began to spin crazily. Boom, the purple gold brilliance bloomed suddenly, swallowing up all the spiritual energy around him, and then violently impacted Zhang Lin's body. Break, the barrier of the seventh layer of Zan that day suddenly shattered into pieces at this moment. Boom, boom. At this moment, the purple gold ocean in Zhang Lin's dantian began to churn violently. The purple gold light was roaring like a tsunami. Behind him, there are scenes such as dragons flying across the sky, the sun and moon reaching the sky, and stars falling. Boom, 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 the purple gold ocean is constantly boiling, one wave higher than the next. Just the next second, many strange phenomena disappeared completely and the purple gold ocean and surging waves in the Dantian gradually calmed down and returned to their original state. Finally, the breakthrough was successful. Feeling the majestic energy fluctuations in his body, Zhang Lin couldn't help but be happy. 
Nearly a year has passed since he broke through to the sixth level of Tianxuan. This can be said to be the slowest period of time in which his realm has improved. Brother Zhang, have you made a breakthrough? Outside the cave, Long Yu felt that the powerful aura in the cave had restrained, and he couldn't help but ask loudly inside. She has been waiting for Brother Zhang for a long time. She still wanted to play with Brother Zhang. I couldn't help but stretched out my hand and patted the door of the cave. Why is there no movement? Is there something wrong? Some time ago, I heard that someone went into retreat and became a master. No. Long Yu patted the door, but saw no movement. The news I heard some time ago suddenly came to mind. His face instantly became anxious, and there was a worried look in his eyes. Brother Zhang, he shouted, trying to force his way in. That is when Long Yu was about to open the door. The closed door suddenly opened, revealing Zhang Lin's handsome face. Okay okay, I heard it. After Zhang Lin came out, he looked at Xiaolong Yu who had been guarding outside and said with a little helplessness. We, aren't you worried about brother Zhang? Xiaolong Yu breathed a sigh of relief when he saw Zhang Lin walking out intact. Then, she pouted her lips unconvinced and said, Brother Zhang, I've been waiting for you for a long time. Okay, okay, it's my brother's fault. How's it going? Zhang Lin took advantage of the situation and took Xiaolong Yu's outstretched hand and walked there with her. Then my brother wants to have a fun day with me, all is compensation for me, how about that? Feeling the warmth of Zhang Lin's big hands, Xiaolong Yu also showed a smile on his face and said happily. No problem, I just can't do anything to you. Zhang Lin shrugged his shoulders and said with a smile. Comma, another breakthrough. This cultivation speed is so fast. Yes, it has only been a while since I reached the seventh level of Tianxuan. The second ancestor was right. I'm afraid it won't be long before Zhang Xiaozi will catch up with Guer, or even surpass Guer. Danyu Pagoda, Yao Lujong, the first elder and the second elder were sitting there. I also felt the aura of Zhang Lin's breakthrough. Since Mr. Zhang has broken through, let him challenge the tower. By the way, let him consolidate his cultivation. The great elder said while stroking his beard. Um. The second elder smiled and nodded. In half a year, my old son will be back. I really wonder what it will be like when the two of them meet. And that matter, how are you preparing for it? The first elder suddenly asked the second elder. During the first two sentences, there was a smile on his face. By the end, the smile disappeared instantly. There was also a hint of solemnity in the depths of his eyes. After hearing the eldest brother mention this matter, the second elder stopped drinking the tea in his hand. His expression was also solemn. We're almost ready, we just need to wait for my old son to come back. That's it. The second elder pondered. Very good. The great elder nodded, with a smile on his face. Speaking of which, it's time to restrain Xiao Yuer. She should also grow up and not just pamper her. When my old daughter comes back, let me take her to practice. Thinking of the girl Long Yu again, the great elder said helplessly. They doted on the girl Long Yu to the extreme. Challenge Tower. As the name suggests, it is a training place specially built by the Tianlong clan in order to cultivate disciples and geniuses within the clan. There are countless practicing puppets and puppet warriors inside. They range from as low as the body forging realm to as high as the straight king realm. It's just that the higher the realm, the fewer the number of puppets. Just like the puppets in the king's mirror, you can count them all in just two hands in the challenge tower. After all, the materials used by the king level puppets are extremely rare. Otherwise, they would not be able to withstand the destruction of the king level powerful ones. Is this the challenge tower? Looking at the giant tower in front of him, Zhang Lin's face was filled with excitement. The challenge tower stands alone, mainly because it is so huge. This challenge tower towers into the sky and takes on an octagonal shape. There are countless complicated patterns carved on it. It was a combination of countless formation patterns. Protecting the challenge tower. Not only that, but that's just the surface. No one knows how many killing formations are hidden in the void. Zhang Lin estimated that even a strong person in the king realm could drink a pot of it when he came. Boy, what are you still doing standing there? Come here quickly. The person guarding the challenge tower today is the fourth elder. The fourth elder looked at Zhang Lin, 
who was not far away and had been sizing up the challenge tower, and shouted to him. I called him here to let him break into the tower, not to see the scenery. Fourth Elder. Being treated like this by the fourth elder, Zhang Lin also took his thoughts back. There was also a hint of embarrassment on his face. He quickly stepped forward and said respectfully to the fourth elder. I know, I'll come in right away. Zhang Lin quickly replied. Go to the eighth floor. There are puppets from the Tianxuan realm there. Don't play down there, these puppets are very troublesome to make. The fourth elder lying there rolled his eyes at Zhang Lin, then threw him a token and said. Zhang Lin caught the token and found that it was a bronze token with the inscription on the surface shining with the light of the formation. It looks quite quaint. Fourth elder, the eighth level is a puppet of the Tianxuan realm. Does that mean that the ninth level is a puppet of the king realm? Zhang Lin's eyes moved, and then he came behind the fourth elder and put his hands on the fourth elder's shoulders. Go up, help the fourth elder to massage, and ask with a smile. Enjoying Zhang Lin's massage, the fourth elder also closed his eyes and enjoyed it. After hearing Zhang Lin's words, the fourth elder also nodded and said, This is natural, but the ninth level is difficult. You can go and have a look. But the level of danger there is also very high. And with your strength, you can't be the opponent of the king level puppet, so see if you can, don't go looking for trouble. For fear that Zhang Lin might be tempted to go to the ninth floor to find puppets of the king realm, the fourth elder also reminded him seriously. Don't worry, fourth elder, I won't do it. You know me, I'm not the kind of person who looks for trouble. Zhang Lin quickly shook his head, patted his chest and promised. Little slippery man, hurry up. The fourth elder shook his head. He didn't believe a word of Zhang Lin's words, but he still gave Zhang Lin a few words. Afterwards, Zhang Lin also walked towards the challenge tower. Hey, this kid. After Zhang Lin entered the challenge tower, the fourth elder sighed helplessly. However, I was still a little worried, fearing that he would really do something wrong. His mind paid close attention to Zhang Lin, so that whenever something went wrong, he would be able to take action in time. Comma. The other side. Challenge the tower. Inside and outside the tower. What a difference. Without paying too much attention to the bottom floor, Zhang Lin walked straight towards the eighth floor as soon as he entered the challenge tower. At the junction of each layer and the next layer, there is a transparent light mask. To prevent some disciples with low cultivation level from breaking in rashly. However, Zhang Lin had the token given by the fourth elder, and these lights in front of him were as if they were fake and could not stop him at all. Zhang Lin went straight to the eighth floor. On the way, I also met some other disciples. After seeing Zhang Lin, they couldn't help but stop and look at Zhang Lin with interest, their eyes full of curiosity. They are all very familiar with this person. Everyone in the clan was talking about him before. In particular, he occupied a spot in Huolong Pond. It even caused an uproar among the disciples within the clan. After all, there are only a few places in Huolong Pond, and Zhang Lin, an outsider, suddenly occupied one. This suddenly leaves them with one less competitive spot. What should they do? Therefore, this matter could not help but make many disciples feel unhappy. But when they found out about Longku, none of them were Zhang Lin's opponents. Even Sister Bi Yu Ru said that Zhang Lin was very powerful. This also changed their impression of Zhang Lin drastically. Don't dare to despise him anymore. Of course, Zhang Lin didn't know these disciples, but he had heard some rumors about him. Regarding this, Zhang Lin had an indifferent attitude. Unfamiliar, in spite of, as you wish, he came to the Tianlong clan just for the Nine Dragon Glazed Grass. If it weren't for Nine Dragon Glazed Grass, I'm afraid he wouldn't have come to the Tianlong clan. Just as the second ancestor said, his heart is not here. Not in the Tianlong clan. The higher up, the fewer disciples there are in the tower. Especially after reaching the eighth floor, there were less than a hundred disciples left around. Moreover, the strength of most of the disciples is only at the top three levels of Tianxuan realm. There are also relatively few disciples after the third level. Not paying attention to the gazes around him, Zhang Lin went to find the puppet room according to the fourth elder's token. But what surprised him was that he didn't expect to meet an acquaintance here. Wrong, it should be said, a person who can barely be called a friend. Burro, Zhang Lin looked at the woman walking towards this side and opened his mouth slightly. 
After all, the two of them had met a few times and were able to chat a few words. Ha, huh, your realm. Bi Yu Ru obviously recognized Zhang Lin, but the next second, she was stunned. You know, the last time they met, Zhang Lin was only at the third level of Tianxuan. And now, she actually didn't notice Zhang Lin's cultivation. There are only two reasons for this situation. First, Zhang Lin's level has improved too quickly and is already higher than hers. That's why she couldn't detect his state. The second is that Zhang Lin has something that can hide his cultivation level and cover it up. However, she felt that it should be the former. Although she was not very familiar with Zhang Lin, she thought Zhang Lin would not be like this. This is her intuition. What's more, she felt that Zhang Lin's aura was unfathomable. Your realm, Bi Yu Ru looked at Zhang Lin and couldn't help but ask. It's nothing, it's just that I have made some breakthroughs during this period. Zhang Lin also nodded slightly, and he seemed very indifferent to Bi Yu Ru's question. It's like talking about an innocuous thing. But when Bi Yu Ru heard it, it was completely different. In an instant, her pupils shrank suddenly, but huge waves arose in her heart, and she stared at Zhang Lin with a shocked expression. What he said was a bit too casual. What is called is just a breakthrough. This is a breakthrough from the third level of Tianxuan to at least the sixth level of Tianxuan. Can it be called just a breakthrough? This is simply a little too Versailles. But she didn't say anything. But he was still shocked and surprised by Zhang Lin's cultivation speed. How long has it been since? It's only been a year and a half, and Zhang Lin has already reached this level. Such an improvement would be too scary. If he was given a few more years, he might even be able to break through to the realm of kings, right? Are you also here to challenge the battle puppet? Trying hard to suppress the shock in her heart, Bi Yu Ru looked at Zhang Lin and asked tentatively. Well, I just broke through and it's time to consolidate my cultivation. Hearing this, Zhang Lin nodded and spoke frankly without any intention of hiding anything. Forehead, hearing Zhang Lin's words, Bi Yu Ru suddenly didn't know what to say. Just made a breakthrough and consolidated your cultivation. Every sentence is Versailles. Okay, I won't disturb you anymore. I'm leaving first. Afraid that Zhang Lin would say anything about Versailles again, Baro hurriedly said goodbye and left. She found out and was determined not to chat with Zhang Lin. It was too Versailles, and every word struck her heart at all times. Zhang Lin looked at Bi Yu Ru's leaving figure and felt a little strange in his heart. They had a good chat just now, but why were they leaving suddenly? He shook his head secretly and thought to himself, women are really weird. Then he continued walking towards a certain challenge room. Finally, at the end of this floor, Zhang Lin also found the challenge room represented on the token. He opened the door straight and walked in. Close the door. Zhang Lin then took stock of the challenge room. The challenge room is huge. Although there are no windows, it is still very bright inside. I don't know what material the wall is made of. Anyway, when Zhang Lin's spiritual consciousness entered, he found that his spiritual consciousness could not penetrate the wall at all and could only be blocked outside. Tisk, tisk, it's quite strong. Zhang Lin laughed and reached out to touch the wall gently. Suddenly, Zhang Lin felt a thick, dull feeling. With a little force, there was no damage to the wall at all. This made him slightly stunned and a little surprised. You know, his physical strength is comparable to that of a king. But this is better, as it allows him to use his power arbitrarily. The next step is to see how the battle puppet is doing. The center of the challenge room. There was a figure standing there, motionless. That's the battle puppet. At a glance, one can see that this battle puppet is two feet tall. His whole body was dark and covered with various patterns of runes. There was no expression or look on his face just standing there all alone. Battle puppet, although there is only one here. However, he can use the power of the corresponding realm according to the challenger's requirements. For example, if Zhang Lin orders the battle puppet to use the strength of the seventh level of Tianxuan, then the battle puppet will exert the strength of the seventh level of Tianxuan. If he is ordered to use the strength of peak Tianxuan, then he will also upgrade his realm to the realm of peak Tianxuan. Moreover, the attack power of this battle puppet is definitely not weak. Even the defense of the battle puppet is abnormal. After all, they are all made from special materials. It won't be destroyed that easily. In terms of strength, they are also very powerful. 
After all, they have no consciousness or pain, they only know how to fight. I am also at the seventh level of the Tianxuan realm now, so I will try my strength at the eighth level of the Tianxuan realm first. Looking at the battle puppet, Zhang Lin held his chin and thought secretly in his heart. Tianyi, use the strength of the eighth level of Tianxuan to attack me. After Zhang Lin made up his mind, he ordered the battle puppet. On the chest of the puppet, the word, Tianyi, is engraved. This is the name of this battle puppet. After hearing Zhang Lin's order, the battle puppet called, Tianyi, was officially activated at this time. Red light suddenly appeared in the originally dull pupils. A violent wave suddenly erupted from the battle puppet's body. Buzz. The next moment, the, Tianyi, puppet turned into a stream of light and attacked Zhang Lin. Boom. Although the battle puppet is taller, it is not bulky at all. On the contrary, he was very agile, and in the flash of his body, he actually brought up bursts of strong wind. The punch fell, and the entire space seemed to tremble. Fortunately, special materials are used here, so there is no need to worry about these. Even if Zhang Lin uses all his strength, he may not be able to destroy this place. Seeing the power of the battle puppet, Zhang Lin nodded slightly, with a flash of appreciation in his eyes. Yes, this combat puppet did not disappoint me and indeed had a high combat power. The next second, the battle puppet appeared in front of him, and a big hand, like an eagle's claw, grabbed him. Bang! However, Zhang Lin quickly kicked out, and a whip leg swept out, hitting the combat puppet's waist hard, and kicked him away several meters, almost falling to the ground. However, the battle puppet was not injured at all. And he pounced on Zhang Lin again. The speed is not affected at all. Interesting, I was not disappointed. Zhang Lin narrowed his eyes and sneered, while a strong aura erupted from his body. But he didn't use his spiritual power. Instead, he directly used his physical power to defeat this combat puppet. Bang! Click! In an instant, the fists of Zhang Lin and the battle puppet collided. Boom! A strong wave of energy emanated from the center of their confrontation. However, no matter how loud their movements were, they did not cause any damage to the challenge room. And the moment Zhang Lin took over the battle puppet, he clearly felt how powerful the battle puppet was. In the same realm, in hand-to-hand -hand combat, I'm afraid not many people can be the opponent of the battle puppet. Without thinking too much, Zhang Lin also looked squarely at this battle puppet. The indestructible battle puppet was blown away again and again under Zhang Lin's attacks. But he still looked fearless. The battle puppet, which had no emotion and no sense of pain, struck again and again, charging towards Zhang Lin. However, as the fighting time increased, Zhang Lin discovered something different. That was the battle puppet, Tianyi. His attacks became more and more methodical, the rhythm became faster and more fierce, and the attack range became wider and wider. That's what makes it interesting. When Zhang Lin discovered this, his eyes lit up and he was very excited. Although the attack of the previous combat puppet looked extremely ferocious, it also had flaws. That's too dull, which Zhang Lin doesn't like very much. However, now, the battle puppet's moves are organized and can also launch attacks, so Zhang Lin is even more excited. As he swung his fists, streaks of fist light also burst out from within the fist edge, attacking the fighting puppet nonstop. Under that fist light, the surrounding space seemed to be shattered. Bang bang, boom, Zhang Lin and the battle puppet were both physically colliding crazily. Every punch punched out would produce a violent sonic boom. Two figures, one tall and one thin, were constantly intertwined and fighting together. Bang, a fist gang collided with another fist gang. Suddenly, an explosion sounded, and the space seemed to be distorted. Is this really a battle puppet? Zhang Lin became more and more frightened as he fought. Taking advantage of the slightest moment of retreat, he looked at the battle puppet in confusion. From being stiff at the beginning, to being flexible now, he even recognized some of the moves. After old man Long Wu taught him some moves of the Tianlong clan before, he also practiced some of them. But today the battle puppet displayed it, but he was a little confused. Is this really a battle puppet? If that's true, how many people can actually beat it? Thinking room. However, the battle puppet suddenly appeared behind Zhang Lin with strange steps. Its big hands, like iron pliers, grabbed Zhang Lin's neck directly. This grasp was so strong that the air seemed to be torn with an explosion. 
It was under this move that Zhang Lin's expression changed. He actually found that his body was completely unable to escape. He even felt a sense of crisis. Something weird. This is no ordinary battle puppet. In an instant, spiritual power circulated in Zhang Lin's body. Hidden under the clothes, four true dragon patterns vaguely appeared on the body. And under the background of the true dragon pattern, Zhang Lin's whole aura suddenly rose. Boom boom boom. Zhang Lin's body, however, twisted directly into the combat puppet's arm in a strange twisting manner. Boom. The battle puppet also made a dull roar when it was hit. However, unusually, he only swayed for a moment and did not fly backwards like before. Zhang Lin took this opportunity to quickly distance the two of them. Weird, so weird. Zhang Lin, who had distanced himself, was more convinced by the abnormal behavior of this battle puppet that there was definitely something weird about this puppet. But he didn't have to think about it for too long. The battle puppet rushed forward again. He clenched his fists with both hands and struck Zhang Lin again. Ha! Zhang Lin punched out, directly colliding with the combat puppet's fist. This time, after using his spiritual power, his strength suddenly soared. The speed, power, and strength all became extremely terrifying at this moment. And this time, the battle puppet seemed to have changed again. He, who had been using his fists and palms before, suddenly started to use his kicks. One leg, like a whip, kept lashing over. Explosive sounds kept coming from the air, and the whip legs made the space vibrate with a buzzing sound. Seeing this scene, Zhang Lin also stared. Kick. The fighting puppet uses legs, and Zhang Lin also chooses to use legs. Zhang Lin's right leg was seen blasting out towards the battle puppet like lightning. Boom, the legs crossed, and there was another violent roar. This time, the battle puppet was kicked away by Zhang Lin. Zhang Lin, on the other hand, stood still, not moving at all. The two collided again, fist to fist, palm to palm, leg to leg. Between each impact, bursts of violent roaring sounds would erupt. Zhang Lin kept kicking, kicking, kicking. I don't know when, the battle between the two has reached an unimaginable level. If the challenge chamber wasn't strong enough, Zhang Lin and the battle puppet would really have to tear it down. The two of them were going crazy, going back and forth, and no one could do anything to the other. Boom, there was another loud noise, and the two figures collided together again. Comma, amazing, amazing, it's rare in the world to be able to reach this level. Challenge the tower, the fourth elder was lying on the recliner with his eyes closed, although he never opened them. But he can still see what he wants to see, just like where Zhang Lin is now. Zhang Lin's strength was too low, so his consciousness could not penetrate the walls of the challenge tower. But for old guys like them, it's easy. Zhang Lin's every move was in their consciousness. Yes, Mr. Zhang is only at the seventh level of Tianxuan right now. Even though there are restrictions in the challenge tower, it is really surprising that he can fight to this level. At this time, the two men who had also been observing Zhang Lin the elder also asked. I feel like it should be almost done. The sixth elder said. The three of them were observing Zhang Lin with their spiritual consciousness and communicating in secret. It's over. Let's see what's said about him. The secret elder, seeing that the fighting in Zhang Lin in the tower had stopped, came out and said. After the great elder finished speaking, the others said no more and focused their attention on Zhang Lin again. Inside the tower, Zhang Lin looked at the battle puppet, and there were flames beating in his left and right eyes. He punched again but this time, flame patterns appeared on his arms. This punch, with unparalleled magical power and a domineering fire element, hit the battle puppet's chest with one punch. However, this time, it was not the battle puppet that flew out. But Zhang Lin, for some reason, when Zhang Lin touched the battle puppet, an inexplicable force suddenly flew him away. Okay, let's stop here. Okay, let's stop here. Zhang Lin flew backwards, and before he could even stabilize his body, a strange voice came to his ears. Kindness. Hearing this, Zhang Lin's expression also changed slightly and he looked up. The battle puppet appeared behind him at some unknown time. This speed is really too fast. Zhang Lin's pupils shrank suddenly. The power of this battle puppet is absolutely extraordinary. And, what shocked him the most was. The battle puppet spoke. There is no third person in this challenge room. Just the two of them. 
Therefore, the one who spoke just now was definitely the battle puppet. Who are you? How can a battle puppet speak? Stabilize your body with all your strength, then quickly distance yourself from him, look at him solemnly, and speak coldly. The battle puppet stood there, and Zhang Lin stopped taking action, but just looked at the opponent. He knew that this was no ordinary battle puppet. The battle puppet cannot speak at all, nor does it have any consciousness. But now, the battle puppet he wanted money from actually spoke. My old arms and legs haven't moved in a long time. Facing Zhang Lin's question, the battle puppet not only did not answer Zhang Lin's question, but stood there and moved on its own. His words were full of laziness. Relax, little one. I was just joking with you just now. After Zhang Lin watched him for a long time, the battle puppet finally finished moving its muscles and bones, looked at Zhang Lin, and said slowly. Senior, you are not a battle puppet, right? Looking at this strangely behaving battle puppet, Zhang Lin couldn't help but frown and asked. Ha ha, little guy, you are very smart. The battle puppet chuckled and said, Yes, I am indeed not a battle puppet. I am just the guardian of this challenge tower. After hearing the battle puppet's words, Zhang Lin frowned again and asked doubtfully, Guardian. This challenge tower is guarded by four elders outside. Is it possible that he is guarding the inside? However, Zhang Lin didn't know much about this challenge tower. He didn't know the details. Little guy, there is no need to doubt it. The battle puppet continued, This challenge tower is also one of the treasures of the Tianlong clan, and naturally it needs someone to guard it. Seeing what the puppet said, Zhang Lin nodded. Indeed, the importance of this challenge tower is beyond doubt. I wonder what you call me, senior? Zhang Lin asked. How about a title? Just call me Elder Zhao. The battle puppet shook his head slightly and said calmly. Elder Zhao. Zhang Lin thought in his mind and wondered if there was any elder named Zhao who he knew. But after thinking about it, he didn't think about which elder was called Elder Zhao. Junior, I have met Elder Zhao. I wonder, what's the matter with Elder Zhao coming to see this junior? Zhang Lin asked curiously again. A strange elder suddenly attacked him, which made him very confused. That's not the case, I just came to see how strong you are. The result makes me very satisfied, and at the same time, I am also very surprised. The battle puppet possessed by Elder Zhao said slowly with a smile on his face. However, this smile is very weird no matter how you look at it. This time I am possessed by this puppet and have fought you a few times. I'm very satisfied with the result. You can play with me here in the next few days. I haven't moved my muscles and bones for a long time, and they are almost rusty. Elder Zhao said slowly. Speaking of this, Elder Zhao was also secretly frightened. At the beginning, he was not possessed by the puppet. The battle puppet at the 8th level of Tianxuan was actually suppressed and beaten by Zhang Lin with his physical strength. Later, he possessed the battle puppet and used various small moves, but he didn't take much advantage. In terms of combat skills, he has lived for thousands of years and must be more experienced than Zhang Lin. But even so, he was still being pressed down and beaten by Zhang Lin, who was at the seventh level of Tianxuan. Later, gradually, he also secretly used his strength at the ninth level of Tianxuan. Only then could Zhang Lin be suppressed. However, when Zhang Lin started to use spiritual power, the upper hand he had finally gained was broken again. Although the battle puppet also has some shortcomings in combat, his extremely hard body can roughly make up for it. But even so, Zhang Lin was still able to suppress the battle puppets at the ninth level of Tianxuan by virtue of his level at the seventh level of Tianxuan. This kind of strength is very powerful. Senior, you are using more than just the eighth level of Tianxuan, right? Suddenly, Zhang Lin looked at Elder Zhao and said playfully. It's not that he didn't believe it, but at a certain moment in the middle, he felt the strength of the battle puppet suddenly surge. Although it has improved, for him, the result is still the same. He pinned me down and beat me. He was clearly talking about the 8th level of Tianxuan, but this Elder Zhao is here. I'm afraid the strength he displayed just now is at the level of the 9th level of Tianxuan, right? Such strength is definitely not possessed by the 8th level Tianxuan. Elder Zhao was also a little embarrassed after hearing Zhang Lin's words. Ha ha ha, no, no, I have always used the strength of the 8th level of Tianxuan. Ha ha, Elder Zhao also said. He would not admit that he had used the strength of the 9th level of Tianxuan. 
Hearing this, Zhang Lin did not speak, but stared at Elder Zhao with a strange expression on his face, and he didn't know what he was thinking. Elder Zhao, this junior feels that the strength of the eighth level of Tianxuan is too low. Next time, Elder Zhao should use his level of strength at the ninth level of Tianxuan. Juniors also want to know how much strength they have. Zhang Lin said, his eyes sparkling. Hearing Zhang Lin's words, Elder Zhao was stunned for a moment, and then he said, Okay, next time, I will fight you with the strength of the ninth level of Tianxuan. Let me see how much strength you have, too. Elder Zhao naturally agreed to Zhang Lin's request. However, there was a hint of guilt in his words. The realm of the ninth level of Tianxuan, wasn't it just the ninth level of Tianxuan? After saying that, Elder Zhao suddenly regretted it. If I had known earlier, I wouldn't have agreed to him so quickly. This time, the ninth level was said to be the eighth level. So next time, if you use the ninth level of strength, wouldn't you have to use the ninth level of peak strength? But to be honest, Zhang Lin's surprise for him was really too great. How is it, Lao Zhao? I'm telling you, you can't look down on this little guy like that. How is it, Lao Zhao? I'm telling you, you can't look down on this little guy like that. Now, is the boat capsized in the gutter? They also said that this is the strength of the eighth level of Tianxuan. Old Zhao, how could you lie to the child? The great elder, second elder and the others, who had been paying attention to them, also used their spiritual consciousness to communicate with Elder Zhao at this time. Hearing these words, Elder Zhao was also depressed for a while. The old man blushed, but fortunately he was now possessed by the battle puppet. There was nothing strange about him at all on his dark face. Facing the banter of several people, Elder Zhao left a message to come back in the afternoon, and then disappeared from the battle puppet's body in an instant. After Elder Zhao disappeared, the battle puppet returned to its original appearance. Stiff, stiff, emotionless. Have they gone? This old man is quite good at lying. You only use the strength of the eighth level of Tianxuan, who are you kidding? Seeing that the battle puppet stopped talking and just stood there blankly. Zhang Lin also had some guesses in his mind. However, Zhang Lin would be a fool if he believed what Elder Zhao said just now. But, let's talk about it. It was just a test just now. No one used their full strength. Zhang Lin was quite emotional about the battle just now. He also had a slight understanding of his own strength. With the power of his physical body, he was able to press the practitioners of the 8th level of Tianxuan to the ground and rub them. If you are at the 9th level of Tianxuan, there is no chance. After all, the Elder Zhao just now was an old monster who had lived for thousands of years. Even so, he still hasn't beaten Zhang Lin. If he hadn't used super strength in the end, Zhang Lin was confident that he could defeat the opponent within 10 moves. However, what made him a little disappointed was that he didn't use his full strength just now. What a pity, but wait until the afternoon, when Elder Zhao comes again. He must use 80% of his strength to see how far his strength has reached. Thinking of this, Zhang Lin once again focused his attention on the Tianyi battle puppet. Tianyi, use the strength at the peak of the ninth level of Tianxuan. This time, Zhang Lin spoke directly. That is to let the battle puppet directly use the most powerful strength of the Tianxuan realm. However, in Zhang Lin's opinion, the strength of this combat puppet at the peak of the Tianxuan realm should be not much different from that of the eighth level of Tianxuan. After all, this battle puppet is too dull, not as flexible and conscious as the one possessed by Elder Zhao. After hearing Zhang Lin's order, the Tianyi battle puppet also took action directly, without any hesitation, and blasted hard towards Zhang Lin's chest. Boom! Zhang Lin also punched him directly. The two collided again. Comma, old Zhao, can you do it? The strength of the ninth level of Tianxuan can't even beat a boy of the seventh level of Tianxuan. That's right, if it doesn't work, just say so. Don't hold on. Elder Zhao's heroic deeds in the challenge tower were soon known to some well-known elders. One by one, they used their spiritual consciousness to tease Elder Zhao. Elder Zhao's expression became increasingly embarrassed. However, he also knew that these elders were teasing him, and he did not refute them. After all, this is true. No, I will give that boy a good look this afternoon. I want you to see if I can do it. I secretly said in my heart. He must get this thing back. 
Old Zhao, are you angry? Let me tell you, couldn't you just use the king-shaped puppet? The sky-shaped puppet is too dull and not easy to use at all. Suddenly, at this time, a close elder spoke up. Give him a move. King Puppet, hearing this, Elder Zhao was also startled. But when I thought about it again, my eyes lit up. Why didn't he think of this? The king character puppet represents the realm of the king. Just like the Tianzi puppet, it represents the strength of the Tianxuan realm. It also represents their name, just like, Tianyi. However, using a king character puppet is too bullying, isn't it? But on second thought, Elder Zhao hesitated. After all, the king puppet has the strength of a king. Even if he only exerts his strength at the Tianxuan realm, he is still much stronger than practitioners at the same realm. Moreover, there is a chasm between the two realms of Tianxuan and King. One sky and one earth. If the King puppet is really used, will it make Zhang Lin feel too bullying? What's going on? Old Zhao, we are training that boy. Only in this way can he become stronger. Right, Old Zhao, don't hesitate, use it quickly. Amidst the voices of persuasion, Elder Zhao also sighed helplessly. However, he figured it out. What happened to the King character puppet? Aren't they all still puppets? Moreover, he only used the strength of the ninth level of Tianxuan, which was nothing. It can't be called super qualified. And besides, the great elder and the others didn't say anything. It was obviously acquiesced that he could use the king puppet. HMPH. Boy, just wait for me. Thinking of this, Elder Zhao seemed to have seen the scene where he had regained his place. He pressed Zhang Lin to the ground and rubbed him. Zhang Lin begged for mercy and laughed. That picture is so wonderful. Ha ha ha. Elder Zhao couldn't help laughing. Kama. Yaoluli. Brother, don't you say something. Do you really want Lao Zhao to use the king character puppet? The second elder took a sip of tea and said slowly to the first elder sitting next to him. King puppet, just use it. But let them go to the ninth floor to fight in the afternoon. If it's on the eighth floor, I'm afraid neither of them will be able to use it. The great elder thought about it carefully, and then said, let them both use it in the afternoon, and let them have a good fight. There is no limit to the tricks and weapons can be used. The first elder's words made the second elder nod slightly. If you fight, fight hard. Especially Zhang Lin, they still don't know how strong this kid really is. I just happened to take advantage of this opportunity to give it a good test. Comma, cannot be done. The gap is too big. It's not powerful at all. With another punch, a huge roar broke out, and Zhang Lin punched the combat puppet away. Then looking at the battle puppet flying backwards, Zhang Lin couldn't help but complain. At this time, this combat puppet was already at the ninth level of Tianxuan. But after Zhang Lin used his spiritual power, he became a little weaker. It felt like it wasn't enough for him. Zhang Lin suddenly missed Elder Zhao very much. I want him to come quickly. Hey, Lao Zhao, Lao Zhao. Come quickly. Miss you. Time flies. As Zhang Lin knocked the combat puppet away over and over again, time also passed quickly. Soon, noon passed. In the afternoon, Elder Zhao, why haven't you come yet? Juniors miss you. Zhang Lin lay aside, looking at the ceiling above, and murmured. This time, he wasn't using a combat puppet to train him. This battle puppet is too weak without Elder Zhao so weak that he couldn't even arouse any interest. Elder Zhao is better. He was also a little impatient. When will Elder Zhao come? This gave him a hunch that Elder Zhao would definitely give him a surprise in the afternoon. Did you see it? Did you see it? Now I'm starting to dislike this Tianzi puppet. Did you hear what this kid said? I miss Lao Zhao. Ha ha ha. I'm afraid you want to push Lao Zhao to the ground and rub him, right? Many elders who had been secretly observing Zhang Lin couldn't help laughing at this moment. This Zhang Lin really knows how to speak. I miss Lao Zhao. This is probably because he wants to rub Elder Zhao on the ground. Isn't this intentional to make him uncomfortable? As for Zhang Lin, many people in the clan are aware of his existence. These elders have been observing him secretly. I had always heard the fifth elder, old man Long Wu, bragging about him. Even when I met old friends like them, they kept talking about how talented and powerful Zhang Lin was and how evil he was. 
Therefore, at this time, many elders also heard the news, and each of them wanted to see what the young man that the fifth elder was bragging about looked like. But now, Zhang Lin has indeed caught their eyes. In terms of strength, they were also surprised. Okay, okay, stop talking. Every one of them has been taken care of. I just let him go this morning. This time, I won't hold back anymore. At this time, Elder Zhao suddenly spoke. After listening to their words, Elder Zhao also had a livid face and said forcefully. These old guys know how to laugh at him. He said he couldn't do it, but if he had the ability, they would come forward. Old Zhao, don't be angry. It's our fault, we shouldn't laugh at you. We believe that this time, you will be able to push that kid to the ground and rub him. Comma, the king puppet, it's you who decides. Yi Wang. On the ninth floor of the challenge tower, a wisp of Elder Zhao's soul came here. He looked at the several humanoid puppets standing there and picked them. In the end, the king character puppet named, Wang Yi, was chosen. As the spirit entered his body, the king-shaped puppet, who stood motionless, suddenly raised his head. There was also a bit of agility in his eyes. Yes, this time, I don't believe it. This can't even beat you, kid. Feeling the body of the king puppet, Elder Zhao couldn't help but snorted coldly. Then, he drove the king puppet towards the eighth floor. Comma, isn't Elder Zhao afraid to come? It's already afternoon, hey. Zhang Lin waited for a long time, but did not wait for Elder Zhao to arrive again. I also guessed in my heart. But if Elder Zhao doesn't come, wouldn't he have to go to the ninth floor to have a look? After all, the Tianzi puppet could no longer satisfy him. If you want to progress, you can only go to the ninth floor. Snort, boy, are you saying that I don't dare to come? It's just ridiculous. Suddenly, a voice came from outside. When Zhang Lin heard the friendly voice, he quickly turned his head and looked at the entrance. The sound came from there. But, doesn't Elder Zhao plan to use the Tianzi puppet this time? Zhang Lin also had some doubts in his heart. But the next second, he knew. Bang. There was a loud bang. A figure suddenly appeared at the entrance. When Zhang Lin looked at this figure, he was slightly startled, and then looked at him with that strange look. Yi Wang, King Puppet, especially when he saw the word, Wang Yi, on his chest, Zhang Lin's eyes widened. The King Character Puppet, the King Level Puppet. Elder Zhao, what are you doing? This inevitably makes Zhang Lin feel that the big one is bullying the small ones. Isn't that right? Are you going to use a king-shaped puppet? Boy, don't worry. I only use the strength of the Tianxuan realm. And the Tianzi puppet is too bulky and not as flexible as the Wangzi puppet. Elder Zhao walked in and said with a faint smile. Although, using the king character puppet does feel a bit bullying. But, he's used to it. This, is this good? Zhang Lin asked hesitantly after hearing what Elder Zhao said. Then he took a look at the king-shaped puppet. But I have to say that the King Character Puppet and the Sky Character Puppet are different. The Tianzi Puppet looks a little clumsy at first glance. But this King Character Puppet is different. The King Puppet is like an ordinary person. Just like a real person, all limbs and facial features are real. He was even wearing clothes. If it weren't for the several puppet lines on his face, I might not be able to tell whether he was a puppet or not. Why not? I don't want to use the strength of the King, so don't worry. Elder Zhao also shamelessly rebutted Zhang Lin's question. Looking at the shameless Elder Zhao, Zhang Lin was speechless. After all, the matter has reached this point, even if you say anything, it is of no use. Then, that's it. Zhang Lin could only agree. Challenge indoors. Zhang Lin and Elder Zhao stood opposite each other. But this time, Zhang Lin's expression turned serious. This time, he will never underestimate the enemy. What's going on? This is also a king-shaped puppet. However, they did not wait for the two of them to take action. The great elder's voice suddenly came. Both of them were a little startled. Let's go to the ninth floor. On the ninth floor, I'll let you fight. Young man Zhang, use your full strength to show us old guys your strength. The words of the great elder were heard around. Of course, the main purpose of letting them go to the ninth floor is that they want to see how strong Zhang Lin is. Yes. Great Elder, when Zhang Lin heard this, he also respectfully agreed. He naturally understood what the Great Elder said. And his original plan was to see how powerful he was. Elder, 
Can this junior be able to use weapons? Suddenly, Zhang Lin spoke again. He has never had the opportunity to use his Taoist weapon. And this time, Zhang Lin naturally didn't want to miss it. However, if he uses weapons, is the puppet of the ninth level of Zong that day really his opponent? Can. And one more thing. If you want to use your Taoist soldiers, then Lao Zhao, you can use the strength of the half-step king level. The great elder also agreed to Zhang Lin's request. But it also reminded Zhang Lin. If he uses Dao soldiers, then the person fighting him will not be a battle puppet from the Tianxuan realm. Instead, he is a battle puppet with a half step to the king's level. Although it is only half a step to the king's realm, don't underestimate this half step. If the combat power index at the peak of the ninth level of Tianxuan is 1, then the half step to the king's realm is not just 1 plus 1 equals 2, but a big jump directly to 10. Good. Zhang Lin's eyes narrowed and he said in a deep voice. Since Zhang Lin agreed, there was no need for the great elder to be polite. Let's go to the ninth floor. Elder Zhao looked at Zhang Lin's appearance of a newborn calf not afraid of tigers, shook his head, and then led him to the ninth floor. In his opinion, Zhang Lin is still too young. Once you win once, you won't know what you look like anymore. In his opinion, half-step to the king's realm is not necessary at all. He only needs to be at the ninth level of Tianxuan level to be able to press Zhang Lin to the ground and rub him. Ha! Huh, Zhang Lin took a deep breath and quickly chased after him. He was looking forward to what kind of surprise Elder Zhao, the Tianzi puppet, would give him. After arriving on the ninth floor, Elder Zhao took Zhang Lin to a challenge room with ease. The space on the ninth floor is even larger than the space on the eighth floor. Looking around, Zhang Lin also nodded secretly. This place is really good, enough for him to exert all his strength. Come on, I was just careless this morning. Now, I won't let you offend me anymore. Elder Zhao stood there with one hand behind his back, looking at Zhang Lin coldly, and said lightly. Zhang Lin also nodded when he heard this. He didn't say anything else and just took action. Buzz, following Zhang Lin's wave of his hand. The king-shaped puppet in front of him, Elder Zhao, also rushed out fiercely. Boom, in this instant, Elder Zhao also burst out with astonishing pressure. Clap it with one palm. Suddenly, the void shook. A terrifying strong wind also swept out and enveloped Zhang Lin. The king puppet is originally made from excellent materials. The power is also very powerful. Facing Elder Zhao's attack, he did not dare to exaggerate this time, and the true dragon pattern appeared on his body. Boom. A bright golden glow appeared on the surface of Zhang Lin's body. Immediately, he punched out. The fist collided with Elder Zhao's palm. Bang, there was a muffled sound, and both of them took a step back. Good, little guy, keep coming. Elder Zhao took a step back, and then looked at Zhang Lin's calm appearance. Elder Zhao couldn't help but be surprised. But at the same time, he also became more cruel to Zhang Lin. Elder Zhao is not bad either. Zhang Lin raised the corners of his mouth slightly, and then flashed. Hey, a punch was thrown out, bringing with it a violent wind. Elder Zhao also blocked without showing any signs of weakness. Pap, bang, the sound of cracking continued, and the entire space seemed to be shattered at any time. Every time Zhang Lin and Elder Zhao fought, there were shocking aftermaths. As Elder Zhao had more and more fights with Zhang Lin, his eyes gradually became serious. Although the strength he is using now is still at the ninth level of Tianxuan. However, don't forget, this is a king shaped puppet. The body is extremely powerful, comparable to the physique of a king. In this case, he still has many advantages. But even so, Elder Zhao still didn't have much of an upper hand in the fight with Zhang Lin. Little guy, if you have any other moves, just use them. I will be your sparring partner today, feel free to take action. Elder Zhao shouted loudly after knocking Zhang Lin away with one punch. Good, Zhang Lin didn't say any nonsense. He stepped forward and turned into a stream of light and rushed towards Elder Zhao. Roar, on him, there is also a shadow of a giant dragon emerging. The roar of the dragon was deafening, and a dragon claw tore out directly and grabbed Elder Zhao. But under the dragon's claws, Elder Zhao's body seemed very small. Elder Zhao also frowned slightly. He could feel that the power of this dragon claw was very powerful. However, it's not a big problem. 
His strong body is enough to withstand this dragon claw. Dragon claw, with this little power, you want to hurt me. I'm dreaming. Break it for me. Elder Zhao's eyes widened, and then he clenched his iron fists tightly and fiercely faced the dragon claws. Boom. The next moment, a shocking roar suddenly sounded. The dragon claws and iron fists collided with each other, and ripples spread out in the space. Come again. This time, golden hot flames rose from his body. Come on fire. The surrounding flames changed into blossoming fire lotuses surrounding Zhang Lin. These fire lotuses are also constantly rotating, emitting a terrible heat wave. The fire lotus also contains terrifying power. Boom. Crack. Surrounded by the fire lotus, Zhang Lin waved his hand, and the fire lotus smashed down towards Elder Zhao crazily. Elder Zhao's expression also changed slightly, and he quickly waved his iron fist. You can't hide, so that's all you can do. The fists were fierce, constantly bombarding the fire lotus, and loud sounds echoed through the space. Under the fire lotus, the upper half of Elder Zhao's clothes were also burned away by the flames. Little guy, if this is the only way, I'm afraid it won't work. The next second, Elder Zhao disappeared from where he was. The next moment, his figure appeared on Zhang Lin's back. Harder, Elder Zhao shouted low and punched Zhang Lin hard on the back. Elder Zhao, are you sure? Regarding Elder Zhao who suddenly appeared behind him, Zhang Lin didn't panic at all and just said calmly. It was at this moment that monstrous black flames suddenly erupted from Zhang Lin's back. This is the glorious black flame, the twelfth existence on the list of divine flames of heaven and earth. The radiant black flame turned into a dragon and headed towards Elder Zhao. When Elder Zhao looked at the radiant black flame, his expression suddenly sank. He could clearly feel the terror of this radiant black flame. The punch he threw stopped at this moment. Even, his body is still retreating. All of this just happened between the sparks of calcium carbide, and people couldn't react at all. Zhang Lin turned around and looked at Elder Zhao who was retreating in a panic and said slowly, Elder Zhao, don't underestimate people. Otherwise you will suffer a big loss. Chapter 91 That is, glowing black flame. Looking at the flame dragon transformed from black scorching flames, Elder Zhao spoke hesitantly. He also knew about the existence of the Yaoshi black flame. But isn't this thing in the second elder's alchemy king cauldron? Why did he appear here in Zhang Lin? He looked at Zhang Lin doubtfully. Obviously, Elder Zhao didn't know that this glorious black flame had been surrendered by Zhang Lin. The second elder did not make any announcement about this matter. After all, his home was stolen. If you tell it, wouldn't it be embarrassing? When people get old, what they care about most is face. Therefore, it is normal for Elder Zhao not to know about this matter. When Zhang Lin heard what Elder Zhao said, he smiled and nodded. The next second, behind Zhang Lin, two golden and black flame dragons emerged. Rotating around Zhang Lin, exuding a terrifying aura. I underestimated you, you actually have the black flame of the world. Elder Zhao couldn't help but gasped when he looked at the two flame dragons. The glory black flame is no joke, and its power is extraordinary. Especially just now, if he hadn't been so sensitive, he might have been tricked by this kid using the brilliant black flame. Even an ordinary 8th level Tianxuan might not be able to withstand that blow just now. This kid, if he hadn't been exposed, I'm afraid they wouldn't have known that the Yoshihide Black Flame was on him. Elder Zhao, be careful. Zhang Lin glanced at Elder Zhao, then moved his hands, and two flame dragons flew out. Smelly boy. Elder Zhao cursed angrily. This time, all his attention was focused. He knew how powerful Zhang Lin was. Golden body. As Elder Zhao shouted loudly, golden light also emerged from the surface of his body. Golden light enveloped his whole body, making him look even more divine. Rumble. Waves of violent roars resounded throughout the challenge room. The two flame dragons were unable to move even under the golden light. Golden light enveloped Elder Zhao, protecting him in the center. But the two flame dragons failed to break through Elder Zhao's golden body defense at all. When Zhang Lin saw this, he couldn't help but frown. Elder Zhao's golden body is a bit annoying to him. However, this golden body may not be able to withstand all his attacks, right? Come out, Candle World Fire Lotus. Suddenly, Zhang Lin's body. The golden flame, which represents the flames of the candle sun, 
and the Black Flame, which represents the Black Flames of the world, are under the control of Zhang Lin. Under the gaze of Elder Zhao, they slowly merged together. The bright fire lotus gradually appeared in the eyes of the two people. These two completely different flames actually merged into one. Although he didn't know how powerful it was, just looking at it gave him a chilling feeling. How is this possible? Elder Zhao exclaimed, with a look of disbelief on his face. This is the glorious black flame. The next second. Elder Zhao looked at the Zushi fire lotus flying towards him, and his face suddenly sank. He knew that the power of this Zushi fire lotus must be extraordinary. His figure flashed and he quickly retreated. However, the speed of Zushi fire lotus is also beyond ordinary imagination. In just a few blinks of an eye, he was already in front of Elder Zhao. Boom, the flames and golden light merged together, and a scorching temperature swept away. Elder Zhao was also knocked over and flew out. Even though he was a king-shaped puppet, Elder Zhao was still embarrassed by the fire lotus. The explosion sounded, and Elder Zhao stepped back several hundred meters. Call, call, Elder Zhao steadied himself, his eyes filled with shock. Looking at himself, he felt a little lucky in his heart. Congratulate yourself, at this moment, you are lucky enough to be in the body of a king-shaped puppet, not a physical body. With this power, ordinary practitioners below the ninth level of Tianxuan would have been blown to pieces long ago. Comma. Hey, be good. Why do I feel that Lao Zhao is going to overturn? Don't say you feel that old Zhao is about to overturn. Even I feel that old Zhao is about to overturn. Okay, stop talking, Lao Zhao hasn't made a big move yet. Don't jump to conclusions so early. Many elders who had been secretly observing this battle also spoke one after another when they saw Elder Zhao who was in such a miserable state at this moment. Their tone was a bit playful and a bit gloating. But some people also said that Lao Zhao still had a hidden trump card. When everyone heard this, they also fell silent. They are also very aware of Lao Zhao's ultimate move that he hasn't used yet. Also know what it is. If Elder Zhao really used that move, I'm afraid Zhang Lin would have a high chance of losing. That move was very tricky for them, let alone Zhang Lin. In all likelihood, they will be severely damaged. If I had known earlier, I should have asked the great elder to tell them that Lao Zhao was not allowed to use the Shenlong slash move. Old Zhao shouldn't use this trick, right? Okay, just watch in peace. While the elders were discussing, the great elder's voice suddenly sounded. Let everyone be quiet watching the battle on the field calmly. Boy, you are very good. It's good to be able to force me to use my peak Tianxuan strength. The tough-talking elder Zhao looked at Zhang Lin and said. At the same time, the aura on his body also increased again. Elder Zhao knew that there were many elders secretly watching their battle. He didn't want to lose to a brat like Zhang Lin in front of so many people. Secret Technique of Earth Dragon The first move, Earth Dragon Breath. Elder Zhao made a seal with one hand, and a huge dragon-headed shadow emerged. A roar echoed through the air. One by one, the huge earth dragons spit out powerful dragon breath from the dragon heads and attacked Zhang Lin. Wherever the dragon's breath passed, the air was burned to ashes. Facing Elder Zhao's move, earth dragon breathed out. True dragon fist. Zhang Lin's expression remained unchanged, and the true dragon pattern appeared on his arm. A punch was thrown. The golden shadow of the true dragon emerged. Facing that terrifying breath, boom, along with a loud noise, the golden fist light collided hard with the dragon's breath. Boom, the two collided, and a rumbling sound suddenly spread. At the same time, Zhang Lin's upper body clothes could not withstand the terrifying pressure and burst open. Revealing his muscular body. On his muscular body, there were faint golden dragon patterns flickering. Elder Zhao, on the other hand, took half a step back. Hiss. This round, Lao Zhao lost again. It's half a step away, what a pity. Stop talking, look at that kid. Look at that kid. That is, what the hell. After receiving their reminder, everyone also turned their attention from the battle to Zhang Lin's body. It wasn't how tempting his body was that attracted them. It was the golden lines on Zhang Lin's body that attracted them. This, this is the true dragon mark. Impossible. This is impossible, how could he have the true dragon mark? How so? Everyone's eyes widened when they saw the true dragon pattern on Zhang Lin's body. 
He looked like he had seen a ghost. Elder Zhao at the scene also had his pupils narrowed. He sees more clearly than those in the dark. Four true dragon patterns are looming on his body. Boy, where did the true dragon pattern on your body come from? Elder Zhao looked at Zhang Lin and asked in a deep voice, looking at the true dragon pattern. Regarding this issue, not only Elder Zhao wants to know, but also the elders in the secret want to know. At this time, they all became quiet one by one, looking at Zhang Lin, waiting for his answer. Even the first elder and the second elder who were drinking tea in Yalu were watching Zhang Lin silently. Brother, this, the second elder obviously still hadn't calmed down from the shock in his heart and looked at the first elder. The great elder shook his head slightly, I don't know either. The second elder also fell silent. Everyone else also fell silent. This kid, the third elder shook his head and said helplessly, it's really not easy. Looks like I'm going to look for Lao Wu again. Comma. Is this what Elder Zhao is talking about? Elder Zhao, have you misunderstood something? This true dragon pattern is one of my body training techniques. When you practice to a certain level, true dragon patterns will appear on your body. Zhang Lin looked at Elder Zhao and heard his words. He also lowered his head and looked at the real dragon pattern on his body, feeling a little confused. Isn't this just an ordinary true dragon pattern? How could Elder Zhao be so surprised? However, Zhang Lin still pointed to the true dragon pattern on his body and explained it to Elder Zhao. Body Training Technique Elder Zhao frowned slightly, with a trace of confusion on his face. After hearing Zhang Lin's answer, Elder Zhao was still a little skeptical. This true dragon pattern is different from ordinary techniques. Not only his appearance, but also exuding a faint aura of a true dragon. It's not like a physical training method can do this. What do you say? Do you think this kid's words are true or false? Secretly, been quiet for a long time. Especially after hearing Zhang Lin's answer, no one spoke. It was at this moment that an unknown elder suddenly spoke. I think he didn't lie. Yes, but can the body training technique really produce true dragon patterns? This is truly unbelievable. This is the true dragon pattern, the true symbol of the legendary dragon clan. At this time, everyone spoke one after another. Everyone is discussing this matter. Elder Zhao's expression was also uncertain at this time. That's it for today. You practice with Wang Yi first, and I will go solve some things. Elder Zhao took a deep look at Zhang Lin and did not wait for Zhang Lin to answer him. The trace of his soul left the body of the puppet Wang Yi. As quickly as it came, it went as quickly as it came. Zhang Lin was left alone here. This is a big deal, Zhang Lin looked at Wang Yi, who had no expression in his eyes, and knew that Elder Zhao had left. He shook his head helplessly, feeling a little confused. It was just a few real dragon patterns, but it seemed to shock them. Looking at the true dragon pattern on his body, Zhang Lin shook his head. The true dragon pattern slowly disappeared, also disappearing under the eyes of the elders. Elder Zhao left, but they did not leave. It can be said that when the true dragon pattern appeared on Zhang Lin's body, their eyes stayed on him and never left him. Zhang Lin's every move was under their eyes. I can't imagine it, but when I think of this true dragon pattern, everything seems to be clear. Yes, true dragon pattern, no wonder, no wonder. Comma, Dragon King Valley. The once peaceful valley is now exploding. What's going on? How come this kid has real dragon marks on his body? That's the legendary true dragon pattern. All the elders gathered together, and they were all a little excited. They never expected that the legendary true dragon mark would appear on Zhang Lin's body. However, for them, this kind of thing is really shocking. Okay, stop talking. At this time, Dragon King Long Yao suddenly walked out and looked at everyone with a serious face. After hearing this, everyone became quiet instantly. Long Yao swept around the crowd. You must have seen it just now. Zhang Lin has the true dragon pattern on his body. The voice of Dragon King Long Yao was filled with power. Anyone who has watched the battle between him and Elder Zhao secretly knows that Zhang Lin has the true dragon mark. Even if I didn't see it, I heard them say it at this time. This made their eyes narrow slightly, and a strange light appeared in their eyes. True dragon pattern. That is the true symbol of the dragon clan. What is the origin of this boy? How could he have the true dragon mark on his body? The second elder has already gone to find the fifth elder. 
It is even possible that the second ancestor will come. This matter is of great importance and must not be leaked. After hearing the Dragon King's words, everyone nodded. As the Dragon King, his intimidating power is still very strong. Moreover, they all know what kind of concept this true dragon mark has in the Tianlong clan. This matter needs to be discussed carefully and what should be done next. The great elder looked at everyone and said, After all, this matter is of great importance. Everyone nodded. The true dragon pattern, to be more serious, can be said to be related to the rise and fall of their Tianlong clan. The second ancestor has arrived. There is dark thunder here, and there is also terrifying lightning. One lightning after another strikes the sky, causing the heaven and earth to change color. In the endless sea of blood, endless waves of blood rolled. Boom! The blood wave rolled and turned into a huge bloody dragon, opening its bloody mouth and biting forward. Those were the souls of countless creatures, which were turned into nothingness and turned into energy when he devoured them, and were absorbed into his body by him. Ho, oh, be good, don't make trouble. I heard that a being with the true dragon pattern appeared in the Tianlong clan. After a while, I will capture him and feed him to you. Be obedient, the end of the sky, the gathering place of all saints. A figure sat cross-legged in the cave, with the spell in his hand moving, and a golden light surged out of his body. This figure was none other than Zhang Lin. At this time, his whole body was enveloped in a golden glow. As the golden light flashed, the true dragon pattern on Zhang Lin's body became brighter and brighter, as if it were a living creature. Zhang Lin's eyes were filled with a light golden luster, looking sacred and noble. Especially because he is now wearing a golden noble robe, which makes his temperament even more sacred and inviolable. Buzz. Suddenly, Zhang Lin opened his eyes. Two rays of golden light, like divine light, shot in all directions. Ha! A breath of turbid air was exhaled, and it shot directly several meters away, and there was even a sound of breaking through the air. Wisps of fluctuations that were difficult to discern with the naked eye rippled out from his body. Eighth level of Tianxuan, Zhang Lin murmured, feeling the majestic true energy in his body. Immediately, he stood up. In half a year, he finally reached the eighth level of Tianxuan from the seventh level of Tianxuan, plus some elixirs provided by the Tianlong clan. In two years, Zhang Lin broke through from the first level of Tianxuan to the eighth level of Tianxuan with great ease, without any pressure. And this speed of cultivation is simply monster. For other geniuses, they would only reach one or two realms a year, no matter how talented they were. And what about Zhang Lin? It only took two short years to break through the seventh level. This speed shocked even himself. However, he did not feel proud or complacent because of this. He knew that it was far from over. Counting the days, Long Ji Yu will be back soon, right? Suddenly, Zhang Lin remembered something. As far as he knew, this period of time was the day when Long Ji Yu would return. I just don't know when he will return, but he is quite interested in Long Ji Yu. Half a year ago, the true dragon pattern on his body was exposed. There was a lot of commotion at that time, but for some unknown reason, it quickly fell silent. However, although things have become quiet, the resources provided by the Tianlong clan to him have become more abundant than before. Although no one told him the reason for this, he still vaguely had some guesses in his mind. Become a real dragon and ascend to the throne. Once again, I thought of what the second elder and the others were planning. Their purpose is to return the dragon's bloodline to its ancestors, reincarnate into a true dragon, and then follow the path of God, ascend to the nine heavens, become the strongest of the Tianlong clan, and lead the celestial dragon clan back to glory. How can it be so simple to transform into a true dragon again? I'm really curious as to what the second elder and the others will do. What a dragon! Zhang Lin shook his head and didn't think too much. Anyway, when the time comes, there will be some benefits from him. Even if it doesn't take up the majority, he will definitely benefit a lot. I just don't know what the danger is. Old man Long Wu once told him that it was not safe and there were some risks. Brother Zhang, Grandpa is looking for you. Outside the cave, the cry of dragon language came, clear and beautiful. Okay, here we come. Zhang Lin responded, then swayed and came directly to the door of the cave. At this time, Long Yu was dressed in white, like an exquisite porcelain doll. Compared with her two years ago, 
Xiaolongyu has also grown a lot taller, and her whole person is even more cute. The slender hair was divided into twin ponytails, swaying up and down as Xiaolongyu jumped up and down. The little girl's face was as red as an apple, so cute that Zhang Lin couldn't help but reach out and squeeze it. Xiaolongyu, you've grown taller again. Zhang Lin pinched Long Yu's pink cheeks and smiled. Snort, I'm not a kid anymore. Xiao Long Yu pouted dissatisfiedly and slapped Zhang Lin's hand away, his face slightly red. Zhang Lin laughed. Brother Zhang, Grandpa is looking for you. Outside the cave, the cry of dragon language came, clear and beautiful. Okay, here we come. Zhang Lin responded, then swayed and came directly to the entrance of the cave. At this time, Long Yu was dressed in white, like an exquisite porcelain doll. Compared with her two years ago, Xiaolong Yu has also grown a lot taller, and her whole person is even more cute. The slender hair was divided into twin ponytails, swaying up and down as Xiaolong Yu jumped up and down. The little girl's face was as red as an apple, so cute that Zhang Lin couldn't help but reach out and squeeze it. Xiaolong Yu, you've grown taller again. Zhang Lin pinched Long Yu's pink cheeks and smiled. Snort, I'm not a kid anymore. Xiao Long Yu pouted dissatisfiedly and slapped Zhang Lin's hand away, his face slightly red. Zhang Lin laughed. Although the little girl is not very old, she is already a slim beauty, and she will definitely be a great beauty in the future. I just don't know which one to buy cheaper. As before, Zhang Lin held Xiao Long Yu's hand and walked outside. Xiao Long Yu still wanted to let Zhang Lin hold her but in Zhang Lin's opinion, Xiaolongyu had grown up and it was not appropriate to hold her. When Xiaolongyu saw this, he immediately became unhappy. HMPH, big bad guy, Xiaolongyu held Zhang Lin's hand tightly, stared at him, and said angrily. When Zhang Lin heard this, he couldn't laugh or cry. Great elder, what do you want from me? Zhang Lin was dragged by Xiaolongyu who was walking in front. Asked, I won't tell you. Xiaolongyu snorted twice. Ha, Zhang Lin smiled, not bothering to care about Xiaolong Yu, and just walked towards the foot of the mountain. My brother is back, brother Zhang, don't forget what you promised me. I see, the figures, one large and one small, disappeared on the mountain peak. Dragon King Valley, dressed in a golden dragon robe, a handsome young man flew out from a stone. Flying towards the Dragon King Pavilion. Father. The young man came outside a pavilion and bowed his hands respectfully. Um, half step to the realm of king, not bad. Inside the Dragon King Pavilion. Dragon King Long Yao and the Great Elder both looked at the chessboard on the stone platform. Long Yao's face was a little serious, his eyes were deep, and he exuded a power. He was also very satisfied with his little son. The strength of the half step king realm is considered top notch among the younger generation. And he also heard that Long Ji Yu had already reached the 12th level through the Heavenly Pass. My dear, did you ever encounter any tough opponents when you were crossing the Heavenly Pass? The Great Elder asked with a smile on his face. I've encountered quite a few, but those are the most powerful ones. Long Ji Yu nodded. Thinking back to the people I met when I entered the Heaven Pass. Strong, very strong. Some people are not even his opponents. By the way, Father, Grandpa, I heard that fifth grandpa brought someone back. Are you planning to compete with me for the position of Dragon Son? Long Ji Yu suddenly raised his head and looked at his father and the great elder, with a somewhat complicated expression in his eyes. He had heard about that person when he was in the imperial domain. But I never cared about it. Until that person found him and asked him to do something, which suddenly made him interested in Zhang Lin. Looking at that look, it was obvious that that person also cared about Zhang Lin, so Long Ji Yu gradually began to pay attention to him. If nothing else, Zhang Lin is probably his strongest competitor for the position of Long Zi. Not bad, but don't worry. He has withdrawn from the Long Zi dispute. The elder nodded slightly when he heard Long Gu's words. He naturally knew what he was thinking now and smiled lightly. After hearing what the great grandfather said, Long Ji Yu was stunned for a moment, and then a trace of doubt appeared on his face. He looked at the two of them confused, not knowing what they meant. Withdrew from the battle between Long Zi. How can this be? The position of Dragon Sun is full of glory and honor, and is what all Tianlong people dream of. But now, he actually gave up on his own initiative, which made Long Ji Yu feel a little unbelievable. 
The next second, Long Ji Yu seemed to have thought of some possibilities. He looked at them with a strange look. Father, you. It can't be, Long Ji Yu said with some hesitation and disbelief. What are you thinking about? How could we do such a dirty thing? Don't worry, it's okay. Long Yao felt Long Gu's strange gaze and instantly understood what this kid was thinking. It was a little funny at first, but also a little helpless. How could any of them do such a thing if they had not lived for thousands of years? And they don't even bother to do that kind of thing. If you want to be a dragon, you have to show your strength. Those evil ways are the most shameful to them. By the way, where is sister? Why didn't you see her? When Long Ji Yu saw this, the worry in his heart completely disappeared, and he asked instead. According to the past, every time he came back, his sister would come to trouble him. Why didn't I see her this time? This made him a little strange. We'll be here soon. I asked the little girl to call Zhang Lin over. You will get to know each other then. By the way, that little girl Long Yu has heard that you are coming back these days, but she is looking for someone to teach you a lesson. Don't mess with that girl again. Hearing the great elder mention this matter, Long Ji Yu smiled bitterly. He was helpless towards this sister. After all, it's all my father's fault. If his father hadn't asked him to be born first, how could such a thing have happened? With this thought in his mind, Long Ji Yu looked at his father full of resentment. See. Looking at Long Gu's eyes, Dragon King Long Yao suddenly couldn't laugh or cry. This is also his fault. Why? Coming. Suddenly, the three of them turned their heads and looked in a certain direction. Sure enough, the next second, they heard a familiar voice. A voice that makes Long Ji Yu feel dizzy when he hears it. Little story. This time, I will let Brother Zhang teach you a lesson. Let you know what a sister is. The childish voice spoke arrogant words. On the side, the great elder and dragon king Long Yao looked at each other, both showing helpless expressions. My dear, are you ready? The elder looked at Long Ji Yu and said with a smile. Long Ji Yu curled his lips and ignored the elder. But his eyes were still looking in that direction. There, he felt two breaths. There was a scent that he was very familiar with, that was his sister. The other one was very strange, a breath he had never seen before. Apparently, that aura belonged to Zhang Lin. I heard he is very strong. I just don't know who is stronger between the two of them. There was a fighting spirit in his eyes. Long Ji Yu stared there closely, and there was a surge of expectation in his heart. Close, closer. The next second, two figures suddenly flew over. When he saw the appearance clearly, the fighting gaze disappeared in an instant, followed by the strange gaze. He saw that his sister, who often bullied him, was being carried behind by a strange man. The man had a smile on his face, but his sister looked towards them with a tight face. Especially, the moment when Long Yu saw Long Ji Yu. The little tiger teeth in his mouth bit hard. Her little fists were clenched tightly and her cheeks were red, as if she was trying to control her anger. Now, when she sees Long Ji Yu, she wants Brother Zhang to teach him a lesson. Her stupid brother. Brother Zhang, you must help teach that stinky brother a lesson. Okay, Xiao Long Yu clutched the clothes behind Zhang Lin's back with both hands, lay on Zhang Lin's shoulders, and said softly and a little aggrievedly. This little thing is really. Zhang Lin was a little helpless. Although he couldn't see her current expression, Zhang Lin knew her well. That must be him, pretending to be very pitiful, with an aggrieved expression on his face. Such a pity. Long Yu's disguise had no effect on Zhang Lin. That's it, Long Ji Yu. Zhang Lin also looked at the young man standing there. Wearing a golden dragon robe, it is very attractive. Even Zhang Lin's eyes couldn't help but linger on him for a moment. Half step to the realm of king. In an instant, Zhang Lin knew the cultivation level of the young man in front of him. While Zhang Lin looked at him, Long Ji Yu also noticed Zhang Lin's eyes, which were full of hostility. Zhang Lin, somewhat inexplicable, is this their first meeting? Why are they so hostile when they meet for the first time? Moreover, he already said that he would withdraw from the Longzi dispute. This hostility came out of nowhere. After landing, Zhang Lin put Xiao Longyu down. The next second, Xiao Longyu, who had just landed, rushed towards Long Ji Yu there. The anger was not concealed at all. Xiao Longyu, full of anger, ran towards Long Ji Yu with small steps, 
his face bulging with anger, like an angry little tigress, extremely fierce. Moreover, while Xiao Longyu was running, he was waving his little fist at him. As for Long Ji Yu, the moment he saw Xiao Longyu rushing towards him, he quickly hid behind his father. This is his sister, he couldn't hit her, he hurt his sister, and he didn't know how he would deal with him. He can't even scold him. If he does, he won't be able to live a stable life during this period of time. Therefore, he would rather hide. Father, you take care of it. Long Ji Yu hid behind his father Long Yao, looking at Long Yu who was running toward him angrily, and he asked his father for help anxiously. When he came back this time, he didn't provoke her. Little story, come here. Long Yu came to his father, looked at his younger brother who was hiding behind his father and refused to come out, looked at him with anger, and shouted. Hearing this, Long Gu's body froze, and he lowered his head aggrievedly. I looked at the great-grandfather to save me. Looking at this look, his father might not be able to save him. I can only rely on grandpa. It's a pity that for both of them, whether it's Dragon King Long Yao or the Great Elder, they all have a don't-care attitude. Just watching this scene, a farce. Zhang Lin also slowly approached, looking at the little girl who had been jumping in front of Long Yao, he shook his head and sighed helplessly. I've met the Dragon King, I've met the Great Elder. Looking at the two people in the Dragon King's pavilion, Zhang Lin also saluted respectfully. Well, you're here. Dragon King Long Yao glanced at him and nodded slightly. The Great Elder also nodded slightly, pointed to a seat aside, and motioned for Zhang Lin to come and sit down. Zhang Lin was not polite at all and walked straight towards that location. Okay, Xiao Yuer, stop making trouble. This time, Dragon King Long Yao spoke, pulling Xiao Long Yu over who was confronting Long Ji Yu, and finally made them quiet down. The two siblings also made him quite upset. Xiao Long Yu, who was pulled over by him, was still pouting, looking at Long Ji Yu angrily, with deep unhappiness in his eyes. Seeing her fierce look, Long Ji Yu felt helpless, but he had no choice. I found the farthest and safest place to sit down. Then he looked at Zhang Lin and took stock. He looked at Zhang Lin, and Zhang Lin also looked at him. There's nothing surprising about the eighth level of Tianxuan. How did he attract the attention of Saint Qingyan? Long Ji Yu looked at Zhang Lin and thought secretly in his heart. There was some confusion between his brows. What kind of charm did this man rely on to attract Saint Qingyan? That's right, he was talking about Saint Qingyan. When he was crossing the Tianguan Pass, he met Saint Qingyan. A very strong woman. At the ninth level of Tianxuan, his strength is comparable to that of a half-step king, and even slightly better than him in combat power. Very evil. And there was one thing when he came back this time. It was something that Saint Qingyan asked him to help with. It's also about Zhang Lin. He used to think Zhang Lin was so great, but now it seems that it's just that. The eighth level of Tianxuan, average strength. Guer, don't underestimate Mr. Zhang. Oh, Long Ji Yu had a look of surprise on his face when he heard his father remind him. Is it possible that Zhang Lin can be better than him? If you two really fight, you may not be his opponent. Long Yao said with a faint smile. What? Long Ji Yu frowned, a look of shock flashed across his face. Father, what do you mean? Zhang Lin's fighting power is superior to yours. What? How is it possible? Long Ji Yu said with a look of disbelief. Father, are you kidding me? Looking at Zhang Lin again, the look of shock on his face deepened as he nodded slightly towards him. Your father is right, don't underestimate Mr. Zhang. The great elder on the side also looked at Long Ji Yu seriously and said. Brother Zhang, I admire you. With grandpa's confirmation again, Long Ji Yu no longer looked down on Zhang Lin this time, and looked at him with a more serious and cautious look. Zhang Lin smiled slightly and said. No, my strength is not worth mentioning. Seeing this, Long Yao and the Great Elder looked at each other secretly and nodded slightly. Okay, you guys should get to know each other. We two have something to do, so we'll leave first. Long Yao looked at Xiao Long Yu, Long Ji Yu, and Zhang Lin and said with a faint smile. After saying that, Long Yao and the Great Elder disappeared. Only Zhang Lin and the big one and the small one were left, looking at each other. The moment Dragon King Long Yao and the Great Elder disappeared, the little Long Yu who was waiting for him immediately rushed towards Long Ji Yu who was sitting there. Little story, 
sister wants you to look good. After saying that, Xiao Long Yu directly used her fleshy little hands to pat Long Ji Yu. Seeing Xiao Long Yu attacking him, the corners of Long Gu's mouth couldn't help but twitch. Fortunately, Long Ji Yu also ducked out of the way instantly and was not hit by Xiao Long Yu. Seeing that he failed to hit Long Ji Yu, Xiao Long Yu's face showed disappointment. Brother Zhang, you are bullying me with a little excuse. Xiao Long Yu pouted her mouth and looked at Zhang Lin with an unwilling expression. Looking at her expression, Zhang Lin suddenly felt a headache. Look at Long Ji Yu again. But he discovered that Long Gu's eyes were also full of helplessness. He is really helpless towards this sister. Zhang Lin. What is this? Xiao Yu Er, stop making trouble. Come here and be obedient. Zhang Lin looked at Xiao Long Yu and responded to her aggrieved words with a smile. As soon as he finished speaking, Xiao Long Yu, who still looked aggrieved, slowly walked towards him. There is no need to go to Long Ji Yu again. He sat honestly beside Zhang Lin, but the aggrieved look on his face still did not disappear. Long Ji Yu, who was on the side, looked at his sister in disbelief. How long had she been so obedient? But when he came back to his senses, he looked at Zhang Lin with an unkind expression. Brother Zhang, my sister, have you always been so obedient? Although he reluctantly called Long Yu to call his sister, there was nothing he could do. If you don't scream, I'm afraid you will be in real trouble in the future. Ha, huh, Zhang Lin was slightly startled when he heard Long Gu's words, and then glanced at Xiao Long Yu beside him. In the past two years, Xiao Long Yu seemed to listen to him. Okay, Xiao Yu Er, you're very good. Zhang Lin rubbed Xiao Long Yu's head and said with a slight smile. Dragon story. He looked at Zhang Lin with a hint of complexity in his eyes. Do you know Qingyan Saint Xie Qingyao? Suddenly, Long Ji Yu asked. Hearing this, Zhang Lin was slightly startled and looked at Long Ji Yu with some confusion. How could he suddenly ask about Qingyao? We know each other, what's wrong? What happened to her? Zhang Lin's heart tightened and he quickly asked. He thought that Long Ji Yu had also returned from breaking through the Heaven Pass. It's possible that he met Qingyao when he was in the Imperial Domain. No, nothing happened to her, but she is doing extremely well. She asked me to give you something. She asked me to give you something. Long Ji Yu looked at Zhang Lin with a strange look in his eyes. Are you two Taoists? Long Ji Yu asked again, with a hint of gossip on his face. There is no scandal or gossip about Saint Qingyan in the outside world. But now, a man who may have a close relationship with Saint Qingyan suddenly appeared. Maybe, he might be the Taoist companion of Saint Qingyan. Thinking of this, Long Gu's gaze towards Zhang Lin became much hotter, with a hint of excitement and more of a taste of gossip. Zhang Lin was slightly startled when he heard Long Gu's words. A Taoist companion of Saint Qingyan. Zhang Lin lowered his eyebrows in thought. Listening to Zhang Lin's words, Long Ji Yu and Xiao Long Yu looked at him nervously. Waiting for his answer. Not yet, but it will be soon. Zhang Lin shook his head, looked at them and said with a smile. His relationship with Qing Yao can only be said to be that they are not Taoist lovers yet, but he believes that they will be soon. Oh, Long Ji Yu, who had a gossipy face, was slightly disappointed when he heard Zhang Lin's words. It's a pity that it's not. But I heard Zhang Lin say again, it's almost time. Long Gu's expression also became excited. First hand gossip about Qingyan Saint. Brother Zhang, I love sister Qingyao very much. When Xiao Long Yu heard Zhang Lin's words, he also said softly. There was a flash of strange color in his eyes. I heard that Qingyao has something for you to hand over to me. Zhang Lin asked Long Ji Yu expectantly. He was inexplicably excited when he heard that Qingyao asked Long Ji Yu to hand over something to him. I wonder what Qingyao will give him. But it doesn't matter what the thing is, what matters is the person giving it to it. Oh yes, here, everything is inside. Long Ji Yu said, took out a storage ring and handed it to Zhang Lin. Seeing this, Zhang Lin reached out and took it. But he wasn't here just to see what was in the space ring. Thank you, Brother Long Ji Yu. After putting away the space ring, Zhang Lin also thanked Long Ji Yu. Then, Brother Zhang, I'll leave first. My sister, I leave it to you. After seeing Zhang Lin's subordinates, he immediately said. After saying that, he turned around and left. He didn't want to stay here anymore. He was sitting here, 
and his sister, Long Yu, was glaring at him. If Zhang Lin hadn't been here, she would have troubled him long ago. Brother Zhang, I am very disappointed in you. Xiaolong Yu is still sad now. Xiaolong Yu sat next to Zhang Lin, folding his hands on his chest and muttering with a dissatisfied look on his face. What's wrong? Who messed with my little princess? Regarding Xiaolong Yu's appearance, Zhang Lin skillfully reached out and touched her silky hair. Ha! Huh, Xiaolong Yu snorted coldly and didn't say much. Looking at Zhang Lin, Long Yu's eyes flashed with resentment. Hum, I'm not your little princess. I don't want to be a princess, I want to be a queen. Comma, as night falls, it gets cooler. Wulongshan Courtyard. In the room, Zhang Lin carefully inspected the room. Inside the bookcase, inside the wardrobe, under the bed. Zhang Lin carefully checked every place where people could be hidden. Once bitten, twice shy. Last time, he experienced what happened to Xiao Longyu. This time, he had to stand up from wherever he fell. It is inevitable that Xiao Longyu will not be able to see it again. This time, there should be no problem, right? After checking under the bed for the last time, and seeing nothing unusual, he breathed a sigh of relief and murmured. The last time Xiao Longyu hid under his bed, this time, he focused on the underside of the bed. After finally checking the entire room and confirming that there was no one else, Zhang Lin breathed a sigh of relief. Then he took out the space ring that Long Ji Yu gave him today. Looking at this space ring with expectation. As this, just three things. Zhang Lin penetrated the space ring with his spiritual consciousness and looked at the three things inside, a little stunned. There are only three things in it. A projection stone that he was very familiar with. I don't know the other two things. But presumably, it is not extraordinary. Thinking of this, he first took out the projection stone. Don't worry about the other two things. Let him first see Qing Yao, whom he misses the most. After injecting spiritual power into the projection stone, Zhang Lin stared at the projection stone with his eyes. Long time no see, Aaron. Calculating the time, it has been close to two years. I am now in the imperial domain, breaking through the heaven pass, when will you come? She is still wearing the long white dress, still has the same delicate and pretty face, and still has the same indifferent smile. At this time, Qing Yao was standing in front of him, looking at him with a smile. Looking at the mesmerizing face in front of him, Zhang Lin's eyes were filled with the beauty in front of him. Qing Yao, the corners of his mouth raised slightly, Zhang Lin shouted softly. You should have received the projection stone I asked Elder Long to give you before. This time, not only do I have the projection stone, but I also have two other things for you. I hope these two things will be helpful to you. Xie Qingyao's projection was suspended in midair, staring softly in front of him. Zhang Lin also stared closely at the peerless face on the projection stone, and his mind moved with her involuntarily. She is so beautiful, outside the room, why can't you see it? I couldn't hear anything. A petite figure lay on the window, put his ear on the windowsill, and muttered with a depressed look on his face. She was lying here, but she couldn't hear any movement inside. As everyone knows, in order to be wary of Xiao Longyu, Zhang Lin even arranged a soundproof array after ensuring that no one was in the room. Just to prevent Xiao Longyu from listening to the corner. Comma, Imperial Domain, 15 Passes of Tianguan, Mechanical Star. Thank you Qingyao, suffer death, how dare you steal my clan's sacred items. A huge man from the mechanical race, covered in mechanized armor and holding a silver white spear, rushed towards Xie Qingyao with an angry roar. Behind him, there were countless strong men from the mechanical clan chasing after him, intent on killing Xie Qingyao. The divine object of their mechanical clan, the mechanical heavenly fluid, is on Xie Qingyao's body. Snort, you led my human race to breathe the heavenly liquid, you should be punished. Xie Qingyao glanced contemptuously at the group of strong mechanical race men behind him, then lightly clenched his palms, and a long sword exuding cold light suddenly appeared. As soon as the sword was swung out, a bolt of cold current flew out. Ah, a strong man from the mechanical race was split in half in an instant. Kill, Xie Qingyao scolded and rushed out suddenly. The long sword in his hand shook, and suddenly, the endless sword shadow drew an arc in the void, spreading to all directions with endless sword intent. PFF, a piece of powerful mechanical clan was instantly torn into pieces. Xie Qingyao's attack was too fierce, 
not at all the level expected of a strong person in the Tianxuan realm. This kind of strength is simply too abnormal. Palace of Eternal Life. The magnificent hall has thousands of dragon carvings and paintings on the four walls. The giant pillars carved with golden dragons make the palace look like a real dragon soaring into the clouds, full of endless domineering power and nobility. Besides, there was a golden cloud lingering around the entire palace, making it difficult to see the surroundings. In the main hall, all seven core elders of the Tianlong clan gathered together. Even the fifth elder, Long Wu, who has been mining in the small world, also appeared here. Not only that, but the second ancestor also appeared in the Hall of Eternal Life. There are a total of eleven people in the hall. They all stood there with serious expressions. Among them, there are also Zhang Lin and Long Ji Yu. At this moment, Zhang Lin no longer had his usual playful smile, his expression was extremely solemn, and he looked closely at the center of the Hall of Eternal Life. There, he felt the rich and terrifying blood. The pool, which was only a few feet away, was filled with blood-red liquid, and the blood was rolling. Dragon blood, extremely powerful dragon blood essence. Zhang Lin couldn't imagine how much powerful dragon blood essence was contained in this pool. Just being there made him feel oppressed. He glanced at the old man Long Wu beside him. Seeing that he still looked serious, he didn't speak. Wait quietly. Our clan has been preparing for this day for hundreds of thousands of years. The second ancestor looked seriously at the people around him and said solemnly, These dragon blood essences, even the weakest ones, all have the realm of quasi-saints. Shower, are you ready? Looking at the second elder again, the second ancestor spoke slowly. After hearing the words of the second ancestor, the second elder also nodded slightly, and then waved his hand. Inside the Hall of Eternal Life, countless magical medicines, medicine kings, and rare and rare herbs were taken out and piled in the center of the pool. Zhang Lin's eyes were also attracted. He saw a lot of medicinal materials and even some rare spiritual flowers and spiritual fruits. Having read the Dan Jade Pagoda Alchemy book, he recognized most of the magical medicines, but there were some medicinal materials that he had never heard of. I have never seen it in the alchemy book. Suddenly, Zhang Lin's eyes were attracted by one of the magical herbs. Wrong. It should be said that it is a damaged magic medicine. That is, the roots of the elixir of immortality. Zhang Lin's eyes widened instantly and he exclaimed in disbelief. Although the roots of the elixir of immortality are damaged, they are just some roots. But it cannot be underestimated in the slightest. Even if it's just a root, it's still comparable to those magical medicines. You know, the elixir of immortality is something that all the ancient emperors wanted. An immortal medicine can be said to allow the emperor to live a second life. Think of the value. Zhang Lin really didn't expect that they would actually take out a treasure of this level. That's right, it's the roots of the immortality medicine, or the roots of the immortality medicine nine dragon grass. Seeing Zhang Lin recognize the roots of the nine dragon grass, the second elder said happily. Immortality medicine nine dragon grass. Zhang Lin's face showed shock. Of course he knew about nine dragon grass. According to legend, the immortal medicine nine dragon grass was born in the land of the fallen pure blood true dragon. By absorbing the essence and blood of the pure blood true dragon, it eventually became the immortal medicine. Compared with other immortal medicines, nine dragon grass is even more extraordinary. In millions of years, nine dragon grass appeared only once. For today, my clan can be said to have risked everything. I almost emptied my family's fortune. Dragon King Long Yao looked at the dragon blood pool and the countless magical medicines in it. His eyes were full of excitement and excitement. But then he thought that these things had almost emptied the dragon clan's treasure house, and he couldn't help but feel a flash of distress on his face. All is ready except for the opportunity. Everyone focused their attention on Zhang Lin and Long Ji Yu. Go in. The second ancestor looked at the two of them, with a look of relief in his eyes. The two of them can be said to be the pride of their Tianlong clan. Especially Long Ji Yu. He believed that as long as this was completed, Long Ji Yu would be able to break through to the realm of king. Let's go. Zhang Lin and Long Ji Yu looked at each other, nodded, and walked towards the dragon blood pool. In the dragon blood pool, the rich dragon blood was suffocating, filling the air, filling every inch of the air, making it difficult to breathe. There is also a vague sense of rich breath of life. 
These breaths of life are so rich that it even makes people feel lost in it, addicted to it and unable to extricate themselves. Without the slightest hesitation, Zhang and Lin stepped into the dragon blood pool. As soon as they entered, they immediately felt the horror inside. The rich breath of life seemed to be pouring into their bodies crazily. Run the dragon transformation technique taught to you by me. When the second ancestor saw this, he immediately spoke. Zhang Lin and Long Ji Yu also activated the dragon transformation technique and frantically absorbed the dragon's blood in the dragon's blood pool. Ding, you have run the human transformation technique, absorbed the essence and blood of 10,000 dragons and feel that the meaning is still unfinished. Congratulations to the host for understanding the human transformation manual. The complex and mysterious Walong Sutra flashed over and over in Zhang Lin's mind and he was also subconsciously operating the Walong Sutra. In an instant, the dragon essence and blood in the dragon blood pool poured into his body at a terrifying speed. It's not right, why did Zhang Lin absorb it so quickly? Gu Er is obviously much slower. The few people who had been observing the two of them looked into the pool. I also realized something was wrong. Fourth child, come and help me, draw the dragon's blood into my body. If this continues, I'm afraid my old son will fall too far behind. The great elder made a decision instantly and ordered to the fourth elder. If it continues like this, I'm afraid it will be the end. It's probably 73 points. Okay, the fourth elder did not hesitate and began to draw the dragon's blood into Long Gu's body as much as possible. To this, old man Long Wu on the side didn't say anything. Just watched silently, everyone else, start refining the medicine. Seeing that the time was ripe, the second ancestor also spoke. His voice instantly resounded throughout the entire hall. Buzz. Suddenly, everyone started to get busy. They refined all the magical medicine around them into divine liquid and blended it into the dragon's blood pool. At the same time, green flames surged out of the second elder's body. Exuding rich life force, the cyan flame enveloped the magical medicine. Drops of divine liquid dripped from it, dripping towards the dragon's blood pool below, and submerged into the dragon's blood pool. Wisps of magical medicine juice are constantly being absorbed by the dragon blood pool, constantly expanding the color of the water. True dragon pill, go! At the same time, the second elder patted the alchemy cauldron beside him. Immediately, two pills flew out and headed towards Zhang and Lin. Open your mouth! The second elder looked at Zhang and Lin and shouted. After hearing what the second elder said, Zhang Lin and Long Ji Yu quickly followed suit. Opening his mouth, he swallowed it. The true dragon pill was also refined by the second elder using countless precious magical medicines. There are even some roots of the elixir of immortality in it. When Zhang Lin and the others swallowed the true dragon pill, a warm current flowed down their throats and into their stomachs. They felt that the powerful energy in their bodies was surging, as if it was about to burst out at any time. Their bloodline began to undergo transformation at this time. The true dragon pill, the dragon blood pool, and countless magical medicines all came into play at this moment. The power of blood surging within the body is undergoing some kind of change. Boom, the power of blood in their bodies was undergoing some kind of transformation, and a powerful wave swept out of their bodies. Behind them, vaguely, two giant dragons formed. In the blood, there are golden law chains swimming faintly deep in the blood. An inexplicable force also burst out from them. Their bloodline is undergoing some kind of transformation, and their cultivation is improving. The true dragon aura has appeared. The second ancestor stared closely at the two people in the dragon blood pool. They had never left, and it was at this moment that the second ancestor suddenly felt a trace of the true dragon aura from the two of them, which they had never had before. It's the real dragon breath. Second ancestor, are you sure? Long Yao and everyone heard what the second ancestor said. He also instantly turned his head to look at the second ancestor. Yes, this is the breath of a real dragon. The second ancestor nodded affirmatively. The breath of the dragon on them is exactly the same as the breath of a real dragon, but it is weaker. However, it's just the beginning now. It will only get stronger and stronger in the future. Hold on, the second ancestor who had once felt the breath of a real dragon, was extremely sure. The weak aura coming from Zhang Lin and Long Ji Yu now is the aura of a true dragon. There is hope, 
When everyone heard the second ancestor's words, the hope in their hearts burned instantly. The speed of refining the magical medicine more than doubled in an instant. This made a look of fanaticism appear on their faces. This day, their Tianlong clan has been planning for countless thousands of years. Just for today, boom, under the full urging of everyone. The dragon's blood pool in the pool kept boiling. While it was boiling, the dragon's blood also began to disperse in all directions. Keep spreading, but there were three elders behind him who gathered the spread dragon blood into the pool again. Is this a real dragon? In the pool, a shadow of a real dragon suddenly appeared in Zhang Lin's mind, its body shrouded in purple gold light. Looking at the shadow, Zhang Lin murmured to himself. There was also an inexplicable throbbing in his heart. The shadow of the real dragon hovered in Zhang Lin's sea of consciousness, its tail swaying gently. But, the next second, the real dragon's shadow suddenly dispersed. It turned into a rain of light that filled the sky and melted into his sea of consciousness. It seems like there are a lot more things. There seem to be many more things in his sea of consciousness. Huge amounts of information filled his sea of consciousness. The majestic information simply made Zhang Lin frown tightly, and he felt pain, forcing him to hold back and slowly digest the information. What a huge amount of information, it seems like I'm going to have a breakthrough. Boom, a terrifying force burst out from his body, impacting the surroundings. Long Ji Yu, who was beside him, immediately erupted into a burst of terrifying pressure just like he had just done. The true dragon aura on their bodies became more and more powerful. Comma, outside world, around the hall of eternal life. In the clear sky, for some reason, it actually slowly darkened. Wow, dark clouds were rolling in the sky. A layer of dark clouds covered the sky, and thunder and lightning intertwined in the sky, just like the end of the world. On the edge of the dark clouds, silver snakes flashed from time to time, making crackling sounds. Wow, suddenly, a shocking thunderbolt pierced the sky. Streams of thunder fell from the sky, raging crazily in the sky. The entire sky became darker due to the appearance of thunder tribulation. The thunder was deafening. Lines of thunder and lightning continued to swim in the air. Thunder continued to strike around the Eternal Life Palace, and the terrifying thunder attracted the attention of the outside Tianlong clan. What a terrifying thunder disaster! Elder Zhao was lying there outside the Challenge Tower when he suddenly felt the breath of thunder coming from the distance and woke up instantly. He raised his head and looked at the thunder in the sky around the Eternal Life Palace, and his eyes suddenly widened. Who is it? So scary, so depressing. His eyes were full of horror. He had never imagined that there would be such a terrifying thunder disaster in the sky. This is something he has never encountered before. In Elder Zhao's opinion, the thunder disaster in the sky can simply be described as terrifying. Even when he broke through to Quasi-Saint, the thunder tribulation was not as powerful as the current thunder, which gave him such a terrifying sense of oppression. Elder Zhao stood up and looked up at the thunder cloud. Not only Elder Zhao, other elders and disciples also felt the terrifying anomaly in the sky. What's going on? An unsuspecting disciple raised his head and looked at the sky in confusion. Inexplicably, they felt depressed. This kind of depression makes them breathless. Comma. Thunder tribulation. Thunder tribulation is more powerful than the holy tribulation. Inside the hall of eternal life. The movement outside also attracted their attention. Everyone looked at the thunder disaster outside with solemn faces. Protect them both. The thunder calamity is coming for them. The second ancestor looked at the world destroying thunder calamity and revealed the mystery with one word. What? Hearing this, everyone had expressions of disbelief on their faces. Fortunately, they had already made sufficient preparations in their hearts. He was just surprised for a moment, and then continued to condense the divine liquid. No matter what the outside world is doing, they don't care about their affairs. Even if the sky falls, it can't stop them from continuing. From the outside world, there are naturally people helping them. How could they dare to act if they were not fully prepared? Comma, outside world, on the peaks surrounding the Hall of Eternal Life. Four directions, east, west, north and south. There is an old man sitting on the top of the mountain. He was as skinny as firewood, as if he would fall over if the wind blew. At this moment, the four old men all raised their heads and looked at the devastating thunder disasters outside. Thunder tribulation, 
he's finally here. The old voice could not help but resound on the top of the mountain. Isn't this just what was expected, brother? For the sake of those two juniors, today's thunder disaster must be resolved. Otherwise, everything will be in vain. Deceit the heaven formation, rise. The formations that had been prepared around the Hall of Eternal Life were under the control of the four old men. Start instantly. In the air outside the Eternal Life Hall, the dense formations were constantly flowing rapidly. A huge formation slowly took shape, wrapping the Hall of Eternal Life in the center. The Heaven Deceiving Formation is a very special concealment formation. Once it is set up, it can hide the sky from the sky. Of course, the materials needed to set up the formation are also extremely precious. The Deception Formation is activated. The thunder calamity that had been brewing for a long time above the Eternal Life Palace seemed to be unable to find its target. The thunder dragon kept roaring in the calamity cloud, but it was because of the deceiving formation. Running around without a target. The thunder tribulation did not disappear. Instead, it seemed as if the target disappeared and it became angry. Endless thunder began to fall from it. Thunderbolts, like thunderstorms, poured down around the eternal life palace. Comma. It's a pity, there is something missing in heaven and earth. It's hard for a real dragon to exist. The second ancestor looked at the two people wrapped in blood cocoons in the dragon blood pool and sighed inexplicably. Yes, but the golden age is coming, and the road to immortality seems to have begun in this life. After all, there is still hope. Long Yao also nodded and said with emotion. Thunder tribulation, the movement has become much quieter. It seems to be dispersing. Feeling that the thunder calamity outside gradually calmed down, everyone could not help but breathe a sigh of relief. The thunderstorm lasted for a while, and their hearts were always in their throats. Extremely nervous. Let's finish it quickly. Let me wait and see the result of this countless efforts. Everyone looked at the two blood cocoons in the dragon blood pool with burning eyes. Comma. The bloodline is transforming, and deep in the blood, golden chains of law are being born. The true dragon, the legendary true dragon, becomes the immortal king when he reaches adulthood, becoming the real great supernatural power and the king of immortals. It is a pity that the heaven and earth are lacking and the laws are incomplete, so it is impossible to become an immortal. The emperor is the limit. The dragon blood in the dragon blood pool continues to decrease at a speed visible to the naked eye. I don't know when the blood cocoon gradually turned golden, giving it a slightly sacred feeling. The thunder tribulation is over. The second ancestor was keenly aware that all the thunder tribulation outside had disappeared. Heaven and earth were also restored. It's all gone. It will take some time for the dragon cocoon to be completely broken. Just leave two people here to watch. An old man's vicissitudes of voice sounded in the hall of eternal life. Yes, I will obey my ancestors' orders. Everyone responded respectfully. Since eldest brother has said so, I will leave. You must not let any accidents happen here. The second ancestor looked at Long Yao and the others, stroking his beard and warned them seriously. When Long Yao and others heard this, they bowed slightly and said, yes. Yes, the second ancestor nodded. The figure flashed and disappeared from the place in an instant. Okay, fourth child, sixth child. You two stay here to guard these two boys. The great elder looked at the fourth elder and the sixth elder, thought for a moment, and then ordered. He still believed in both of them very much. Moreover, the two of them were the most idle. Several other people have to deal with matters within the clan, which is a bit troublesome. On the side, old man Long Wu, the fifth elder, also looked at the first elder expectantly. Seems to want something. The great elder also felt the eager gaze of Lao Wu, but he still hesitated. Lao Wu, you, forget it, you should go mining. In the end, the great elder shook his head helplessly. Why, after hearing this, old man Long Wu sighed helplessly. After all, the wrong payment was made. Okay, let's all go. No one is allowed to approach within a 50-mile radius of the Eternal Life Palace. The great elder waved his hand. Yes, everyone responded in unison, and then left one after another, each performing their duties. The fourth elder and the sixth elder stayed in the Eternal Life Palace, guarding these two dragon cocoons. Comma. Spring goes and autumn comes. Time passes. The time in the Hall of Eternal Life is also changing quietly. The time was much longer than they imagined. 
they thought it would only take a few months to complete. But, in fact, two years have passed. That is on this day. A crisp sound suddenly sounded in the Hall of Eternal Life. Click. The sound was crisp and clear, which seemed particularly harsh in the empty hall. The fourth elder and the sixth elder were both shocked and stood up quickly, looking towards the dragon blood pool. Soon, they discovered the source of the sound. I saw. A crack appeared faintly on the dragon cocoon belonging to Long Ji Yu. Under the gaze of the two people, there were more and more cracks on the dragon cocoon. In less than a moment, the cracks were all over the entire dragon cocoon. As the cracks became larger and larger, the entire dragon cocoon was trembling violently. Quick, tell Big Brother and the others. Let them come quickly. The fourth elder stared at the dragon cocoon and urged the sixth elder. The sixth elder also hurriedly used the messenger jade pendant to tell the elder brother and elder. The two of them just stared at the dragon cocoon. Sure enough, it didn't take long. Boom, finally, the entire dragon cocoon collapsed into debris in an instant. Inside, there was golden light rising into the sky. A dragon-shaped shadow also emerged in the golden light. It's done. The sixth elder's eyes showed joy. Succeeded. The great elder who had just arrived at the Eternal Life Palace happened to look at the scene in front of him and was immediately excited. After two years, the results are finally out. Many elders gradually appeared in the Hall of Eternal Life at this time. All eyes were looking at the broken dragon cocoon. Second level of the king's realm. The great elder was slightly surprised when he felt Long Gu's cultivation at this time. In the dragon blood pool, Long Ji Yu stood up slowly and slowly opened his eyes. Is this the second level of the king realm? Long Ji Yu looked at his palms, feeling the surging power in his body, and his eyes were full of excitement. And this power is so powerful. The transformation of his bloodline gave him great strength. Not only that, but at the same time, he also has many dragon clan inherited techniques in his mind. Father, everyone, Long Ji Yu looked at everyone in the Hall of Eternal Life and said respectfully. Okay, okay, you have finally been promoted to the second level of the King Realm. Long Gu's father, Long Yao, was full of joy. Yes, but it's a pity that the bloodline has not completely transformed after all. There is a shortage of heaven and earth, and there is no room for true dragons. Feeling that Long Gu's bloodline had not completely transformed into a pure-blooded true dragon, the great elder felt a little regretful. Another thunder tribulation appears. In the outside world, after two years, another calamity cloud appeared over the Eternal Life Palace. However, compared with two years ago, the power of the calamity cloud that appeared this time was much weaker than before. Boom, buzz buzz. Dark clouds are rolling in the sky, electric snakes are crisscrossing, and the terrifying power of thunder is also brewing. King's Tribulation The King's Calamity from Long Ji Yu When a practitioner's cultivation reaches the realm of kings, it will trigger a catastrophe of heaven and earth. It is also the first great catastrophe of heaven and earth in practice. Father, grandfathers, young man, I'm going to go through the tribulation first. Long Ji Yu glanced around then bowed his hands to them. Go, go, you must be careful this time. The great elder nodded and urged. Kindness, Long Ji Yu once again bowed his hands to express his gratitude, and then his body shot directly towards the distance. The king's calamity, in his opinion, it is not difficult. Especially when he has the half-finished true dragon bloodline, and now he has reached the second level of the king. Overcoming the tribulation is easy. Unfortunately, he underestimated. Guer can break through to the second level of the king realm, which is already very good. I won't say that I am invincible, but I won't be far behind. The great elder stroked his beard and nodded in praise. Yes, within the same realm, those who can defeat Guer can be counted with one hand. Half true dragon bloodline. The second elder also nodded appreciatively. Yes, if one can awaken perfectly, Guer's achievements will definitely be unmatched. It's a pity the great elder said with somewhat sad eyes. Why, everyone couldn't help but sigh. Since Guer has woken up, then, Mr. Zhang. The second elder turned his attention to the dragon cocoon that had not moved at all in the dragon blood pool. There was still no movement in Zhang Lin's dragon cocoon, where it was swallowing the spiritual energy around it. Boy Zhang, whether it's dragon blood or divine liquid, he has absorbed much more than Guer. Perhaps, 
he can give us a surprise. The great elder also looked at Zhang Lin's dragon cocoon, his eyes flickering. His potential is very strong. At this time, I'm afraid there really aren't many geniuses who can compare to Boy Guo Zhang. Comma. Long Gu's king's calamity has passed two months. The dragon cocoon where Zhang Lin was still lay in the dragon blood pool. The fourth elder and the sixth elder still stayed in the palace of eternal life, guarding Zhang Lin. And Long Ji Yu also returned to the imperial domain not long after surviving the king's tribulation, intending to continue to conquer the sky. Feel it. Boy Yang's absorption of spiritual energy has become faster. The sixth elder raised his head and looked in Zhang Lin's direction with confusion. He keenly felt that the spiritual energy between heaven and earth was pouring into Zhang Lin's body crazily. Are you about to revive? The fourth elder's eyes narrowed slightly. Ding, congratulations to the host for obtaining the pure blood of the true dragon. Because there is a lack in the world, 30% of the true dragon's blood is sealed. Inside the dragon cocoon, Zhang Lin's eyes moved slightly while he was sleeping, showing signs of waking up. The voice of the system suddenly sounded in his mind. The sound of the system woke Zhang Lin up and opened his eyes. The golden dragon cocoon is also like the day when Long Ji Yu awakened. However, the movement was much louder than Long Gu's movement. There is a gathering of auspicious energy between heaven and earth, and the auspicious scene of dragon and phoenix appears. The sound of all beasts chirping resounded in the sky, and the auspicious aura also gathered towards the dragon blood pond, forming a huge colorful vortex around the river and forest. This, what happened, the visions of heaven and earth also attracted the attention of many people. As this, Mr. Zhang is about to wake up. The elder looked up at the vision between heaven and earth, with some vague guesses in his heart. Boom, buzz, between heaven and earth, the light of the rainbow rises into the sky. Wow, a huge golden dragon also appeared in the sky above the eternal life palace, roaring upwards, shaking the sky. And Zhang Lin's dragon cocoon slowly emitted golden light, and runes also flickered on the dragon cocoon. The golden shadow of the true dragon was also constantly circling and flying. Finally, it got directly into the dragon's blood pool and disappeared from everyone's sight. Aha! Boom! A burst of violent fluctuations resounded, and the golden dragon cocoon also exploded. Click! A terrifying coercion spread out from the dragon blood pool. Everyone present, including the first elder, second elder and others, felt as if they were hit by a mountain. This is the pressure from the bloodline, and it is also a kind of original crushing. Really, little Yang's bloodline power is probably 70% pure blood. Feeling the trembling feeling coming from the bloodline deep in his heart, the second elder also exclaimed. Such a bloodline, even if we look at the entire world, is definitely a top existence. King's Realm, Second Level. The cultivation level is the same as that of Guer, but in terms of strength. Guer will never be Yang's opponent. The second elder also shook his head with certainty. Zhang Lin's ability in leapfrog combat is really terrifying. In the same realm, even they are not sure they can beat Zhang Lin. For example, Elder Zhao before. Elder Zhao used the King character puppet and raised his level to the peak of the Tianxuan realm, but he still failed to defeat Zhang Lin, who was at the eighth level of the Tianxuan realm. One can imagine how strong Zhang Lin's leapfrog strength is. I'm afraid, Mr. Zhang, is planning to break into the Heaven Pass next time. After all, there are still people in the Imperial Domain in Tianguan that Mr. Zhang misses. The second elder looked at everyone and said with a smile. They all knew about Zhang Lin's affairs. The saint of Qingyun Holy Land is unparalleled in strength. Mr. Zhang is indeed lucky. No, this can no longer be said to be luck. Good, let's see, Mr. Zhang is about to wake up. Comma, Zhang Lin stood there, his clothes in pieces. At this time, his whole body was filled with the rich aura of dragon blood. Around him, there was a golden shadow of a real dragon surrounding him. On his body, at this moment, the nine true dragon patterns were completely complete. Nine true dragon patterns. This also means that Zhang Lin's physical strength at this moment is comparable to that of a pure-blooded true dragon. Even if he has 30% of his pure blood sealed away, his physical strength has definitely reached its limit, which is terrifying. The second level of the king's realm. Zhang Lin narrowed his eyes slightly. He can clearly sense that his physical strength is one of the best even in the realm of kings. 
This is the horror of the pure blood true dragon bloodline. Is my king's tribulation coming too? As if feeling something in his heart, Zhang Lin felt an inexplicable throbbing outside. Go ahead. Go and overcome your king's calamity. Everyone also looked outside. They also felt the calamity cloud that was beginning to gather. The first elder and the second elder looked at each other with expectation in their eyes. Boom. The visions of heaven and earth are getting more and more intense. Boom. The calamity clouds between heaven and earth are constantly changing, and streaks of lightning pierce the sky and shine in the hall of eternal life. I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.